Kermit Washington. I mean, Kermit Washington. Kermit Washington is the brand new Galaxy Opal in the vault. 91 offense, 99 defense, 6 foot 8 with a 7 3 wingspan. Finishing badges, pretty good on current gen and next gen. Shooting badges, nothing special, but you can give them range extender, which is a pretty big deal, and flexible, which is pretty big on current gen. You also got downhill, quick first step, and you got a lot of defensive badges on Kermit current gen and next gen. I almost said Kermit gen. On next gen, more of the same. Posterizer, Pro Touch, Acrobat, everything you need. He's looking pretty good on current gen and next gen. Has a few extra Hall of Fames on next gen, but you guys get the picture? I don't need to show you guys this much longer. If you want to take a look at this though, you can find it in the description as we go for Kermit Washington. What's good everybody, it's CP the Doc. And let's get this stream started. Yesterday we made it from 796 wins all the way up to 900. We didn't get Don Ol, so hopefully we have some better luck today going for Kermit Washington. Without any further ado, let's get right to it. This is a lineup we used yesterday. We won like 104 games in less than 6 hours, so yeah, we were going crazy yesterday. Let's get this stream started and let's hope that the 2K gods, let's hope that luck is on our side today. What's up, Cade? Harky Pig? No Limit DS? Keaton? Chase? Javen Malone? Mr. Raymer, La Felipe, Chad, Eli. We got 77 people in the stream early. Hope all you guys are chilling, enjoying your days so far. This is gonna be a good stream. I'm planning on it, I'm planning on this being a long stream too, because even if we get Kermit super early in the stream, I still want to hit a thousand wins. And there's no guarantee that we get Kermit Washington either, because I mean the vault reward odds are so bad sometimes, so. We gotta hope for the best. What's up, Dragon Fire? A Doge, Casey Pepo, Amit, Colin, the new Mellow, Dragon Fire, ZYT, Yosapat, Hector, Ashton. Feels good to be live once again, man. This is our third stream in three days, and this is our ninth stream in ten days, if I'm not mistaken. So we've been grinding. And this stream is another one on the list. What's up, who is Jay? What's up, Joseph? I'm at Horrent. What's up, Le Legend Gaming? Legend Gaming said, let's get it, Doc. Hey, Legend, I had to give you that mod, man. You're moving up the ranks in hours. And yeah, I think everyone knows how much you contribute to the channel. So big shout out to Legend Gaming, one of my new moderators. RJL said Kermit the Killer. Yeah, he almost killed Rudy T on the court. Hey, Rudy T said it's okay though. What's up, Zachary Daly? Love your videos. I appreciate you, Zach. What's up, F9 Flame? Welcome to the stream. What's up, Black Caillou? Tally Johnson. Francisco said, Yo, CP, I'm back from yesterday. Hey, welcome back. It's good to have you back. This is gonna be another long stream today, so sit back, relax, and I hope you enjoy it. What's up, Mikey Expert? What's good, Joker? Chad said, I got food poisoning. So I'm glad you have a stream right now to- hey, hey, I'm glad I can help you out, man, for sure. How do you get food poisoning, though? That sucks, but... Nah, sit back, relax, and enjoy it, just like I'm saying to everybody else. I'm here for you to watch. Jasfon said I'm back. Welcome back, Jasfon. Xavian said, how's your day going? Very good so far. Hope it's been a good day for you, too. I have class in 26 minutes, and sadly, it is not cancelled. Yesterday, I had class at 5 p.m. I joined the class just to figure out it was canceled, so today, not the same luck, but you know what? It's still okay because you guys know I don't really pay attention anyway. I joined the class, I mute myself, and yeah, we go from there. So let's just play today. Let's get a lot of wins. Let's see if we can get the new card, and if not, we're not going to end the stream until we get a thousand wins. Dallas said, yo, what's up, man? What's good, Dallas? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, my boy, Bobovin McNabb? What's good, Nick Wright? Welcome to the stream, all you guys. Hey, Bobovin, I just saw you in SB's stream. I hate that he had to end, but I'm glad I could drop by for a little while. K 
Can we get this man first game of the stream? We're not going to, but that would be epic. Xavian said which curry is the best. In my opinion, the season one pink diamond curry is the best. I mean, honestly, the new curry is so similar to this one, and I've been using this curry since season one. I really like this curry card, and the new one, just not worth it in my opinion. What's good, Matthew Daly? Left Felipe. Owen said, and what year spotlight challenges is the one with 50 point triple threat? I mean, every single spotlight challenge after the first four has 50 point triple threat games. Price Spooky said, what's good, Doc? What's up, Spooky? Welcome back. How am I doing? I'm doing great. Hope you're doing great too, Cry Spooky. Cyan said, try not to rage like Myers Leonard during the stream. I like Myers Leonard, so I'm kind of disappointed in him, but still a fan. I wish he hadn't said what he said, though, but you live and you learn. Nick Wright said the update took so long for 2K. If I'm not mistaken, it was a current gen update. I could be wrong, but wasn't that just a current gen update? Because I, lo I logged in on 2K this morning, and there wasn't anything for me to download. But I heard it was a super big up update, like 30 gigs? I could be wrong, but I think someone said it was 30 gigs. Ryan said, Mr. Goat himself, glad you're live. Hey, welcome to the stream, Ryan. I saw you were live earlier too, but of course I had class, I had shit to do, went to the gym, and I was gonna start the stream earlier, but nope. I was in the Chick-fil-A line for like, I wanna say like 25, 30 minutes. It was rough, man. I haven't had much time today, but we have time right now. We're streaming right now, and hey, let's see if we can have some good luck today, like I said earlier. Let's see if the 2K gods bless us and give us this new Kermit card. What's up, Aiden Lydell? What's up, No Limit Jacob? Cry Spooky said, I'm doing good. Grinding for watch hours and subs. Yes, sir. Hey, man, that grind was tough for me. That grind was tough. It took me over a year to get to 1,000 subs, but I wouldn't say it's been smooth sailing ever since, but it gets a lot easier after you hit the big 1,000 sometimes. Once you get a good community, once you get things rolling, it gets to, be, gets to be a lot of fun. Can't really talk right now for some reason. You get what I mean. Hopefully. Silas said, CP the doc. What's good, Silas? Welcome to the stream. Shea said, got Kermit in 11 games. Jean Kerr said, how do you get the new card? You get him out the vault. That's how you get him. Win some games and hope that he's inside. Ashlyn says, hopefully you get Kermit. Yeah, hopefully, because we didn't get Don Ole yesterday. We're not, I mean, we're going to get Don Ole back in the vault eventually, but not till the end of the season. But, I mean, it's not a big deal. Let's grind for this man Kermit and see if we get him. We played 100 games yesterday, didn't get Don Ole, so hopefully we can play 100 more and get the new card. Ryan said only 25, 30 minutes for Chick-fil-A. Nah, I wasn't moving. It was taking forever. I was going to start this stream at, like, I think... Four, but nope. Had to start at 4.30 instead because the line was tripping. Either way, we're going to get done at a pretty good time, I think. And like I said earlier, whether we get the new card or not, this is going to be, I'm thinking, a six or so hour long stream because, I mean, I want to get a thousand wins. So if we don't get Kermit, we will get Peja. I'm never going to use Peja, but I guess that will be another opal for the collection if we do get him. What's good, Navin? Welcome to the stream. Dallas says, I'm working late today, so I can't get Kermit until about 9. That's tough, but he's going to be available for a long time, so just because you can't get him right off the bat doesn't mean that's too bad of a thing. He's going to be around for a long time. What's up, Don't Doubt Tay? What's up, Tristan? Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. Septic says, just watched the Myers Leonard video. They said Adam Silver is Jewish, and that may have been him. Really? So... Adam Silver. It may have been him instead of Myers Leonard. That sentence made no sense. That was pretty clearly Myers Leonard that said what he said. Legendary said, hey, what's good, Doc? What's up, Legendary? Welcome to the stream. Ryan said, six or seven hours. How far are you from Peja? A hundred games. So a hundred games should take a little less than six hours. I'm thinking. And if we do get to a hundred more games played today before we get Peja... Or before we get the new Opal. I'll play a few more afterwards, just to test the waters, and see what we get. Kabir says you're so close to Peja too. Yeah man, like I said, if we don't get the new Opal, we will get Peja, and 
we're gonna go for the new opal other days too if we don't get them today what's good marcus springfield welcome to the stream also what's up peyton scaff jurassic Pooh said i hope i'm here to witness 10,000 subs we're not gonna hit 10,000 subs today now there's no way we get 10,000 subs today but as you guys see below my face cam the sub goal for today is what 9,300 i'm pretty sure and we are getting pretty close to there we gained a lot of new subs yesterday and i'm thinking that today we could gain a lot of new subs too so if there are any new subs watching the stream feel free to talk to me let me know how you're doing sit back enjoy the vibes enjoy the grind because this is going to be a long stream today what's up three two one what's up death row death row says is the vault reward good the vault reward looks very very good Legendary said, what are your thoughts on Donovan Mitchell? I like him a lot. I like that new Donovan Mitchell a lot. A lot of guys are saying he's better than John Wall. I don't agree with that. But, nah, he's still super explosive. Nice shooter. A bit of a liability on defense, though. That's the biggest thing about cards like Donovan, who are 6'1". Even though they're super athletic, even though they can shoot well, even if they have good defensive ratings and badges, at the end of the day, if you're like 6'1", 6 feet... 5'11", you know, you're going to be a bit of a liability on defense, especially versus bigger point guards like Luka, Magic, versus wing players like the new Giannis card. You're going to be a bit of a liability, so Donovan Mitchell, without a doubt, a bit of a defensive liability, but, I mean, still very usable, still very fun. YBZ said, yo, Doc, what's good, YBZ? Welcome to the stream. Ryan says we have 112 people in here with only 50 likes. Yeah, Ryan, there's something wrong with that. If you guys listen to Ryan, make sure to like the stream if you haven't already. I hadn't said it yet. This is my first time saying it today, so you guys make sure to do that if you haven't already because, yeah, come on. We have over 100 people, 50 likes. You guys step it up, hit that like button for me if you haven't already. Hitting the like button really does help, man. Helps the stream get out there. Helps more people see the stream and you never know. More people seeing the stream may just lead to more subs, so you never know. Every single like helps grow the channel. Every single person in here helps grow the channel, so let's keep on grinding, and let's go for this new vault reward. That is our third game down already. I don't know how many games it's going to take for this new Kermit Washington, but we'll have to see. What's up, NFL young kid? What's up, CKB? What's good, Rex boy? Welcome to the stream, all you guys. Javen said, I think for how much time you spend on John Wall, he's not as worth it because Mitchell only takes half an hour, but that doesn't mean Donovan's better. I agree, Javen. I agree. John Wall is definitely the better player. I'll take John Wall over Donovan, but in terms of value, in terms of opportunity cost, like Donovan Mitchell, he's not as good defensively, not as good of a shooter and stuff. He's like a slight tactical downgrade from John Wall, but still, it takes 30 minutes to get him, so... Especially if you're a budget player, go for that Donovan Mitchell. He's 100% worth it, especially since it only takes, yeah, like 30 minutes, like you said. That's nothing in 2K. Takes over 30 hours for John Wall, takes 30 minutes for Donovan Mitchell. 100% worth it. I couldn't agree more. Bullyball NYK said, yo, CP. I just opened Flash Super Packs and got Marcus Saul and Juan and got Pink Diamond Ricky Rubio. Nice! You know, I saw some gameplay on Ricky Rubio and he doesn't look that bad, but the thing is, we have so many good point guards in the game. We just got a John Wall Galaxy Opal point guard. We just got Donovan Mitchell. We also got D'Angelo Russell. Not to mention cards like, you know, Hero, Gilbert Arenas, Hero, Patrick Beverly. They aren't very good, but like, you guys get the point? We've gotten a lot of point guards this season. So, that Ricky Rubio, he looks nice, but we also got the Juan Carlos Navarro. We're getting a lot of point guards, which isn't a bad thing, but I don't know. Even though Ricky Rubio is nice, I feel like he gets kind of lost in the fold just because we've gotten so many good PGs this season. Wrecked Boy says I have possessed Donovan Mitchell. He was good for a little while. He was pretty good. Him and possessed Jimmy Butler. Isaiah said Kermit's a school threat. 
He did hit Rudy Tomjanovich pretty hard, but I mean, hey, no need to talk about that. Let's just talk about how good he is on defense. Anthony said, yo, CP, I'm back today. Sorry for being a little bit late. It's been 15 minutes, but welcome to the stream. I wouldn't call 15 minutes late because this stream is going to be like six hours. I would definitely not call 15 minutes late. Welcome to the stream, though, Anthony. Oh, that's bad defense. Very early release, though. These CPUs are tweaking. Crazy Shot said, hi, Doctor, you got Don. No, I didn't. Good shot. D'Lo said, CP was good, my guy. Watching ads right now, I'll be there soon. So I wonder if you're even going to hear what I'm saying right now. But yeah, enjoy the ads and feel free to skip them because those ads can be long. They can be kind of annoying. Um, yeah, feel free to skip ads, guys, especially the ones that are super long. I mean, I made them skippable for a reason. Kevin Brockney said, yo, Doc, right when I got home from school, I hopped on 2K and got Kermit in my first game. I think you're like the 10th person to say that, so good for you. Good for everybody who's gotten Kermit in their first game. I think about 10, 15 guys have said that in the chat, so very good for y'all. LeBron Jordan fan said, yo, CP, what's good? What's up, LeBron Jordan fan? Welcome to the stream. 123 people in here. Hope all you guys are enjoying your days today. We're off to a good start. We've won four games in about, what, 15 minutes? Not a bad pace, but let's see if we can go at the same pace we did yesterday. Yesterday, we won like 104 games in less than six hours. Well, a little bit over six hours, but you guys get the point. We won like 100 games in less than six hours. You guys get the picture, so let's see if we can go at that same pace today. What's up, Coop? Welcome to the stream. Tragsag said the vault reward isn't even that good. Why? Because he doesn't have range extender? I mean, have you seen his badges? Have you seen the SIGs? He's definitely good. Yeah, I don't know why people aren't saying that he's good. And I don't get why people are saying that David Robinson's not good. Three-point shot's not everything. Just because he has an 83-3 doesn't mean he's a bad player. He literally has everything else. Lucid said, yo, Doc, what's good? What's up, Lucid? Welcome back. Gotta green that shot. Rex Boy said, just opened a flash pack and got Glenn Davis. Nice. I don't think he's going for that much, but still, nice. B Jaggy Mix said, what up, Doc? What's good, B Jaggy? Welcome back. LeBron Jordan fan said, is Spencer Haywood good? Eh, I don't think so. He has so many cold zones. I don't know why, but yeah. I'd say that he's not very good. Not really worth it. I'd say Fred Brown's a lot better. What's good, Nicholas? Welcome to the stream. Good shot, Curry. Travis Scott said, what up, Doc? What's good, Travis Scott? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, ISO Mentality? What's up, Leonard? Yosapat said, David Robinson's a dub? Oh, definitely. Without a doubt. Best Opal in the game for sure. So... He's going to be available either tomorrow or Friday, without a doubt. That David Robinson's going to be a beast. So many guys are upset that he doesn't have Hall of Fame range, but he still has 35 Hall of Fame badges and gold range. So, nah, David Robinson's looking like a beast. Definitely the best Opal in the game. No doubt about that. What's up, Tony? What's up, Carter? What's good, Miguel? Welcome to the stream. Dev Brazy, good to have you in the building. Yeah, we got 140 people in here. Y'all talk to me in the chat if you haven't already. And yeah, just sit back, relax, enjoy today's stream. It's going to be a long one today. So if you don't have anything to do, I got you. Rex Boy said, where's Donovan? He plays for the Jazz. That's a Utah basketball team. Tay said, I was playing AAU, hurt my knee. They didn't tell me the name for my injury, but I should be back playing in the next week. That's good. I hope your knee gets better, so yeah, rest up, recover, and get ready for next week. What's good, Jaden? Welcome to the stream. Graphy Crisis said, had to drop in before work. What's good, Doc? Hey, just chilling, man, chilling. I got class in 10 minutes, but we're grinding right now. 
And I'm gonna be grinding for this new Galaxy Opal during class, too. 10 minutes, so hopefully I don't forget and join the class late. I gotta make sure I mute myself and turn down the volume for class so you don't hear it and so my professor doesn't hear me. Mellow Underrated said they updated Spencer, but Kermit still looks better. Yeah, I agree. Nah, Kermit definitely looks like a better player. If you want a good lockdown defensive small forward who can cover a lot of ground, shoot if you give him range, and you know, go off the dribble fast with Hall of Fame quick first step, get to the rim and dunk on somebody, that Kermit's gonna be a beast. What's good, Nathaniel? What's up, Goat Larry? Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. Leafs fan said Hall of Fame range ain't everything. Yeah, facts. For centers, gold range is good enough. I mean, unless you plan on dribbling in circles with David Robinson, you should be fine. Janice said, yo, Doc. I don't think you saw me in the chat. Yeah, I did. I said hi to you, but welcome to the stream once again. Retro pack again. Retro volume two this time, though. Yesterday, we got like five or six retro packs. And yeah, we're starting off this stream with the retro pack too. Sean said, yo, what up? It's me, LeBron James. I'm on my second account. What's good, LeBron? Or Sean, welcome to the stream. Oh, nice block by Haslam. Leafs fan said, I like Sidney Wicks a lot. It's going to be hard to replace him. Sidney Wicks is pretty good. Long wingspan. And if you give him range, he's a beast. Badges on the auction house. They're cheaper than ever right now, so... Getting range and giving it to Sidney Wicks shouldn't be that hard. Shouldn't be that hard for Kermit either if you pick him up. I can't believe this guy's name is Kermit. I love saying it. Drake said, what's up doc, how you been doing? I'm good. How have you been doing, Drake? Good to have you in the stream, Drake. Anthony says, I clicked on stream today with my broken finger. Nice. I hope it's getting better every day. Mello said Kermit has Dante Exum's base. Facts, facts, and that's a big deal. His jump shot's nice, but of course giving him a range extender is a pretty big deal. Isa Gaming said, what's up, CP the go? What's good, Isa? Welcome to the stream. Owen said, who's better, Kermit or Spencer? Uh, definitely Kermit. Definitely Kermit. Of course, I know you guys saw earlier how Spencer had all those cold zones. 2K fixed that, but I mean, even changing all those to hot zones, I'd say that Kermit's the better player. I mean... If you've seen the defensive badges, you know how much of a beast Kermit's going to be. Not to mention the Hall of Fame downhill, quick first step. And of course he doesn't have range, which kind of sucks, but like we've been saying, you can give it to him. Septic said, yo doc, do you have Don? If so, use him for maybe one game. He has splash release and is like Curry. I have Don for Mitchell, but I'd rather use Curry. I mean, we get through the game so fast with Curry, so if it ain't broke, don't fix it. All you need is one good shooter in triple threat offline. Just snatch back over and over again and try to green it every time. I know I didn't green that one, but trust me, we're not going to miss very much of the rest of this game. What's good, Josiah? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up? I'm Volatile. Welcome back. Yeah, we didn't green the last one, so we had to get it back right there. Shay said, do I sell Hero Jordan? That's your decision. 100% your decision. If you want MT, go and sell him. Hero Jordan's good, but you can get some other players to round out your roster too. What's good, Eric Mantle? What's up, Dominic? Eclipse? A Bay? Got so many guys joining the stream, so if I miss your chats, don't get too mad at me. Just send them again, and I'll try not to miss them. The weird one said yesterday I sprained my left hand ring finger. That's tough. Keep on recovering, man. I've seen like four or five guys with injuries in the chat, so you guys rest up and get better. Y'all rest up. Don't play too much 2K either, man, because you don't want to hurt your other fingers too. I'm Volatile said, wish me luck on the Ascension board. Hey, good luck to you. Good luck to you. I hope you get something good. I also hope you get Adrian Dantley, but I've heard he's not very good. Rex Boy said, where do you get Donovan Mitchell? Go to season agendas. I mean, Donovan Mitchell came out on Monday. I thought everyone knew about Donovan Mitchell. All right. That's like six games down in less than 30 minutes. Nothing yet except for a retro pack and a token. Eiffel Love said, 
told you Don O wouldn't be there. Yeah, you told me well. Welcome to the stream, Eiffel Love. Good to have you back. Yeah, man. Nothing yet, but you never want to expect to get the big reward after like three or four games. So I'm expecting this to be a long grind. And yeah, even if we don't get the new Galaxy Opal, we're still going to get Peja. So we're at least going to get one Opal today. Today, we're getting at least one Galaxy Opal. If we get two, though, that would be epic. What's good? Hi, hi. Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Jake King? What's up, Zalin? Sean said, how's your day going? Pretty well so far. Pretty good so far. Woke up, went to class, got in the gym, got some homework done, and I actually have another class in five minutes, so I gotta make sure to join that Zoom class, but we're not gonna end the stream. Like I said earlier, this is gonna be a long stream, so just because we have class doesn't mean we're gonna end things. La Legend says, I wish Peja was a little bit better. Yeah, man, Peja's not bad, but I used him on another account and I just wasn't a big fan. Bryant said, CP the Doc, what's up? What's good, Bryant? Welcome back to the stream. George Pig said, I'm using Pink Diamond Ray Allen and two bronzes. Like I said, man, that's a great, that's a great strategy. Use one really good shooter who can create a lot of space and two bronzes because if you use two bronzes, you get really easy matchups. Notice how we're playing versus Silver Mo Bamba. We're playing versus Gold Carmelo. Their one really good player is Colin Sexton and even Colin Sexton's Pink Diamond can't really guard Curry. Okay, that was a terrible shot. I did not mean to shoot that. But yeah, we have takeover with Curry, so we're probably not gonna miss the rest of the game. So if you can get in a rhythm with that one player, if you can create space, and if you can just pull up from half court like this, there's really nothing the defense can do. So if you guys want those fast triple threat offline wins, I think that's the best strategy. Defense doesn't even really matter. Go for the steals, go for some, some blocks, but even if you don't get them, you'll get the ball back fast. And we're gonna give the ball back to Curry, run to half court, and yeah, you guys get the picture. What's up, Baylor23? What's up, my boy, Sherrod? Welcome to the stream. Luan said, I just got Brandon Roy, and are there any triple threat games in the John Wall challenges? Um, in the challenges for John Wall, there is one triple threat game. I can't remember which game it is. I think it's game number two or three. It's a triple threat game. Game to 50. The rest of the games, though, are games to, you know, five minute quarters, and you have to do challenges along the way. There's one triple threat game, and the rest are five minute quarters. Welcome back, La Felipe. What's up, Jacob Toledo? Welcome to the stream. That's now seven games in the books. We missed a couple shots that game, but we're still on a good pace. Let's keep on grinding, keep on moving forward, and yeah, you guys know the big goal is Kermit Washington, but we're also going for a thousand wins. Sean said, CP, do you hate the Celtics? I really don't hate any team in the NBA. Gabe Ortiz said, what's up, CP? What's good, Gabe? Welcome back. Gabe says, I can't beat the Hall of Fame games, man. If you're on current gen, I feel you, man. On current gen, those games are tough. On next gen, they're incredibly easy, though. Keep on grinding is all I got to say. And real quick, let me go ahead and join my online class. So, yeah, you guys give me one second. I might take a couple possessions off on defense just so I can join my online class. And look at this. They're really not doing anything on offense either, so... Yeah, I'm just going to sit here and join my online class. And yeah, now we're going to keep on grinding. Dominic says, I have homework to do. Boring. Homework is boring, man, but you got to get it done. Get that homework done. And I promise you, once you get your homework done, I'm still going to be live. I can guarantee you that. Wait a second. What the heck, man? What the heck? Earlier, I pulled up my Zoom class. And it said we had class today at 5 p.m. But you guys can guess it. My class got canceled again. <sighs> my, my professor must be a huge fan of me. I was literally about to join class. It's one minute before class is starting. And my class just got canceled. I got an email at 4.54. My class got canceled again. That's crazy. Yeah, she must be a big fan of my streams. What's good, Jack? Welcome to the stream. What's up, the Killer Baker? 
Michael Sanchez, and my boy D2K. Welcome back. Casey said, hey, no school. Lucid said I wouldn't complain about that. I'm not complaining, but I was so ready to join class. On time and everything. I'm not complaining, but dude, I was like 100% planning on muting everything, grinding during my class, but on mute. I'm not upset about it, but yeah, no school today. That's a dub for sure. I see you guys getting those dubs in the chat, but yeah, I was 100% ready for it, not gonna lie. What's up, Tristan? What's up, Jack Mills? Yeah, Lucid, don't worry. I'm not complaining about that. I'm not gonna sit here and complain about no school. I'm not one of those, for sure. Luan says, I finished up the first two games. Tomorrow, I'm gonna get John Wall and Donovan Mitchell, and hopefully Kermit Washington. Same, same. I hope I get Kermit today, too, but... We already have Donovan and John Wall. We have a whole bunch of Opals, man, but always got to keep the team getting better, moving in the right direction. What's up, Yufei? Welcome back to the stream. My boy King K said, yer, what's good, King K? Yeah, so no school today. I don't have to worry about joining class. We can just sit back and grind the game. It's been 30 minutes, and I'm not going to lie to y'all. This stream's off to an awesome start. 100 likes already. 167 people in here. You guys talk to me if you haven't already, and if you're new, all I can say is sit back, relax, and enjoy the grind. Enjoy the grind. It's going to be a long one, so if you guys need something entertaining to watch, I got y'all. Javen says I get every Wednesday off. I'm not supposed to get every Wednesday off, but this is like my third week in a row where my professor has canceled pretty much every class. I don't know what she's up to. I don't know why she's canceling class, but... Yeah, my theory is that she's a big fan of my channel. No, I'm kidding. I doubt that, but you guys know what I mean. Neek Music said, love the positive vibes. Hey, man, positive vibes all the time. This is a pretty toxic game, so you never want to bring those toxic vibes into the streams. Welcome to the stream, my boy Neek Music. What's up, Dorito Dog? Hey, 100 people in the stream already. I know a bunch of you guys already have Kermit Washington, but... We're on the grind for him right now. Jeller Jeller, Flex Gaming, welcome to the stream, both of you guys. CP the Goat fan said, I wish they can remove contracts. Nah, me too. 100% me too. I mean, contracts, they're no fun. And when you run out of contracts, you have to start using MT and VC, and it's just uncomfortable, man. Especially for guys who don't have much MT. Thankfully for me, I have a lot of MT, and of course, Steph Curry has a max contract, an unlimited contract, and these bronze players are very cheap, so... Yeah, I'm okay with spending like 40 MT for a few bronze contracts, but not contracts, they just suck. What's up, car kid? What's good, Toby? Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. Jack said, try to say my last name, Kavanaugh. Like Tyler Kavanaugh. He used to play for the Atlanta Hawks. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but I think that's pretty correct. La Austin said, yo, what's good, La Austin? Welcome to the stream. Shout out to my boy, La Austin. Austin, I'm not gonna lie to you, man. You're hilarious. Yesterday's stream was awesome. Austin started the LeBlanc movement. It's Jeb said, hey, Doc, I've been grinding for Kermit like you. No luck so far. Yeah, man, same here. Our grind just started, but yeah, no luck so far. We're going to keep on grinding. This is going to be a long stream, but no luck just yet. A Bay said, Doc, you're my favorite YouTuber ever. Hey, that means a lot to me, man. That means a lot to me. We still have a lot of work to do. We got to keep on getting better. I mean, hey, I appreciate the love, but we still have a lot of growth to do, a lot of work to do, and yeah, got to keep on growing and improving every day. I appreciate you, man. I appreciate all the love. What's good, Malachi? Matthews, welcome to the stream. James said, are you in class? My class got canceled. I didn't think it would get canceled because earlier today on Zoom, it was listed under scheduled meetings, but yeah, I got an email six minutes before class started that said it was canceled. So no class. We're just going to sit back, relax, and grind. Get through these games fast. La Austin says, I still haven't done my la homework. Get your homework done, man. This is going to be a long stream. Like I've been saying, 
If you guys go and do your homework, then I promise that by the time you're done, I'll still be live. There's no doubt about that. This is going to be a long stream. I'm thinking this is going to be a six hour stream. Because even if we don't get Kermit, or even if we do get Kermit early, I want to get a thousand wins too in Triple Threat so we get Galaxy Opal Peja. You guys know what's up. Gotta grind, man. We're hoping for multiple Opals today. What's good, Papa Money? Welcome to the stream. Matthew Daly says you're my favorite YouTuber. I appreciate you, Matthew. Jeller Jeller says I got Kermit first game. Yeah, like I said, you're like the third or fourth or fifth person to say that. So many guys have been saying that, so good for y'all for getting him first game. Snag you said, what's good, CP? Just got back from hanging with some friends. Nice. Welcome to the stream, Snag. It's good to have you back. Yufei said, is Kermit worth grinding? Yeah, he is. I mean, the only big weakness, the big blatant weakness, is that he's missing range extender. That's the big problem, but like, you can give him range extender. And if you have the right coach, if you give him a good shoe, his three-pointer can get up pretty high to at least an 87. Penny Fung said, hi, Doc. I'm so sorry I took a long nap. Hey, Kenny, it's all good. You woke up just in time for a super long stream. Good to have you back in the stream, Kenny. I'm Volatile said, isn't he short? If you think six foot seven or six foot eight is short, then yeah, he's pretty short. Good shot, Curry. Dominic said, Doc, did you know the stream has over 100 likes? Yes, I did know that. I don't think I said that aloud, but... Thank you guys for over a hundred likes on the stream already. Hasn't even been one hour and we already have a hundred likes. That's pretty legendary, so I guess up next we're gonna go for 200. Alex said, yo, 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 what's good, Doc? What's good, Alex? Welcome to the stream. Rex Boy said, should I go for Evo Jose Calderon? I mean, I've heard that Evo Jose Calderon's not bad, but... Also, he has XP challenges. If you get Jose, you get like 200 XP. And if you finish up his challenges, you get like another 800, I think. Plus, I've heard he's pretty good. It's your choice on whether or not to evolve him, but I think you should definitely get him at some point. Coop said, that's what I'm talking about. What's good, my boy Coop? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Josh Move? Josh Move said, I'm here while on break. Ace Move, you've been grinding, man. You've been grinding. And pretty much every day that you have work, you still join the stream. So, big shout out to you for always showing up. Shout out to Steph Curry for always hitting threes. Josh Move says, I called the power forward small forward yesterday. True, true. I said it might be a power forward, but I was pretty convinced that it was going to be a center. But power forward, small forward, you called it correctly. And Kermit Washington, despite the funny name, is looking like a pretty good card. I'm Volatile says, are you gonna play Kermit at the three or the four? Um, probably the three because Wes Unsell is my starting power forward. Wes Unsell is the power forward, my center's Kevin McHale, and of course, we have B-Roy at the two, John Wall at the one. We have guys like Curry, D. Wade off the bench. Our team is solid, but I gotta make some upgrades for sure. Kermit Washington could be a pretty good upgrade. Josh Move said he's the guy that almost killed Rudy T. Facts. Yeah, almost killed him, but now he's in the game and he has a Galaxy Opal while Rudy T has a pink diamond. Tough. But at least Rudy Tomjanovich is still alive. That's the bigger dub in my opinion. GR Baller says, are you excited for Peja? Not really. I've used him before and personally I'm not a big fan. I'll still use him though. He might still be in the lineup, but I don't know. There are some pink diamonds I like better than him, so... Yeah, I'm probably gonna keep on using Terry Dissinger, Jack Marin, those guys. Even though Paige is definitely not bad, I'm just not a big fan of his card. Crispy Kevy said, road to 10k, yes sir. Yeah, we're trying to get closer to 10k subs every day. Maybe today, we can hit 9,300. Kawhi said, who do you think is better? 
Retro Giannis or Kermit? Um, I don't know, man. Retro Giannis is very good. Now keep in mind, you can't give him range extender. Or can you? I know you can't give range to the new Giannis, but you can give Kermit range. He's going to be relatively similar, similar to Giannis, but a little bit shorter. Still very fast. Hall of Fame quick first step. Good strength, good rebounding. Amazing defense, though. Amazing defense. Retro Giannis versus Kermit. I think I'd have to take Kermit, especially if you decide to give him range. Jacob said, did you watch the All-Star game? Yes, I did. Ryan said, a fantastic and hella budget baller is KPJ. Hey, no, you're 100% correct. You said you got him for 1.8 thousand. Nah, he's very good for a very low price. Super fast jump shot, very athletic, great defensively. Yeah, Ruby KPJ is 100% worth it. You're 100% right about that, Ryan. Hey friends said tomorrow senior night, should I make a sign for someone to hold up for me during the B team game? Uh, that's your call. That's your call. I never asked people to make signs for me, but people made signs anyway at the games. Those were good times. Nice shot by Curry. Sean said, how do you get points? Owen said, how do you get points? There are so many ways to get points. Um, first of all, if you talk in the chat once every five minutes, you get, I think, three points added to your score. If you don't talk in the chat, but you're in the stream, you get one point every five minutes. So, those are two ways to get points, but also, if you donate one dollar, you get 50 points. And of course, you can multiply that. If you donate like $10, you get 500 points. If you, if you become a channel member, you get 500 points. And if you heist and gamble, those are also ways to get points. So, exclamation mark gamble, exclamation point heist and yeah there's a lot of ways to get points and you can use those points to get gifs and soon i'm gonna add some new ones in the description ryan weeks said first time seeing you man such a chill guy definitely subbing i appreciate you ryan weeks thank you for the sub welcome to doc nation and yeah like i said man very good recommendation kpj might be the best ruby shooting guard in the game him and kobe are definitely the top two for me What's up, Jack Mills? Welcome to the stream. Mateo said, this is Jacob on my brother's computer. What's good, Jacob? Also, welcome to the stream, Herbs. I saw you were the first person in the stream. It's good to have you back. Jas Fawn said, any new XP? Um, I saw that we got XP for Diamond Token players, but was that here yesterday, or is that a new thing? But yeah, Diamond, Devin Booker, and Diamond Karan Butler in the token market, I'm pretty sure... They have challenges now, but those might have been added yesterday. Anthony said, how many games are you at? Um, we've played 11 games, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure 11 games down. So 89 more games for Peja, and I have no idea how many more games for Kermit Washington. Wavy Hoops said, Doc, we back. What's good, my boy? Wavy Hoops, welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, my boy, Utku and Big Ballers? Wavy Hoops said, I'm trying to make MT. Herb said, the diamond rewards are new. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. So, yeah, diamond token rewards. If you guys have Devin Booker and or Karam Butler, those guys have XP challenges now. So, yeah, if you are getting close to level 40, those guys will get you within, like, I want to say less than 3,000. But I could be wrong about that. What's up, Ace Forte? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Chill Vibe Beats? Matthew says I won 170 plus games for Don Ole and didn't get him, but played two on my friend's account and got him. That sucks, Matthew. That sucks, yeah. I never got Don Ole, but to be fair, I didn't really go for him. As you guys know, I didn't get back on my account until last Monday, so I wasn't really playing Triple Threat offline. I was playing nothing but those Spotlight Sims, trying to get those Spotlight Sims done as fast as I could, so I didn't play that many games for him, so I'm not really mad about not getting him. Plus, you guys know we already have John Wall, Curry, D. Wade, and we have a lot of MT to get some more players, so we have some very good guards. I'm not too upset about not getting Don Ole. And at the end of the day, we're still going for a thousand wins in triple threat. So, yeah, we're just trying to keep on grinding, get those games done. And if we get Kermit along the way, that would be freaking awesome. 
We're going to go for Kermit a little bit harder than we went for Don Ole. Since I would like a good new wing player. What's good, Rex boy? Jacob says, what grade are you in? I'm a senior in college. Volatile said, let's be honest. John Wall, Unseld, and Roy are way more worth it than Don. Yeah, I agree. I agree with that. Yeah, John Wall, Brandon Roy, Wes Unseld. They're definitely better than Don Ole, but at the end of the day, it kind of comes down to personal preference. I know some guys out there who really love Don Ole, and I mean, even though I probably wouldn't have used him much, I still kind of wanted to have him for the lineup, so even though we didn't get him, not a big deal because, like I said, we're going to go for this other player today. Kermit Washington. Ace Forte says, I packed another Don Ole while grinding XP this morning. Any idea how much he would quick sell for if I open him? About 4,000, right? 4,000, 5,000 MT. So, you can do that if you want to, but if I were you, I'd probably wait until the next season because we might get another Galaxy Opal exchange and you might need an original owner Galaxy Opal for that. Maybe, I'm not sure, but that's what I'm gonna do. If I do get like more than one Galaxy Opal, you know? Matthew said it's 5,000. That's what I thought. I knew 4,000 or 5,000. I wouldn't know though because I haven't opened up a spare Galaxy Opal, so I appreciate that. Dylan Reese said, what's good? What's up, Dylan? Welcome to the stream, my boy. RJL says they released d Rob stats today, so he might not be Dark Matter. Yeah, he's not going to be Dark Matter, but he still looks very good. 35 Hall of Fame badges, a bunch of gold badges too. I mean, even though he doesn't have Hall of Fame range, I mean, he's still going to be worth it. I, know, I saw a lot of guys complaining about the fact that he doesn't have Hall of Fame range, but... He's still going to be the best center in the game. Possibly the best Opal overall. Javen said, how much does a Dark Matter Quick Sell for? I have no idea. I have no idea. So, a Pink Diamond Quick Sell is for like 3,000. That means an Opal Quick Sell is for 5,000, which is... That's 67% higher than Pink Diamond Sell for. If we go by the same algorithm... That means that that Dark Matters could quick sell for 10,000, but I seriously have no idea. If somebody in the chat would like to confirm, let me know. How much do Dark Matters quick sell for? 6,000? 7,000? Because I don't think 2K would actually make that to where you can quick sell for 10,000, so I'm going to guess 7,000. Abay said 6,000. Matthew Daly said 6,000. Okay, so I was close, but yeah. If we go by that same algorithm, they will be quick selling for like 10,000. CJ Triff said, yo, what's good CJ Triff? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up my boy Bajorn and No Limit Turtle? Welcome to the stream, all you guys. Nice shot by Curry. Another win in the books. Jacob says, what I like about CP the Duck, he reads your messages. Hey man, I try to read every single one, but... At the end of the day, the channel's been growing so much, we get so many viewers in here, I can't read every single thing, so you guys don't get too mad at me if I don't read your message, because chances are I'm not ignoring you. Ryan said D-Rob looks good, but Hakeem is only 120k, and he will be a cheaper version of him. That's a good point. That's a good point. I mean, D-Rob is tactically the better player, but if you do want a good center for cheaper, Hakeem's a very good option. Of course, D-Rob is going to be the best center in the game, but that's kind of similar to what we mentioned earlier. John Wall is better than Donovan Mitchell, for sure, but it takes over 30 hours to get John Wall, and it takes you 30 minutes to get Donovan Mitchell. So it's all about how much you want to spend, how much time you want to put in, and just how much time you want to spend, how much MT you want to spend on these players. So, now nah, D-Rob's going to be great, probably the best center in the game, but yeah, there are other centers out there who aren't as good, but... You can get them without, you know, grinding hours and hours and hours and hours to get level 40. TM Fast said, yo, what's good TM Fast? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up Rex Keith? We're down 4-3 to three in this game, so let's start to get things going on offense. I'm taking some bad shots. I gotta be a lot smarter than this. Snag, you said I only went for Wes Unseld. Wes Unseld was very good. I mean, Wes Unseld, despite being 6'7", he's a big mismatch. A big mismatch. 
If you put him at the four or the five, I mean, he's great at blowing past bigger players. And I mean, the only his only weakness is that he's six seven. That's really it. If you put him at the five, he's gonna get out rebounded sometimes. Even if he has good position, just because other players can get off the ground so fast, jump, grab the rebounds over him, and sometimes he'll get blocked on some cheesy stuff just because he's six foot seven. But nah, he can curry slide as a big man and. He can also get to the rim, dunk on you. He's great defensively, forces a lot of missed layups, and can hang with you on the perimeter if you get switched onto. I mean, Wes Unsell's very good, but his only weakness is that he's six foot seven. What's good, Unown Rage? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Joshua? Shadow Play said, "I feel so bad for DBG." Are you talking about how he shaved off half his beard? Is that what you're talking about? DBG's a beast, though, man. Don't feel too bad for him. Jaden said, Yo, Doc, do you think there's going to be a Galaxy Opal or Dark Matter Steph Curry? Eventually. We're going to get a, a Galaxy Opal Steph Curry this season. It's already confirmed. We're getting a Galaxy Opal hero card for Steph Curry. So that means we're going to get a regular Steph Curry, too, at some point. I don't know what the collection's going to be, but we know we're getting an Opal Steph Curry this season. E.T. said DBG lost on a buzzer beater. That's tough. Andrew Irvin said, did you see Ty Debo versus DBG? I didn't see it. I knew they were playing, but I guess they already played. I didn't see it yet. Sounds like DBG lost, though, based on what you guys are saying in the chat. Sean said, nothing but respect for you and what you do for the community. I appreciate you, Sean. Ralph said, hey, yo, what's up? I'm back. What's good, Ralph? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, my boy? J.O. the GOAT. Legend Gaming said, your boy, Kermit. Yeah, man, we're going for him today. We're going for him today. It's not looking great, though, man. Well, actually, I can't say that. It's been like 15 games. Andrew said he got swept. I mean, to be fair, I mean, Tidebo is the best in the world. It's too bad that DBG got swept, but he's the best in the world. What's good, Mike Murray? Welcome to the stream. Javen Malone says, I have 19 picks on the top ascension board. Hey, make sure you go row six, column nine. That's a guaranteed Galaxy Opal Adrian Dantley. I'm kidding, though. I'm kidding. Um, a spot where I've gotten the Opal before is row three, column six, and row one, column six. Those are two spots where I've seen a lot of guys get the Opal at. But of course, I haven't gotten the Opal on this account. I haven't gotten the Ascension player on this account before. I've gotten Ascension players on other accounts, but never my own account, which is crazy. Fire Guy said, what's up? What's good, Fire Guy? Welcome back. Also, what's up, Versal? Andrew said, what do you think about the D-Rob upgrade? He looks great. He looks great. Best center in the game, in my opinion. Of course, we're going to get some better centers than D-Rob. And, I mean, of course, eventually, he's not going to be the best center anymore. But, as of right now, if you grind for him, I can promise you he's going to be a great center. 35 Hall of Fame badges, gold range for a big man. I mean, he's going to have good handles. He's going to be a great post player, post defender, and scorer. I mean, at the end of the day, he's going to be a beast. Trade 2 official says, I'm going for Kermit 2. Nice. Yeah, I know a lot of you guys are going for Kermit right now, but I know a bunch of you guys already have him too, so good luck to anybody who doesn't have him yet. Let's Rock it said Tidebo won the wager. Yeah, you guys were talking about that earlier. What's good, Harris Scott? Welcome to the stream. Utku said, what are we getting Friday? We're getting new packs. We're getting new heroes, but I don't know what it's going to be yet. Zerst on top said, did you see Cookie's video? No, I didn't. Flex Gaming said, just got Galaxy Opal Donovan. Nice. He's so easy to get too, so I'm glad you got him. Very good budget player you can call him yeah I guess you could call Donovan Mitchell a budget player if you really want to even though he's an opal so easy to get 
What's good, Grayson? Welcome to the stream. My boy, Grayson. Matthew says, almost 930 wins. Congratulations on that. Yeah, at the end of our stream yesterday, we were at 900 wins, so... Yeah, we're slowly working our way to 1,000. Game over said, what's up, Doc? I know I came late, but at least I'm here. Hey, I always say it myself. I'm better late than never, so... Thank you for dropping by. Volatile said, thoughts on Galaxy Opal Yao Ming. Very good post player. Not a bad spot-up shooter, but... I mean, he's so slow that... Versus most centers... Now, he's a bit of a defensive liability, so... Yeah, Yao Ming, great post scorer, great post defender. I mean, not a bad player all around and not super slow, but versus centers like Anthony Davis versus someone like, you know, David Robinson after the update versus somebody like Wes Unseld, he's going to be a bit of a mismatch because of speed because these centers are all so fast off the dribble and Yao Ming is not very quick laterally and not very fast overall. So Yao Ming's good, but... I wouldn't say he's one of like the best centers in the game, even though he is in or close to the top tier. M Long said, what's up doc, it's me from Ireland, what's good M Long, welcome back, and shout out to Ireland. I'm Volatile says, when you say post, do you mean a good player to be posterized? Yeah, you must not watch basketball if you don't know what I mean by post. You must not play either if you don't know what the post is. Joshua said, yo, saw you in SB stream. I saw you in SB stream too. Harris says, I'll be back because I have to do homework. Sounds good. Go do your homework. And by the time you're done, I'm still going to be live. This is going to be a long stream and it hasn't even been one hour yet. It's about to be one hour, but yeah. It's going to be a long stream, so you're not going to miss much. Josiah said, keep up the good work. I appreciate it, Josiah. Eiffel said, in what way was D-Rob upgraded? You can find his badges online. Alex said, will you use the 1,000 win card once you get it? Nah, probably not. Not a very big fan of him. I like food said, yo doc, sorry I'm late. I was watching DBG versus Ty. Yeah, everyone's talking about it in the chat. Everyone's talking in the chat about it, saying the result, even though I already know the result. What's good, Darion Ray? Welcome to the stream. Come on, Curry. We're actually down by two. We're not going to lose, but I got to sharpen up. Matthew said, going to the gym soon. I'll be back. Sounds good. Joshua said, poor DBG. He looks like he's 15. Yeah, you've already said that like 30 times. Casey says, who really thought DBG would win? Maybe his fans? I really don't know. I mean, Tidebo, he's the best player in the world. I said that earlier. I'll say it again. So no matter how good the games were, no matter how close they were, I'm pretty sure everyone picked Tidebo. Jacob said your videos are lit. I appreciate it. I don't post videos very often though, but I stream pretty much every day. Little Neon says we love the DBG chin. Canarsie said what's up doc? I'm never gonna get the vault card. I mean, if you play a lot of games and don't get the vault card, I can understand you saying that, but... The Vault card just came out today. I haven't played many games for it. If I were you, I wouldn't lose hope just yet because that Vault card is going to be there for a very long time. Marco said, bro, I hope you get that Opal Washington today. Hey, I appreciate him, Marco. I hope so too. We're going to need some good luck. We're going to need some good luck for sure because getting these cards from the Vault, it takes a lot of luck. We're doing our part by winning games, but two guys got to give us the card. What's good, Harris Scott? Welcome back. Also, what's up, Splash Central? Splash Central said I'm halfway to Brandon Roy. Let's go. Do you already have Wes Unseld? Because if you do, that means you'll be getting started on those John Wall challenges in no time. 
I'm Volatile said, thoughts on Galaxy Opal Andrew Bogut? Uh, one of the worst Opal centers in the game. With that being said, he's not a bad player, but he shouldn't be an Opal. He definitely shouldn't be an Opal, but he's not bad. But for Opal, he's pretty bad. Zerst on top says, I got Kermit after 14 games, got Don after 100, 300 for Terry, and 400 for Beck? I got Byron Beck in 40 games, then I got him again the next game, and then I got him again like, I think five games later, so. With Byron Beck, I had really good luck, but I really wasn't even going for him. For Terry Dissinger though, it took me 300 games, so. We've had some long grinds before, and you guys know we're cool with another long one today. Sean said, do you like the new Curry? I haven't used him. He's so similar to the Pink Diamond, so I think I'll just keep my Pink Diamond Curry. Draco says, I got this bum in five games. Not a bum, but congratulations. Yeah, not a bum at all. I mean, if you think 30 Hall of Fame badges is a bum, if you think, I mean, 99 overall defense is a bum, if you think 6-8 with Hall of Fame posterizer, Hall of Fame, quick first step, all that stuff's a bum, you must have really high standards for free cards then. Tidal Wave Gaming said, hey Doc, good to see you again. Hey, good to have you back. Aiden said, really no range. You're saying that like you can't give him range extender though. Just because a card doesn't have range doesn't mean he sucks. Shooting is not everything. Marco says, I had two Galaxy Opal Don Ols on the same night in like an hour. Yeah, man, like I said, I was the same way. I was the same way with Byron Beck. I got him like three times in a 10 game span, so that was very lucky for me. We haven't been as lucky since, but at least we got Terry Dissinger. We're going for this guy next. Alex said, will you use Peja? Uh, probably not. I've used him before, didn't really like him. La Legend says, looks like a clamp god. Yeah, looks like a clamp god. With Hall of Fame quick first step. Hall of Fame, downhill, posterizer, all that stuff. And you can give him range. And range isn't even that expensive, so... Yeah, he's definitely, like... He's definitely not a bad player. Sean says, Doc, you look like the Falcons kicker. Yeah, everyone likes to join the stream and say... That I look like some random Asian guy. They'll either say Jeremy Lin or Yao Ming. Young, Ho Young Wei Ku. It's really annoying, but it happens every time. Zerst on top said you totally need 800 Hall of Fame badges. Yeah, you need 800 Hall of Fame badges, or else players are just simply not going to be good. But yeah, like I was saying, I think this happens like a good 5-10 times per stream. They'll just join and say, you look like this Asian guy. You look like that Asian guy. It's annoying. Speaking of annoying, yesterday, I raided my boy Sherrod. I left the stream for a little while. I came back in and everybody in the stream was making fun of my voice. It happens though. What's good Brody, welcome to the stream. I like Fu said, do you like my new profile picture? I love your new profile picture. That L-E is perfect. Mike Murray says, I got Terry while in your stream. I got Terry too. I'm glad I got Terry, but at the end of the day, we're not going for Terry right now. We're going for this new guy. DP said, come on. You guys are really complaining about a guy that knocks someone out. Exactly, exactly. Don't complain too much about a guy who knocks someone else out. I mean, that makes it worth it already. Doc Jr. said my face is numb from the dentist. Hey, welcome to the stream, Doc Jr. Sorry your face is numb, but sit down, relax, and watch the stream, man. It's good to have you back. Brandon B said I'm from the South. I know what you mean when people say stuff about my voice. Oh no, they were calling me a robot. They were saying I talk like a robot, but hey, at the end of the day, I mean, I can't control that. If people make fun of my normal voice, that's just tough. I can't do anything about that. Owen L said, hi doc, just joined the Discord. Let me go ahead and pin the Discord link the next time that someone sends it. Next time that my boy YBZ sends the Discord link, I'll go ahead and pin it to the top of the chat, just so he doesn't have to send it again.
Plushy said, Steph Curry dominates in this mode? Yes, he does. He's really a beast in this mode. I mean, he's a beast overall, but in this game mode, he's just unstoppable. Especially if you're being guarded by some random gold player. Nav said, Yur, what's up, Doc? What's good, Nav? Welcome back. Moshi said, sorry I'm late. You're not that late. Welcome to the stream to Moshi. YBZ said, Doc, I sent the link. I'm in game right now, so once the game's over, I'll make sure to pin it. Nav said that Kermit Washington's kind of bums. I I I'm really struggling to see what's so buns about him. I, I really can't find it. I mean, I know he doesn't have range extender, but you can literally just buy it. What's good, Cedric? Welcome to the stream. What's up, Mike S? Also, what's up, King K? Dragon Brawl Stars. We just had like five guys join at the same time. Welcome to the stream, all of y'all. Volatile said, Galaxy Opal Jeremy Lin's underrated. No, yeah, I agree with that. I mean, Jeremy Lin's a top tier point guard, but I mean, he does go under the radar. He's not super tall. He's not insanely athletic. He's a good shooter, but not a great shooter. I wouldn't say that he dominates at like any one thing more than anybody else does, but he's still a top tier point guard. Definitely top 10. What's good, Chauncey? Welcome back. YBZ said, I think of Kermit the Frog. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I, I agree. I completely agree. This guy's first name is Kermit. So, our vault rewards, we got a guy who's a dentist. We got a lawyer in Triple Threat Online. We got a dude named Don Ole. He has a six-letter name. And now we got somebody named Kermit. I really love the names. All right, let's win this game right here. B. Jaggy said, If a car doesn't have every Hall of Fame badge, it's buns. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, it literally, it just makes sense. If you don't have every single Hall of Fame badge in the game, you're bad. That's why everyone's saying that Nate Robinson's bad. That's why this new card is bad. If you don't have every Hall of Fame badge, you're just not a good card. All right. 18 games down, no Kermit yet, but we're going to play at least 100 this stream, so let's keep on grinding. Plushy World said, do you think Galaxy Opal Fred Brown is bad? He's definitely not bad, he's a Galaxy Opal. He can shoot, defend, he's fast, he can dribble. He's definitely not bad. King Trizzy, welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Kristen J? Christian says I got him in four games. Everyone's saying that. Congratulations, though. What's good, LJ? Welcome to the stream. Nav said the Kermit's gonna get outdated fast. I really don't care. M said DBG shaved. Nathan said, what's up, Doc? What's good, Nathan? Welcome back. Also, I just realized we just passed 169 likes on the stream thank you guys for all the likes on the stream we have more people in here than we have likes on the stream so you guys hit that like button for me if you haven't already i know a bunch of you guys haven't liked the stream yet so y'all come through and hit the like button for me if you haven't already y'all know it helps the channel grow owen said thoughts on opal t-mac he's still one of the best shooting guards in the game for sure still one of the best his price has dropped a little bit but He's still great. Arguably the best shooting guard. I wouldn't say he is the shooting guard, but he's arguably one of the best. Doc Jr. said my game is still updating. Hey man. Yeah, I heard there was a big update on current gen, like 30 gigs. Herb said, yo, if you haven't turned the stream up to 1080p, do that now. Yes, sir. You guys listen to Herbs. If you have good Wi-Fi, good connection, turn the stream quality up to 1080p. It's going to look pretty beautiful if you do. You're going to like that gameplay footage, man, for sure. What's up, Nacho Thigh Juice? Welcome back to the stream. Also, welcome back, Jimi Hendrix. Good to have you guys back in the building from yesterday. Rex Boy says, I updated things during class. Not a bad idea. Like I said, man, it was a big update. 
I know a lot of you guys, it took a long time for your games to update, so very smart getting it done during class. What's up, Pierre? What's up, Silas? Silas said Kermit at the 3 or the 4. I think I'll put Kermit at the 3. I already have what's unsettled for the 4 position, so I'll probably put him at the 3. I think that's a better idea. He has so many defensive badges, I'm going to need him to guard some of those fast wing players for sure. What's good, Ryan Coley? What's up, Matt Agbe? Welcome to the stream, my brother. DPDP said, everybody's hating on my boy, Kermit the Frog Washington. Yeah, man. So many haters. Everybody is saying that he's buns. I don't think he's that bad. Rex Boy said, leave your PS4 on during class. Exactly. Go to class, but leave your PS4 on so your game updates. Jacob said, do you have LeBron? Yes, I do. I have multiple LeBrons, actually. I have so many LeBrons. To be fair, though, LeBron has so many cards, so a lot of you guys probably have a lot of LeBron cards. What's up, Diane? Welcome to the stream. Issa said, do you get Don Ol? No. Darian says, I've played against him offline so many times. Is draining? Facts. Facts. Yeah, 2K kind of taunts you by... Making those guys play against you offline. Don Ole, Kermit Washington, 2K definitely taunts you in that way, for sure. Parky Pig said, did you have class? Class was canceled again. I was not expecting class to be canceled. I was going to sit in class, mute myself during the stream, but my class was canceled once again. I didn't think it would be, but I'm not complaining. Jeb said Kermit's only flaw is that he's named after a frog and that his three isn't very high, but with the right boost, it can be fine. Exactly, exactly, I agree. And keep in mind, you can buy a range extender for pretty cheap and give it to him. But yeah, the big weakness is his name. That name's a pretty big weakness for sure, but still great defensively. Casey said your teacher loves the streams. Facts. I think that's why she always cancels class. Plus, she said, who is the worst pink diamond you've played with in the game? The worst pink diamond I've used. Hmm. That's a good question. I haven't used him, but I think pink diamond Ralph Sampson might be the worst. I mean, I've never seen anybody use him. I think the pink diamond, who else? Mikan? He's not bad, but he's kind of out of date. Um, yeah, I'd say pink diamond Mikan. I'd say Pink Diamond, Ralph Sampson, they are probably the two worst. Let's get one more three, and that's going to be another game in the books. It's Jeb said, I can't wait for Opal, Richie Alvinson, or something like that as the new vault player. Yeah, man, I mean, you guys were correct. It was going to be somebody I didn't know. I mean, to be fair, a lot of guys know who Kermit Washington is all because of Rudy Tomjanovich, but yeah, I didn't know the name till today. When in Rome said, yo, what's good, Rexa? Welcome back to the stream. Dallas said, Pink Diamond Jason Kidd is bad? Yeah, he is kind of bad. But at the same time, though, he's so good defensively, he's so good off the dribble. He might be the worst guard in the game, but I don't think he's that bad, but his jump shot is insanely slow. ACOG said my game has 30 minutes left, and once he updates, I can grind for Kermit. I'm mad. Yeah, man, that update on current gen is crazy. On next gen, there was no update, because you guys know 2K never updates next gen, but yeah. Get on your grind, ACOG. Welcome to the stream. Go and get that Kermit, because he's honestly looking pretty good. I saw your tweet about him on Twitter, and I completely agree. Just because the three-point shot's not that great, just because of no range, doesn't mean he's a scrub, but of course a lot of guys have been saying he's a scrub. I know his name's funny, but hey, no need to hate too much on Kermit Washington. Christian said, have you tried Juan Carlos Navarro? I haven't yet. I haven't yet, but I mean, I look at the badges, look at the stats. He looks like a beast. I saw some gameplay on him too. That Navarro looks really, really good. 
Plushie says I got Pink Diamond Curry in a free Dark Matter pack. That's tough. You got a Pink Diamond out of a Dark Matter pack? I'd be upset. I want a Dark Matter. Auto said is getting Nick Nurse as a coach worth it? He's 50k MT. He's good, but like, personally, I wouldn't want to pay that much for a coach. I'd pay that much for a player, but not for a coach. My coach is Spolstra. He gets the job done for me. Silas said with range extender, shoe, and a coach, and maybe flexible, Kermit is comp. Facts. I mean, on defense alone, he's already comp, but the offense does make him a bit of a liability, so giving him that stuff does complete the puzzle. No doubt about that. What's good, my boy, LeKelvin? Welcome back to the stream. It's still funny seeing so many guys with Le before their name. LeKelvin... La Legend. I know there's so many more in the chat. I know a lot of you guys are lurking though, but big shout out to every single La Legend in the chat. Good shot by Curry. La Kelvin said, not gonna lie, everyone should know who Kermit is for sucker punching Rudy in the face. Yeah, and almost killing him. TJ said, is Kermit the guy who almost destroyed Rudy's face? Yes, that's him. It seems like everybody knows who that is. It seems like everybody has some pretty good knowledge of Rudy Tomjanovich getting punched in the face. Gabe said, should I feel bad for not doing spotlights? Nah, man, doing spotlights is a choice. Of course, John Wall's good. Of course, what's unsell Brandon Roy. They're all very good players, but I mean, there's other good players too. And just because you don't do spotlights doesn't mean you should feel bad. Keep on doing your own thing, man. I know everyone out there is doing spotlights, but that doesn't mean you have to as well. Taco said, Doc, do you think there's a chance that D-Rob gets upgraded to Dark Matter? Nah, I don't think so. I mean, today, 2K finally posted David Robinson's stats, so I doubt those get upgraded anymore. I mean, let's be honest. Even without an update, he's looking great. But, yeah, he finally got updated today. We finally got to see his stats and badges. So, no update, I don't think, but he's still looking great. Panda X says, is Kermit on current gen? Uh, yes. Kermit's on current gen and next gen. Techno said, yo, what's up, Doc? What's good? Techno God, welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Joshua? Joseph says, I played like 30 games and got too pissed off. Really? You got pissed off playing triple threat offline? That's tough. Triple threat offline might be the most relaxing game mode, man. I literally just sit here and talk to y'all the whole time. Pierre said, Doc, I got a 99 overall Kobe. Yeah, maybe in 2K20, but yeah, no such thing in 2K21. Alex Caruso said, what about Pau Gasol's stats? Haven't seen them yet. I don't think they updated Pau Gasol's stats, but they did update D-Rob's. I mean, the reason why they updated D-Rob is because D-Rob, he's going to be available either tomorrow or Friday. And then Pau Gasol, he's not going to be available until the last week of the season. Tim Miller says, are they adding new domination challenges? Yes, eventually 2K is going to add two more dominations. Two more dominations. So, yeah, you guys get ready for those. I think we're going to get at least one domination next season. And you guys already know we're going to grind through it in less than two days. Herb said triple threat challenges are tedious. Maybe that's why. Nah, man. I mean, any challenge in triple threat, it's super tedious. Playing triple threat offline over and over is not hard, but nah, it definitely gets annoying. So, herbs, you make a great point. I mean, I can sit here and hit threes every single game. I can just sit here and green three after three after three, win game after game after game. The games do get super, super tedious. Pan said, how do you get Kermit on current gen? Uh, play triple threat offline. What's good, Senua? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Nathan Albert? Welcome back to the stream as well, Doc Jr. Doc Jr. said, finally got my milkshake. Yes, sir, Doc. Lasplash said, yo, what's good, Lasplash? Welcome to the stream. The new Mellow says, there better be Dark Matter Domination. I think there will be. I think there will be Dark Matter Domination. I think the next Domination reward is going to be a Galaxy Opal. But then the last one, Domination number six... 
I think that's going to be a Dark Matter award for sure. Hypershot said, Yo, Doc, I'm one game away from level 36 Ascension. Nice. That's very good. Let me know when you get the Ascension. And let me know if you get that man, Adrian Dantley. La Splash said, Doc, how's your day? Very good so far. Very good. I went to class in the morning, went to the gym after, got some good food, came home, started up the stream, and then my second class got canceled, so that was a huge dub. We're just sitting back, playing the game, enjoying the stream, all that good stuff. And hey, quick announcement. We are less than 10 likes away from 200 likes, so we have 186 guys in here. I know a lot of you guys have not hit the like button yet, so you guys hit that like button for me if you haven't already. I wonder who like number 200 is going to be. I wonder, man. But nah, for real. 200 likes already is a great start to the stream. Every single like helps the channel get out there, helps the channel grow. I never want to sound too obnoxious asking for likes and subs, but at the end of the day, every single one helps the channel grow. B Stacken said, Yo, Doc, I got that Dantley card at level 30. Nice. I did not. Believe it or not, B Stacken. I haven't gotten a single one of the Ascension cards on this account. On other accounts, I've gotten Ascension cards, but not on this one, which is weird. To be fair, none of them are really good anymore, but I still want to get one just for collection purposes. No Limit Zoe says, I got you with the 200th like. Yes, sir, No Limit Zoe. 200 likes on the stream, courtesy of all you guys. Number 200, courtesy of No Limit Zoe. Hey, Zo, awesome Twitch stream last night. I love the vibes in your Twitch streams, but I hope you get back on YouTube soon, too. Welcome to the stream, my boy, No Limit Zo. Also, welcome to the stream, Connor Bennett. Good to have you back. Jonathan said, are you a college student? Yes. I'm in my last year of college, actually. 21 years old, last year of college. Gonna go grad school next year. And hey... I haven't thought that far ahead after that, man. It's been pretty chill, though. It's been pretty easy. If I'm able to do this consistently and go to class and go to the gym twice a day, it's pretty chill. It's Record says, what's up, Doc? Did you get Don Ole yesterday? No, I didn't. We played for six hours and still didn't get Don Ole. So, yeah, it wasn't meant to be. It was not meant to be. To be fair though, I know some guys who played like 600 games, 500 games, like hundreds of games, and I only played like 150, so I didn't play as many games as other people, so I'm not really mad about not getting Don Ole. Plus you guys already know, I have Steph Curry, I have Galaxy Opal, John Wall, I have B-Roy, I have some really good guards, D-Wade, and I have almost a million MT, so yeah, we've been grinding, collecting MT, and we're gonna get Peja today too, so... Yeah, we're just grinding. Grinding as usual. And yeah, if we don't get this new vault card today, not going to be that upset. Kind of like how we didn't get Don Ole yesterday. And I wasn't too upset. So let's just sit down and enjoy the grind. It's going to be a good one today for sure. Zoe said, I appreciate you coming through. YouTube is still going to be the main platform. Yes, sir. Zoe, I love to hear that. Like I said, man, I love the vibes of your Twitch stream, but... The YouTube hits different for sure. Panet says, can you win Kermit after your first game? Yeah, you can. You have to get very lucky, but yes, you can get Kermit after one game. I'm Volatile said, how do you get so much MT? Just by playing the game. Playing Triple Threat Online used to be a great way to make MT, but then they completely messed up the Triple Threat Online board, so... Not as easy as it used to be. Cedric said, hey CP, what's good? Cedric, welcome back. Yeah, we're grinding, man. We're going to be getting that page of the day. I would also love to get Kermit Washington, man. I would love to get two opals in one stream, but I wouldn't be too upset if we don't. Nikki Boy said, yo, what's good, Nikki? Jonathan said, no way. I'm a senior in college also. What's your major? My major is business marketing with a minor in communications. Hey, I have a major in communications broadcasting. I have another major in neuroscience. Double major, man. It ain't easy. 
it's not easy to balance all that stuff but yeah sounds like we're pretty much in the same boat that's pretty dope though man both seniors in college 2021 man gonna be awesome graduating and then going to school again that part sucks but nah it's cool that we're finally graduating what's good jive beer welcome to the stream La Legend says I'm third in hours. Are you seriously? You were seriously climbing up the ladder in hours. That's what I'm talking about. Jonathan said, let's get it, bro. Yes, sir, Jonathan. Looking forward to graduation. College has been fun, but nah, graduation is going to be great. Bittersweet. And then, like I said, more school afterwards. Jaden said, yo, Doc, I'm sorry you didn't get Don Ol. You really don't have to be sorry. I mean, I'm not feeling sorry for myself, so... I don't know why so many guys are saying that. They're saying, sorry you didn't get Don Ol. As if I don't have Galaxy Opal John Wall and Spider Mitchell. I appreciate the love. Len said, hey doc, sorry I'm late. It's all good. You're not really late. I mean, hasn't even been two hours yet, so I wouldn't say you're that late. And this stream probably is going to be like six hours. So yeah, I wouldn't say you're that late. Welcome to the stream, my boy Len. Dallas says I graduated college back in 19, going back to grad school this fall, yes sir. I'm not gonna lie to you man, I'm considering taking a leap year too, but nah, at the end of the day, might as well go ahead and get my masters, get that stuff done. But nah, hey, you're gonna kill it in grad school man, and I know I'm still gonna see you in these streams all the time while you're in grad school. Sainal said, do you think Paige is crazy? Um, crazy bad, yes. Okay, I'm kidding. He's not that bad. I just don't like him. Not a bad card, but I'm not a big fan. Look, Kelvin said thoughts on Spencer Haywood. Um, I mean, he looks pretty bad. Or he looks kind of bad until they fix his hot zones. He looks all right. I mean, he's a free card, but yeah, probably not going to go for him. I mean, I, you guys know I play a lot of triple threat online, so... I might get him anyway, but not a big fan of him. What's good, Lucci Gaming? Welcome to the stream. I forgot to say this earlier, but thank y'all for 200 likes. That's really good. Hasn't even been two hours yet. 200 likes is crazy. And we have 172 people in here. Hope all you guys are enjoying today's grind. Going for Kermit Washington. And going for Peja at the same time. It's a two for one. If we get Kermit in the next 100 games, I'll be happy. If we don't, we still get Peja. So we're going to get at least one Opal this stream. It's inevitable. We're going to get one Opal. I would rather that Opal be Kermit, though. Colin says I'm back. I was gone for like an hour. Welcome back, Colin. Gabriel said, do you have a command for redeems? Yeah, all the commands for redeems are in the description. Go to the description and they should be there. I'm going to add some more soon for sure because you guys have some pretty cool ideas for new redeems. I haven't used them yet either, so I'll probably do those sometime this weekend or tonight after I finish studying. Len says, is there a way I can see my hours? Um, on YouTube, no. On YouTube, no, but my boy SB actually told me about a way where I could show you guys your hours, so I might try to get that done tonight as well. Workaholic said, which pink diamond is the best in the Spotlight Sims? I think it's really opinion-based. I mean, I think there's a best pink diamond for each position, but I don't know who the best one is overall. I have all of them, but I've only used like four or five of them. Brody said, how's your day been today? Very good day today. I can't complain. Very good day and streams off to a very good start. Gotta make that shot. Lucid said, bro, I'm straight vibing right now. Listening to the stream, grinding for a dude named after a frog, and vibing to Juice World. This is a good day. I agree. I agree. I'm glad you're having a good day, Lucid. I hope all you guys in the stream are having a good day. 
A lot of you guys are joining the stream, asking how I'm doing. I hope you guys are doing alright too. It's record says is Kermit worth grinding for. I'm thinking about going for him this weekend. I think he is. That's just me though. A lot of guys are saying that Kermit's buns, but looking at the SIGs, looking at his jump shot, looking at his defensive badges, looking at his badges overall, I don't think he's bad at all. I think he's very good. And we'll get to see if we can find out after we get him how good he is. Bryant said, hi guys, I was lurking. What's good, Bryant? Welcome back from lurking. Jacob says, I hope you're having a good day too. I already said I'm having a good day. I already said I'm having a very good day. No Limit Zoe says, Kermit is a beast. He's definitely making my squad. Hey Zoe, are you gonna be grinding for him live? Just wondering, are you gonna be going for him live? Because if you do, you know I'm tuned in. I wonder how long that stream is gonna be. Joe says, I'm a fan of you from Portugal. I appreciate that, Joe. Shout out to you watching from Portugal. Also, shout out to my boy, Zach. Welcome to the stream, Zach. Fax said, what is the hardest game for John Wall? Hardest game for John Wall? I really don't know. I didn't have a problem with a single game. My smallest win was my 20. The hardest game was game number five for Dave DeBusher. I won that game by like 17 or 18. Every other game, smooth sailing. But Kelvin says I would go for Kermit, but I feel like he's gonna be more rare than the dentist. I mean, I really don't know. I seriously have no idea. In theory, he should be more rare because he's a Galaxy Opal and Terry Dissinger was a pink diamond, but nah, getting Terry Dissinger was insanely hard, so. Hopefully this grind for Kermit is a little bit easier. Aura said, hello, I'm new. What's good, Aura? Or is it Era? Welcome to the stream, Era. Hang around, enjoy the channel, and since you're new, would love it if you subbed if you're enjoying my content today. Zoe says, yeah, I'm gonna grind for him tonight. But I'm also close to getting Wes Unselled, okay. So you have some choices to make. Do you get Wes Unselled? Or do you go for the new content? Hey, no matter what, you know I'm tuned in. You know I'm tuned in. I lived at Waits earlier today. I ran yesterday, so I'm not gonna be going to the gym tonight. I'm just gonna be vibing, getting some homework done. Might go on a walk since the weather is so nice at night. I mean, I really don't know, but no matter what you do, I'm tuned in. Aura said you said it right the first time. So Aura, okay, Aura. Okay, I'm glad I at least said it right once. I'll try to remember that, but welcome to the stream, Aura. But Kelvin says, I feel like once they update the vault, they lower the odds. Yeah, I feel that. You might be right about that. I mean, some guys, they get the vault reward after like 10 games though. So yeah, I don't know how the vault works. I know the odds are low, but some guys seem like they have way better odds than other guys, so... Yeah, we're gonna grind. I don't know what the odds are, but y'all know we're gonna go hard. We're gonna play these 100 games at least, and we're gonna see if we can get Opal Peja and Opal Kermit today. The new Mellow says the only vault that I've pulled is Terry. Yeah, man, I mean, luckily I got Terry too. Terry's very good, but... A bunch of guys in the chat earlier were saying that they changed his shot. I wouldn't know though, I still think his shot's money. Aura says I got Buck Williams and Embry, Buck Williams in one game and Embry in 22. That's crazy. It took me about 100 games for Embry. I don't know if it was 100, but it was something like that. But we got Embry the day he came out, which was awesome. We got him at the very end of the stream. It was super clutch. That was a long time ago though, man. I don't know when that was, but it feels like that was so long ago. Games TV says my I started as soon as it began. I got him in two games, that's dope. Jacob said, my day is good because I'm sitting back watching you. Yes sir, Jacob, glad you're enjoying the stream. Not Thunder Puff said the games for John Wall are hard. How should I beat them? 
Play defense. That's the most important thing. I mean, you have Brandon Roy. You have Wes Unseld. So you have two pretty good players on your team. You can surround those guys with anybody. So make sure you have good defenders, good athletes, good rebounders, and you should be fine. I think the hardest game for John Wall is the game where you need 20 rebounds as a team. But even then, I got like 30 rebounds in that game. So make sure you have a tall center. Having someone like Mitchell Robinson or Thon Maker. I mean, or Mo Bamba or Taco Fall is good enough. Those are all Ruby centers who are insanely good rebounders. And yeah, if you put Wes Unseld at the four, he can also grab rebounds, but he's a bit undersized for the five. So make sure Unseld's at the four. Make sure you have someone tall at the three, a good wing player, an athletic wing player. And yeah, B-Roy at the two, a good PG at the one, and a big center at the five. It sounds easy, but yeah, trust me, it really is that easy. What's good, Elham? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, TB Gaming? Hypershot said, I got four packs from level 36, but no grand prize. Like I said, man, I've heard that Adrian Dantley's not very good. I haven't used him, but that's the general consensus from guys that I've talked to about Adrian Dantley, is that he's not very good, so maybe you dodged a bullet by not getting him. I don't know, but at least you got four packs. Let me know if you get anything good out the packs. No, don't want to shoot that. What's up, Le Felipe? Welcome back. Kevin says, I've gotten all the vault cards besides Dave Bing, Brian Winters, and Terry Dissinger, and I have a thousand wins. Nice. I have Dave Bing. I have Brian Winters. I have Terry Dissinger, but I didn't get Don Ole. I didn't get Buck Williams. I didn't get... There's one more I didn't get. Who was it? I'm not going to sit here and try to remember because it ain't a big deal, but yeah, I know I have Dave Bing, I know I have Terry Dissinger, Wayne Embry, all those guys. Chuck Person, too. There's a couple that I missed. Gray2K said, yo, what's good? My boy, Gray2K, welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Aiden? Aiden said, I'm sorry I'm late. You're really not that late. Honestly, you're not that late. Hasn't even been two hours yet, and this is going to be a six-hour stream, so... Welcome, Aiden. Sit back, relax, and enjoy it. Nacho said Jeff Malone. Yeah, he's the one I didn't get. Jeff Malone, Buck Williams. I missed both of those guys. So, yeah, no Jeff Malone, no Buck Williams. Goat Talk said Doc. What's up, bro? What's good, Goat Talk? Welcome back. Goat Talk Gray, Aiden, everybody who's joining. Say what's up to me if you haven't already. And let's keep on grinding through this stream today. What's up, my boy? First rate BK in the building. What's good, BK? I'm assuming that you're going to hit level 40 either tomorrow or Friday. That's going to be an epic stream if you do that live. R2K said Malik Seeley's the GOAT. Malik Seeley is very good. And he's so cheap. He's a pink diamond, but he's so cheap. So you might as well pick him up if you need a wing player. What's good, Brady the Gate Maker? Welcome to the stream. Aiden says I'm about to be level 37. Almost there. Yeah, level 37 is not too bad. The max level right now is 39, so you're not too far behind. What's good, F9 Flame? Welcome back. Jack said, Yo, I have a test tomorrow, but I'm studying while watching you. Hey, man, if you gotta lock in the study, go ahead, because I don't want to distract you too hard from your studying grind, so... Go study if you have to, but yeah. By the time that you're done studying, I'll still be live. Six Man Sam said, ooh, level 34. Yeah, man. Nothing too special, but there's still so much time left in the season. And Sam, you already know we're going to get there. I didn't start playing this season until last Monday, so we're just taking it one day at a time, taking it slow, just chilling, and doing all these other grinds on the side. I might, like, sit back and grind XP sometime soon, but we got those Spotlight Sims done in a four-day span. And, yeah, right now we're going for a 1,000 wins in Triple Threat and the new Galaxy Opal, so we're just chilling. Also, shout-out to my guy, Six Man Sam. I didn't even know you were in here. That's the GOAT right there. Big shout-out to Six Man Sam. 
Owen said, BK, will you be the first in the world for D-Rob? Hmm. It is possible. It's most certainly possible. It really depends on how fast he just hops on the new XP. He could certainly be the first in the world. He could certainly be the first in the world. Sam said, forgot about your setback. Hey man, no love lost. We're back on the game. Absolutely no love lost. We're just grinding. We're back on it. And we're going to be getting D Rob. Nothing stops the grind at the end of the day. MV Beat says, I hate when people say, I got Don Ole in 20 games. Bruh, I played 300 games. I got one retro pack and one diamond consumable. Hey man, I hear you, MV Beats. I completely hear you. So, I didn't get Don Ole, but thankfully I got Terry Dissinger. The entire time while grinding for Terry Dissinger, though, I was hearing everyone say, oh my gosh, I got Terry Dissinger in two games, three games. And then I played like 300 and didn't get him. But then everybody was saying, oh my gosh, I know this strategy to get him. If you use all bronze players in your actual lineup, if you use a bronze coach and bronze jerseys, you're going to get Terry Dissinger. I'm telling you, man, the superstitions go crazy for sure. Those superstitions go insanely crazy. But at the end of the day, if you just stop playing MV, you don't have any chance. So as long as you keep on playing the game, as long as you keep on winning, you have a chance. If you stop playing, you lose your chance. What's good, Owen L? Welcome back to the stream. BK said, I doubt it. I'm not maxed out because of all the pack streams I've been doing. Hey, it makes sense, but those pack streams are entertaining, so don't stop doing them. Jumbo Gumbo said Kermit the Frog. Yeah, I love this guy's new name. I love this new guy's name, I mean. Kermit, that's just a guy that I want in my starting lineup. Forget Opal David Robinson. I want Kermit the Frog, Washington. What's good, Corbin? Welcome to the stream. Tyreek Wright said 22 more games. Yes, sir. 22 more games for what? I'm pretty sure for me, I have 22 more games and I get to 950 wins, but I don't know if you're talking about your own grind or mine. Aiden said, if you use Ruby Kobe with gold shoes and have gold Dwight Howard as your center, you'll get Terry Dissinger. Yeah, that's the conspiracy. There were conspiracies like that. They were saying if you if you use an entire bronze 13-man lineup with a bronze coach and bronze jerseys, two guys going to think that you suck at the game. They're going to feel bad for you, and they're going to give you Terry Dissinger. I was like, what? What? They're going to feel bad for you? I don't know if they feel bad for anybody. Not saying that in a bad way. I'm just saying, why would they feel bad for anybody? BK said, thanks, man. Definitely going to keep them coming. Yes, sir. You already know. Tyreek said, good luck getting him. I appreciate you, Tyreek. We're going to need luck. We're going to need a lot of luck. I know this opal's hard to get, but that's why we're going for him today. If we don't get him today, not going to cry about it, but I would love to get him today. Oh, come on. I got to green that. If only I was better at the game. Owen said, if you grind unlimited spotlight sims and level 40 on my account, you're going to get Kermit. Really? So if I do all that stuff on your account, I'm going to get Kermit on this account. Now that's another good conspiracy, but I might actually have to take you up on that one. Kyle said, have you ever played my career? Of course I've played my career. I just never play it on stream. Sean says you got Mamba mentality. Hey man, that's the biggest thing. Kobe passed away, man. I miss him for real, but he lives on through your mentality, Mamba mentality. Go hard every day. Don't give up on your grinds, whether it's basketball or football or baseball or even a game or school. Don't give up on your grind. That's what Mamba mentality is all about. What's good, Fear Clan? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Aiden? Aiden says, I'm not missing another live this week. Hey, I'm going to have to see it to believe it, but it's good to have you back in the stream, Aiden. Fear Clan, welcome to the stream, both of you guys. Another badge pack. 
Dallas said, do a good deed today, and 2K will bless you with a frog. Yeah, Kermit the Frog. Kermit the Frog, Washington. Yeah, I think everyone's forgetting. His last name's Washington. I'm not gonna lie. I forgot his last name too. I had to look, I had to look over at my stream's title to remember his name. What's up, Drake? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Geo? Welcome back. Len said, would you actually grind for me? I mean, I'm behind on XP on my account, so I gotta grind XP on my account first. Owen L said, Doc, we are 8 likes away from 69. Yeah, Owen, you're a little bit behind. We have 241 likes on the stream, so I don't know what stream you're looking at, but my stream says we have 241. What's good, Travis Scott? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Dogwater and RBM? RBM said, is it true about D-Rob being moved to a dark matter? Even though he has five Hall of Fame badges, he does not have five Hall of Fame badges. He has 35 Hall of Fame badges. You must not have heard about the update. He has 35 Hall of Fame badges. So, yeah. No dark matter. Splash said, I have Beck and Don. I have Beck and Terry Dissinger, though. And John Wall. So, hey. Can't complain about not having Don when I have John Wall. What's good, Snipe God? Good to have you back. Also, what's up, Jack? Volatile said, should I sell Galaxy Opal Butler? And if I do, who should I replace him with? How much MT are you going to have? In theory, you should replace him with someone like T-Mac. But I don't know how much MT you're going to have. Dogwater says, I got Opal, Donovan, Mitchell. Nice. Hey, man, if you guys have a little bit of MT and a little bit of time, I guarantee you, that's all you need to get Donovan Mitchell. Galaxy Opal, all you have to do is eight challenges. Hit eight threes with any. Steph Curry, which means you could use the Emerald from season three. Hit eight threes with any. Damian Lillard, make five dunks with any. Trailblazers player, you guys get the picture. Those challenges are insanely easy. You can get those done in less than 30 minutes. Miles Taylor said, yo, what's up? When do you think they're releasing the stats for Pau Gasol? I'm assuming at the end of the season. I'm assuming they'll be here at the end of the season. The reason why d Rob's stats came out today are because d Rob's going to be here either tomorrow or the day after. Probably Friday. So, yeah. Once it gets closer to Pau Gasol time, we're going to see Pau Gasol's stats. What's good, Corbin? Owen L said my little sister says hi. Tell her I said hello too. Geo says, how do you get Pau Gasol? You get Pau Gasol by getting five rings in My Team Limited. Personally, I don't think he's going to be very good. So I'm going for the Hall of Fame badge instead. Even though I was banned for the first two weeks of the season, since everyone got a ring in Limited, I got a ring too, which means I'm still going for the Hall of Fame badge for sure. Yeah, Pau Gasol... I don't think he's going to be that great. I mean, limited rewards, they're usually not very good. So, yeah, I don't think Pau Gasol is going to be very good, but hopefully for the guys who get him, he is good. Louis says, can I get a D-Rob with no PlayStation Plus? Um, I really don't know. I mean, there's a lot of offline challenges, but... Maybe it is possible to get D-Rob without PlayStation Plus. I really don't know, though. You're going to have to cut it close because, I mean, so many challenges you have to play in Limited, Unlimited, Triple Threat Online. I would say no, but you can still get a lot of XP offline. Hey, my boy Flurry2K. My man Flurry2K is going crazy. Dropping the first dono of the stream. $1.99. He says I've been here the whole time. I was lurking, eh? You are very good at lurking, but shout out to you, Flurry, for dropping that dono. First dono of the stream. You guys have been going crazy donating lately, so thank y'all for showing love. Thanks to Flurry for the dono. Hey, I saw it a little bit late, but also thanks to all you guys for those dubs in the chat. 
BK said no because my team is online itself. That is a good point. That is a good point. I know you need PlayStation Plus to like load into park games and everything. And yeah, I'm assuming that you probably need PlayStation Plus if you want to get all the way to level 40. Like I said, there's so many challenges in Triple Threat Online, in Unlimited, Limited. There's so much stuff you have to do online, and like BK said, my team itself is an online mode. Corbin said Irish Spring Green Green. Yeah, this curry is crazy. We still use him all because he's so good at shooting. I like John Wall better. I use him online because of his defense, but offline, Curry has an unlimited contract, so yeah, we're just chilling and shooting threes with Curry and hoping that the vault opens. What's good, Blake Vidal? Welcome back to the stream. Dogwater says, I remember Fernando yesterday with the donations. Yeah, Fernando was going crazy yesterday. I don't think he's in here right now because whenever Fernando joins the stream, he donates. So I don't think he's in here yet, but nah, big shout out to Fernando for always coming in here and showing love. Dropping big donos whenever he's in here. You guys know I never ask for donos, but every single dono, it, it catches me off guard. Gets me hyped, so yeah. Thanks to anyone who donates, but y'all know that all I need you guys to do is like the stream, subscribe, and be here. And that's good enough for me. You guys don't have to pay any money to support this channel. What's good, Judge? Welcome back to the stream. Harvcore said it's not possible because you can only get 110 XP for offline challenges. Yeah, but there's still so much time left in the season, so if there's 110,000 XP available right now, maybe there's going to be 150 by the end of the season. Like I said though, I don't know the exact numbers for online offline challenges, so I'm seeing a lot of different things in the chat. I don't know who to listen to because some guys are saying there's 130k offline challenges. Some guys are saying there's 110k, so I don't know the exact numbers. I'm going by what you guys are saying. Astro said you get so much MT from just playing triple threat. Yeah, online and offline. Yesterday we made like 40,000, 40,000, 50,000 from playing Triple Threat offline. And of course you get a lot from playing online too. Two of the best ways to make MT, but Unlimited has also become a very good way to make MT. How many games have you played already, bro? I like the card. I just don't know if it's worth it. We've played like 30 games, right? I can't remember how many games we've played, but we'll find out soon. We'll find out very soon. Let's just keep on shooting with Curry and get through the game fast. I'm Volatile says you can buy Galaxy Opal PG or LeBron or Giannis. Oh yeah. I saw somebody ask that. If you have 400,000 MT, there's a lot of good small forwards you can get. It's really your choice. 100% your choice. Len said, how often do the top hours switch? Um, it really depends on how many guys actually watch the streams. It really depends on who's in here and who isn't. I'd say the top hours, they shift all the time, but if you're asking how often I reset them, not very often. I reset them for the first time ever last week. All right, another game in the books. I saw you guys ask how many games I've played, so I guess we'll find out right here. Len said my goal is to make the top 20. That's a very attainable goal. The weird thing about Streamlabs hours though, is that you gotta also talk in the chat to get hours, so if you just sit there and lurk the entire stream, even though you should be getting hours, you get one point per five minutes you're in here, so you get points, but sadly not hours. I don't know why, but... I can't do anything about that. Alright, we've played 32 games. We've played 32 games in less than 2 hours. That's pretty crazy, so we are winning games at a very fast pace. Let's see if we can keep it up. We're about to have 33 games done in less than 2 hours. That means we'll have about 99 or 100 done after 6 hours, and yeah. Like I told you guys earlier, this is definitely going to be a 6 hour stream. 
No Limit Zoe said, Streamlabs does not reward us lurkers. No, it doesn't, man. It does not. You gotta be active to get hours consistently, but at least it gives you points. I will say that. Carco said, hey doc, I'm here. What's good, Carco? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's good, Jasfon? Jasfon said, good vibes. All the time, Jasfon. Nothing but good vibes in here. Hey, speaking of good vibes, I just noticed we have 200 viewers. 200 viewers in here for the first time today. That's what I'm talking about, man. That's awesome. So, thanks to all you guys for tuning in. If there's anybody new watching the stream, talk to me in the chat if you haven't already. Sit back, enjoy the vibes. If you like them and you're not subscribed, what are you doing? Subscribe, turn on notifications. We grind the new content pretty much every day, whether it's Triple Threat online or offline. We play the new content every day, and I try to stream every day, give y'all content. Dave Oyen says, when are you ending the stream? This stream is going to be six hours, man, like I said. Six hour stream. If we don't get the new Opal, we are going to get a thousand wins, so we're going to get at least one Opal today. I would love to get two, the new Kermit and Peja Stojakovic, but if we don't get the new Opal, not going to complain. We'll just go for him another day. What's good, Feroz? What's up, J.U.? Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. BCTO said, do you remember me from yesterday? Yeah, I do. You changed your name back to just BCTO. It was Lebecto, but now it's just Becto again. Jay Bucket said, half-court shot for the win for a dono. I'll shoot the half-court shot, but I wonder if you're actually going to donate. A lot of guys say they're going to donate after I do something, but half of them usually just never come back. I will say, though, yesterday you guys were pretty honest. You guys were saying, if you win, I'll donate. If you make a three, I'll donate. And you guys were actually donating. I was surprised because I remember one time in NBA 2K20, I think I was grinding Spotlight Sims. I was using the GOAT Kobe Bryant. Somebody said, if you score 81 with Kobe in this game, I'll donate. I scored like 110, but guess what? I never saw that guy again. There's the half-court shot for the win, though, but if we don't get the dono, ain't a big deal. What's good, Damian Perez? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, Nick and Jack Lockney? Good to have y'all back in the building. Half-court shot for the win. Casey says, I was also surprised they donated. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Usually, they'll say, hey, if you do this, I'll donate, and then I'll do it, and then I never see them again. But like I said... You guys know I don't care too much about donos, so we're just going to keep on grinding because our big goal today is getting the new Galaxy Opals. What's good, chaps? Welcome back to the stream. Do my fade said, how many games have you played? So far today, we've played 33 games. 33 games, 33 wins in less than two hours, too. That's a very good pace. Winning 16, 17 games an hour is a really, really good pace. You Cooper said, what's up? What's good, You Cooper? Welcome back. Jacob said, do you watch TikTok? Nah, I'm more of a YouTube guy. I will say, though, every now and then, I'll get a bunch of TikToks in my reels on Instagram, and I'll just sit there and watch through a bunch of them, man. They're addicting. I just don't watch them very often. Len says, I got Kerman Washington in negative one games. Nice. Yeah, I mean, believe it or not, I got him in negative five games. Not to brag or anything. Lenacho said, where's the dono? RJL says, he lied about the dono. Tough. Hey, I don't know, man. Maybe he's getting his mom's credit card right now. Maybe he's running back to the room right now. No, I'm kidding. Splash said the man was capping. Like I said, though, it's not a big deal. What's good, Pierre? Welcome back. Gotta make that shot. Kelvin said, members, spam the Hall of Fame cap badge. Hey man, I know we have a lot of members in here, so I better see a lot of Hall of Fame caps in the chat. Darian said, are you a sneakerhead? Nah, I collect jerseys. 
I collect jerseys, not shoes. I need to get my shoe collection better, though, man, for sure. I need some shoe, new shoes to hoop in, for sure. Lil D-Max said, what's up, Duck? What's good, Lil D-Max? Welcome to the stream. And yeah, there we go. There's all the Hall of Fame caps in the chat. BK Legend, the Hall of Fame caps. My boy Jay Bucket said, if you make that half-core shot, I'm gonna dono. Little did we know, he was the Hall of Fame cap artist. Nah, Jay Buckets, he's been showing up for a while, so I'm not mad at him. Yozami says, I'm learning a lot from your streams. My capture card comes tomorrow, yes sir! Your capture card comes tomorrow, so that means you're about to start streaming too. That's big time, man. That's a big time play. Do you play 2K? Are you gonna stream 2K? Or are you gonna play another game? The new Mello says, go ahead and cop that LaMelo jersey. You know, I got my brother a LaMelo jersey for Christmas. He's a big fan of LaMelo. Now, I like LaMelo too. He's been a lot of fun to watch. He's having an awesome rookie year. He's leading rookies in every stat except for blocks, which is crazy. You know what else is crazy? My boy Keaton is now a channel member. Yes, sir, Keaton. That's what I'm talking about. Shout out to Keaton, our newest channel member. I could be wrong, but I think we officially have 75 channel members. That's a lot of channel members, man. I can't thank y'all enough for that. Shout out to all 75 members, but more importantly, shout out to my boy, Keaton. Keaton Coleman, new channel member. You love to see it. You know what else you love to see? Channel memberships, they only cost $2 a month, so if you guys have $2 per month to spare, and you really, really enjoy my channel, hey, that's a good place to spend it. Paige McKnight said, sorry I'm late, it's all good, Paige. Welcome back to the stream. Yo said, yeah bro, I've been playing 2K for years, finally decided to take it serious. Hey, good luck to you. Good luck to you. I'm glad you're enjoying the stream, glad you're learning from it. Beginner tips for new streamers. Always engage with the chat, man. I think that's the most important thing. Even though my channel isn't like super small anymore, at the end of the day, you always gotta interact with the people who support you. You gotta make sure you're persistent. Even if you have one or two viewers, you always gotta entertain those one or two viewers, so don't get too demoralized by view count. Don't get too demoralized by watch time or anything. It's a slow and steady grind and hey, I have a very supportive community. And a lot of guys in my community also stream. We all support each other, so... Nah, good luck to you. And, yeah, 2K is an awesome community at the end of the day. Especially my team. What's good, Jaden? Welcome back. The legend said, new emoji to celebrate soon? Yeah, yeah, like I said. I'm pretty sure that at 75 channel members, we get a new emoji. So, yes. New emoji coming soon. I don't know what it's gonna be, but I always want the channel members to play a part in choosing the new emojis. I know a bunch of you guys said you wanted an ambulance emoji because I always say, call an ambulance, call an ambulance. But there's already an ambulance emoji like on iPhone for Apple. So like probably not gonna make an ambulance emoji. Someone else said I should make a weed emoji, but I don't know if I should do that, so you guys give me suggestions and I'll try to give y'all something good. What's good, Frank? Faulkner, welcome back to the stream. I'm volatile, said Lamelo or Lonzo. It's so hard to pick between Lamelo and Lonzo, man. I mean, if you combine Lamelo and Lonzo, you would have a really, really good player. I mean, Lonzo, he's shooting over 40% from three point range, which is way better than Lamelo. He's also a way better defender than LaMelo, but at the same time, LaMelo is so much more aggressive. They're both amazing playmakers. They can both rebound. I mean, if you combine the two, he would get a really good player. It's so hard to pick between the two because they're both looking like pretty good NBA players. Yozami said, thanks bro, just subbed. I appreciate you, Yozami. Thank you for the sub. Welcome to Doc Nation. I promise you're not gonna regret that sub. Also, we just hit 269 likes on the stream. Shout out to my boy Jazz Fun for being the 269th like. That's what I'm talking about. 
Yates family said, make a John Wall GIF. I think I will. I think I will. A bunch of you guys were asking for that yesterday, so I'll try to get that done tonight. What's good, YBZ? Welcome back to the stream. Aiden Productions said, Doc, who's your MVP? The MVP of the first half of the season, in my opinion, is Joel Embiid. We're going to have to see, like, where these teams finish in the standings, like the 76ers, for example, the Lakers, the Nuggets, teams like that, because Jokic has a shot at MVP, but the Nuggets, they got off to a slow start, and they're trying to move up the standings. Same things with teams like the Warriors. Let's see if Steph Curry can lead the Warriors to a top four seed. Let's see if the Trailblazers can finish top three. You guys know what I mean? My, my MVP for the first half was Embiid, but we're going to have to see how these teams do in the second half of the season, too. Jamari said, should I go for D-Rob or Wes Unseld? You could go for both, because if you play 20 games of the new Spotlight Sims, I'm pretty sure that you get a lot of XP. It's either 20 or 30 games. You get a lot of XP just for playing. You can also get XP challenges done while grinding for... Galaxy Opal, John Wall, and Wes Unseld, so I say do both. Travis Scott says, I've been lurking hard, trying to get John Wall. Yes, sir, Travis. Hey, keep on grinding. Keep on grinding. Go get that John Wall. I'm telling you, he's a beast. But like I said earlier, for some reason, Streamlabs is weird, and it doesn't give you hours, like, if you're lurking, so... Maybe type, like, one letter or a period in the chat every couple minutes. Just so you get points and hours in the process. Len says, I hope you get Kermit. I appreciate you, Len. Jamari says, I'll get both. Yes, sir, I'm telling you, man. Go and get both. Go and get both. 100% worth it. You can get Wes while going for D-Rob. Hammer Time said, CP, when do you release Curry's jump shot? Uh, pretty much at the very top of his jump. That's why Curry's one of my favorite cards. Not only is the jump shot super fast, but he also shoots it at the top of the jump. Very top of his jump, just like that. And he gets there very fast. Bacto says, all I want for Christmas, all I want for Easter, is Kermit the Frog. Yeah, you're not alone. Kermit the Frog, Washington. We're going to see if we can get him today, but you never know. We're going to see if 2K's luck is on our side. Herbs said almost halfway to West Unselled. Yes, sir, Herbs. Hey, a lot of you guys in the chat are going for West Unselled. Herbs, Jamari. I know a lot of you guys are going to like that West Unselled. No Limit Zoe said he's also close to West Unselled. Travis Scott said, I'll come tell you you're the GOAT every 15 minutes. Oh, you don't have to, because I'm not the GOAT. Maybe one day, but that's not my focus. BK said John Wall is crazy. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. I couldn't agree more. He's 100% worth the grind. Of course, some cars like Donovan Mitchell, Galaxy Opal Mitchell, may have better value just because it takes 30 minutes to get them, but nah, John Wall's a top tier PG. Top five, no lower than top seven or eight. Plushy World says, I'm loving this stream. Keep it up. I appreciate you, Plushy. I'm loving this stream too, man. I've really enjoyed the vibes the entire time. This entire stream, I've been enjoying the vibes. It's been chill. We've been grinding. Got a lot of guys in the chat. A lot of likes on the stream. Good conversation. And we're winning every game. So that definitely plays a big role in the vibes of the stream. Don't want to shoot that. Carco said, is T-Mac better than B-Roy for Spotlight Sims? Um, T-Mac's definitely the better player, but B-Roy is like a free version of T-Mac. That's a little bit shorter. They're both super athletic, not bad defensively. I mean, they both have the same jump shot. Nah, if you like T-Mac's jump shot, you're going to love B-Roy's jump shot too. And all you have to do to get him is play some Spotlight Sims. Plus, she said, how are you able to talk for so long? I would say I drink a lot of water, but that's really not true. That's really not true. I need to I need to get some water in a second. I'll drink some water after this game, but really, I've just gotten so used to sitting here and talking the entire time. So, yeah. 
I've just gotten used to it. What's good, Luke Morgan? Welcome to the stream. Nice defense, Curry. Not good enough, though. BK said, no way. Definitely T-Mac. Yeah, yeah, like I said. T-Mac's the better player for sure. B-Roy, he's not better, but he's like a slightly worse version. T-Mac's great. Best shooting guard in the game. B-Roy, I'd say he's top 5, top 10. No lower than top 10. Great, but definitely not on T-Mac's level. Luke Morgan said, Yo! What's good, Luke, Luke Morgan? I already said hi to you, but I appreciate your hype. Jacob said, Doc, do you listen to hip-hop? Yeah. Benicio says, I'm about to finish Domination. It's taking way too long. Domination's still worth it, though. That Antoine Jameson is still very good. I'm really looking forward to seeing who the next Domination reward is. TK said, who would you start at the power forward? Between Pantheon, Zion, or Galaxy Opal PG? Um, I don't know. Zion, I like him, but I'd probably use him at the three because he's a little bit undersized for the four. But, I mean, I use Wes Unseld as the four, and he's six foot seven. I guess if I had to, I would use Zion at the four if I had to. But, I mean, the reason why is different is because Zion can play the small forward, so... In that situation, I go for PG. Extra height, great defensively. Even though I would also rather use PG at the small forward. What's up, Christy Kovac? Welcome back. BK said Zion's really good, but I love the Opal PG. Yeah, I've been hearing good things about the Opal PG. I mean, Paul George is always a fun card to use, but yeah, at the power forward, I probably would have to go with PG. Just because PG's taller, but Zion probably is the better card. I, don't, I really don't know. Luke Morgan said, is David Robinson worth it? Yeah, he is. He got updated. Not sure if you saw him, but there's no doubt that he's worth it. Is the best center in the game worth it? I'd say he is. Also, I should not have taken that shot. Nacho said, I'll be back. Sounds good, Nacho. I'll hold you to that. Aiden said the next domination needs to be a small forward and shooting guard. I wouldn't mind that. We've gotten so many wing players, but I wouldn't mind that one bit. What's good, Chagger? Welcome back to the stream. Lucid said Paul George sucks. I hate Paul George. What did Paul George do to you? I know a lot of guys make fun of Paul George, but I most certainly don't hate him. What's good, Seb C? Welcome to the stream. Fluffy Nation says, What? I got a farm triple threat again? If you want to go for this Kermit? Yes, you do. Welcome to the stream, Fluffy Nation, Seb C. Tally Johnson said, Yo, I just got Ray Allen. I'm so happy. Yes, hey. I don't blame you. That Ray Allen's very good. You know what I'm doing right now with Steph Curry? Just... Snatching back, hitting the three every time. Curry sliding a little bit. I mean, Ray Allen can do the same thing. He has really deep range. He's athletic and fast. Yeah, you can do the same thing with Ray Allen. Herb said, Doc, how do you heist? Um, exclamation point heist and enter a number. That starts the heist and then anybody who wants to join the heist does the same thing. Dallas said, bro, any luck? Had to go show love to my boy Clutch. Oh, Clutch Nation? Shout out to him. I know all about Clutch Nation. I like his content too, so shout out to you for going showing love to him. No luck yet, though. We've gotten one retro pack, and that's it. So hopefully as the stream goes on, our luck gets a little bit better. Welcome back to the stream, Dallas. Welcome back, my boy Greek Freak. My boy Owen said 9.27 thousand subs. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. 9.27 thousand subs. We began this stream with 9.23, so let's keep on grinding and maybe we can get 9.3 by the end of the stream. Nikki Boy said, what's your gamer tag? My gamer tag's the exact same as my YouTube name, CP the Doc. Man Bun said, I opened the vault, but I got 1,000 MT. Yeah, same here. 
I've gotten a thousand MT so many times a day. So many times. Like, low key, we're making a whole lot of MT from this, so. Let's just keep on keeping on, man. Keep on collecting MT, but hopefully we can get the new Opal. Hopefully. Louis says, what is a heist? It's an intense adventure where you could possibly earn or lose points. BK says, I keep on getting one token. Yeah, I've also gotten one token a lot today. I've gotten one token, badge packs, one retro pack, and of course, MT. Or the vault just doesn't open. We haven't gotten anything amazing, but hey, you guys know I have patience, so we're going to keep on playing games, opening the vault, and going from there. What's good, David? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Kyle? Kyle says, I just got back. Do you have the opal? We wouldn't still be playing if I had the opal. Actually, that's, that's not true, because we're going for a thousand wins. Splash Central says, I made a tough decision and sold my glitch James Harden. That's tough. That's tough. I mean, James Harden's very good. His price is dropping a bit, though. It's a good thing you sold him. It's a good thing you sold him. Made some MT. Kyle says, wow, you don't even know me. Yeah. I mean, I don't really care if I know people or not. I read their chats. I try to respect my viewers. Yeah, I got to welcome you to the stream and answer your question anyway, Kyle. You might not know me either, but hey, feel free to hang around, enjoy the stream, and yeah, we're going for that new Opal. Dallas says, what's a card that you use early in the game that you have a hard time letting go of? Mine was Diamond Zion. Honestly, Dallas, mine was Diamond Chris Mullen and Diamond Eddie Jones. Like, their shots on current gen and next gen, I was so good with them. I would use Pink Diamond Steph Curry, and then my shooting guard and small forward would be Eddie Jones and Chris Mullen. They were just such good spot-up shooters. Such good spot-ups. So, I would drive in, kick it out to them, and their shots were always money. They were both good defensively, and they were in my lineup for the longest until we got guys like Jack Marin, Terry Dissinger, Dwayne Wade, those guys. Opal Rick Berry, you know the vibes, man. Those guys were in my lineup for the longest, but yeah, I had to let go of them eventually. Had to. Taylor Hamilton said, I'm in school watching this. Nice. Hey, pay attention in class, but I appreciate the support. I appreciate all your support, but don't get in trouble. Don't get caught, but... Still, sit back and enjoy the stream. The Avocado guy said, Bro, Ray Allen is better Mark Price. Really? You think so? I haven't used Ray Allen, but so many guys in the chat love Ray Allen. Calling him a better Mark Price? That's not really a compliment. I know they can both shoot very well, but doesn't Ray Allen have a better shot? Isn't he taller, faster? I don't know. I seriously don't know because I haven't used them, but I do have them in the collection. Yozami says mine was definitely Glitch Zion. His jump shot is money. It took everything to sell him. I feel that, man. I feel that. Like I said, Eddie Jones. Diamond Eddie Jones. I used him for the longest. I really don't know why. I seriously don't know why. I just used him pretty much every time online and unlimited. He was always great defensively, a great shooter. But then his price eventually dropped to like 20,000 MT, so I had no choice but to sell him. Had no choice. Had to sell him, let go of him, and we got better players along the way. Christian said, do you have any advice on how to get XP challenges done the fastest? Um, I mean, at the end of the day, you get XP challenges done by buying players and doing their XP challenges, so save up MT. Save up as much MT as you can. Buy players that you need to do challenges with, do their challenges, sell them back, and buy more players. I think that's the easiest way to go around it. Avocado said, for me, Ray Allen is 10 times the player Mark Price is. Yeah, man, that's why I was so surprised that someone said 
that Ray Allen is just a slightly better version of Mark Price because I am not a fan of Mark Price, but you guys always talk about how good Ray Allen is, so that caught me off guard. Way off guard. The new Mellow said, Tell me why I'm playing versus Dark Matter Zion and Triple Threat offline. Probably because you're using a stacked team. If you're using like all Opals, all Pink Diamonds, there's a great chance you play versus other Opals, other Pink Diamonds, and I guess now other Dark Matters since they're in the game. So that's why I use this lineup of Curry and two Bronzes because our hardest matchup is usually either a Pink Diamond or a Diamond. Pretty much a guaranteed win. No matter how bad our defense is, Curry's just going to cook the other team and that's going to do it. Will Halsey said, what's up, Doc? What's good, Will? Welcome to the stream. VV Yike says, one game away from Brandon Roy. This grind is tough. Yes, it is, but one game away. You're doing an awesome job. It's not hard to win the games, but the games are so tedious and take so much time. So don't give up, VV Yikes. You're so close to the finish line. Chagger said, Doc, I hate how 2K closes servers after a while of the next 2K coming out because you grind so much just to never see anything again after two years. Yeah, it kind of sucks. I mean, to be fair, I guess it does kind of make things a bit more manageable for 2K, but I mean, I do wish they would keep the older games servers open. I completely agree. I know so many guys would love to go back and play 2K16, 2K17, all those games. I know a lot of y'all would like that, but... Sadly, it's not possible. No Limit Zoe says you better pick up Opal Curry when he drops. I'll think about it, man. I'll think about it. Like I said, Opal J. Wall is the new starting PG. Opal John Wall is my new PG now. Curry's good, but we'll have to see how good that Opal Curry ends up actually being. We're going to have to find out. Your dog water said see you later. Take it easy, dog water. Have a good night, and yeah, would not be surprised to see you back in here again. Also, ladies and gentlemen, we are 10 likes away from 300 on the stream. Thank you guys for all those likes on the stream so far, but we're about to be at 300, which is insane. You guys hit that like button for me, if you haven't already. No Limit Turtle said Curry's going to be fire. Facts. I know he's going to be fire, but it's going to be hard letting go of the pink diamond for sure. Father First said, yo, yo, what's good, Father First? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, my boy, Dynamite? What a goat. Welcome to the stream, Dynamite. Abe said, Doc, sorry for not talking much. Been here the whole time. I was just grinding. Hey, you're not the only one. I know a lot of you guys in the stream are grinding. A lot of y'all. It is not just you. No Limit Zoe said, I feel you. John Wall is definitely going to hold it down for a while. And the Pink Diamond is still fire. Facts. Exactly. I kind of want to try out Magic Johnson, though. Magic Johnson's price is going down big time. Magic Johnson's price is on a big decline, so I kind of want to try him out. I don't know, though. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of Galaxy Opal Magic? I'm surprised his price is so low, because he is very, very good. Kirsten said, damn, I'm two hours late. Hey, Kirsten, you may be two hours late, but at the end of the day, this stream is going to be six hours long, so if you hang around for the rest of the time, you're going to get to see the majority of the stream, which is a big, big dub. Hammer Time says, I don't know what it is, but shooting is way harder on next gen. Do you have any tips? So when I first started playing next gen, I was terrible with the shot meter. I was so good with the shot meter on current gen, but I was terrible with it on next gen. Turn off the shot meter, get practice with it, and I feel like it is 10 times easier shooting with the meter off in next gen. I seriously don't know what it is, but it feels like the window is so open, like so big on next gen. Why? I don't know, but it is so much easier in my opinion. What's good, 69 Weasel? Welcome to the stream. No Limit Joe said, Magic's a great pickup. It's wild he's so cheap. Bobovan said, Magic is nice. Bought him for challenges, and now I don't want to sell him back. Josiah said, I think you should get him. That's crazy. Yeah, man, like I said, 
I can't believe that Magic's going for so cheap. He's such a good PG. Fast, good defensively. I mean, he can shoot, pass. I gotta say, probably gonna pick up that Magic and use him at the one. Taco said, Doc, do you think they'll drop 20,000 XP this week? I need 20,000 for D-Rob. I mean, if they don't drop 20,000 this week, they'll drop 20,000 next week. There's still over two weeks left in the season, so... Yeah, I don't know about 20,000 this week, but... I mean, sometimes they do drop like 20,000 on Fridays, so... Yeah, maybe 20,000 on Friday. Dynamite said, congrats to all the new mods. Yes, sir. I added two new moderators. They know who they are. I'm gonna add some more eventually, because... I know who deserves that moderator badge, trust me. A lot of you guys do, but at the end of the day, I don't want to have like an insane amount of mods. I think the amount we have is good, so I'm going to add them in increments. Slowly but surely, we're going to add more mods. Is Yozami said, who do you prefer, Magic or Ben Simmons? That's so hard because like I said, I'm thinking about getting Magic. You guys are saying Magic is so good, and I've seen gameplay, I've played against him, I know that Magic is great but I haven't used him for myself. On the other hand though, I have used Ben Simmons. His only weakness is the jump shot. He's one of the best PGs in the game. He would be like top three if it wasn't for him not having a jump shot, but he has great handles. He's super fast off the dribble, great defensively, very athletic, very fun player. I mean, I would love to keep him, would love to have picked him up, but yeah, that lack of a jump shot kind of hurts with the way that I play the game. Jordan Cohen said, sorry if I'm late. You are late, but it's no problem, man. Welcome to the stream, my boy Jordan. Also, welcome to the stream, QWERTY on PS4. Welcome to the stream, b b b burner Burner says, I don't know how people hit level 40. I can't do it. It's all about managing your time, man. It's all about taking as much time as you can to grind the game. If you want to get all the way to level 40, you got to get those challenges done. And you got to watch over your time on the game. It takes time to get level 40, man, but it also takes a lot of persistence. A lot of MC. So, yeah, man. If you put your heart into it, if you put all your time into it, you're going to get it. But at the end of the day, a lot of you guys in the stream have other things to do. So, if you don't get level 40, it's completely understandable. What's good, Pierre? Welcome back to the stream. Cordy said, have you gotten the new vault card? No, not yet. Still going for him right now. Kirsten said, I'm seven games away from Wes. I put defense Kobe's on B-Roy, and he's a god with him. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. So you're about to get B-Roy. Yufei's about to get B-Roy. That's freaking awesome, man. You guys keep on grinding. Those spotlight sims. Good defense. Christian said, did you see DBG shaved his beard? Yeah, of course I did. You guys were talking about that earlier. Burner says, I already know, man. Playing versus bots is too boring for me. Oh, don't worry. I hear you on that one. Playing versus bots is super boring. Matthew Daly said, that's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir, Matthew. Welcome back to the stream, my guy. Also, what's good, Young Dagger Dick? Young Dagger said, how are you doing? I'm doing great, man. Just grinding out these final 100 games of Triple Threat offline, going for the new Opal. This is going to be a six-hour stream. We're almost at the halfway point. Let's see if we can get the new Opal. And Peja. Vineet said, yo, Doc, I sniped Steph Curry for 30k. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. One token for the boys. If we get one more token, we're at 1,269 tokens. That's pretty good. Let's give that man, Zara Smith, a new contract. And let's keep on moving. What's good, Zolan? Father first said, just hit the like button. And how does Zion play if you've played with him? Haven't played with him, but I've played against him. He's very good. If you're talking about Dark Matter Zion, he's very good. One of the best cards in the game, which is what you'd expect because he's a Dark Matter. Pierre said, Doc, I had KD on my team 
and now I don't have it anymore. I don't even have Zion or LeBron. That's tough. What happened to KD? Did he get cut from the team? Did he leave the country? Why is KD not on the team anymore? Canarsi Wu said, OMG. I opened one pack. I pulled Oval Magic now. Should I put Mitchell at the one and Magic at the two? If you want to use them together, that's the best way to go because Mitchell guarding shooting guards could be a bit of a mismatch. On the other hand though, Magic's pretty tall, so yeah, he can guard the twos while Donovan Mitchell tries to guard the ones. Kirsten said, do you think Opal Curry is going to be worth upgrading if you have John Wall? I really don't know. You guys know I really like Curry in the game and in real life. So I'm going to check him out, get some games in with him. You guys know I love the Pink Diamond Curry, but we're going to have to see how good the Galaxy Opal is when he comes out. Jacob said, because he's a free agent. Oh, oh. So your free agent cards expired. That's tough. You didn't say they were free agent cards, so that's tough. Yeah, for anybody who doesn't know, free agent cards expire after a few games. I don't think you guys knew that, so I had to enlighten y'all on that. What's good, Louie? Welcome back to the stream. RJL said Kermit's defense is insane. Yeah, for real. His defense is insane. In the thumbnail for the stream, I listed only defensive badges. Yeah, he's going to be a beast defensively. Reverse Cake said hi. I don't know if you remember me from the stream yesterday. Did you get Don Hole? No, I didn't. Welcome back, though, from yesterday. Nikki says, I sniped Galaxy Opal Jeremy Lin. Dub. DP says, I just want Kermit the Frog Washington. But it's been way too many games. It has been a lot of games. But not really. I mean... Today, we've played like not even 50 games yet, I don't think. So, we still have a whole lot of work left to do. We're going to play at least 100 this stream. So, let's keep on grinding through these games one by one. Kirsten said, does anybody know if Paige is good? I don't think he's that good. Personally, I'm not a big fan of him. If you guys have Paige, drop your opinions in the chat. But personally, not a big fan. Hadrian says, I bought a Galaxy Opal for 96k. Was it a snipe? Or was it Andrew Bogut? That's the question. Reverse said, Kermit punched someone so hard, he had fluids leaking out and needed his NBA career. I mean, I wouldn't say anybody needs an NBA career, but yeah. I think what you were trying to say is that he ended his NBA career. So that's some pretty bad spelling, but yeah. He did punch Rudy Tomjanovic very, very hard. Seb C says, I have Dark Matter Zion. Cool. I didn't ask, but that's good for you. Usually guys will say, I snipe Dark Matter Zion, or I pull Dark Matter Zion. Usually guys don't really talk in the chat about cards they have because, I mean, nobody really cares. Oh, I have Zion. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You have possession of Zion. That's crazy. That's like that dude the other day who said, Doc, tell the chat I have Don O. He wanted me to say, Attention, attention. He has Don O. No offense. I'm not trying to offend you, but yeah. Dallas said, tell the stream he has Zion. Jurassic Pooh said, what's up, Doc? You still on? Eh, I can't tell. Nah, we're still on. Been almost three hours. No sighting of the new Opal yet, but we're working on it. Nick said, how is Kermit's offense? I know his defense is best. His offense isn't bad. I mean, he has Hall of Fame quick first step, Hall of Fame downhill, posterizer, all that fancy stuff. He doesn't have range extender though. Thankfully though, you can give him range extender. So yeah, if you give him range extender, he's gonna be a different beast. 
His three-point shot's not great, not terrible either, though. He has some shooting badges, but doesn't have range, so... Yeah, if you give him a range, if you have a decent coach, and you give him a solid shoe, he can have a very good three-point shot. And, of course, giving him range is a big help. Was good volatile. Welcome back to the stream. Felipe said, is this stream going to be six hours? The answer is yes, this stream is going to be six hours. Jay Hillen said, what's good, Doc? What's good, Jay Hillen? Welcome to the stream. Also, Kelvin says, when I came back to the stream, you were saying, attention, attention. Yeah, because that's how guys want me to say. That's how guys probably want me to talk when they announce their amazing snipes and their amazing pulls and the amazing cards that they have. Welcome back to the stream, Nacho. Len said, yo, Doc. Tell the chat I have Costas Atenacumpo. Attention, attention! Len has Costas and Atenacumpo. Bronze! It was a snipe, 100k. Costas goes for like, what, 800k? So, big snipe right there. Tristan said, hey doc, I'm back. I'm home now, so I'll stay for a bit. Sounds good, Tristan. Good to have you back in the stream. Jurassic Pooh said, Duck, tell the stream I have Gold Kyle Lowry. I thought he has like a Sapphire card. Gold Kyle Lowry, now that's what I'm talking about. Kelvin said, no way. I got Dean Wade and Anthony Gill on the same refresh, and I got them each for 100 KMT. That's crazy. And Bacto says, I sniped Bronze Jalen LeCue for 100 K. You guys are going insane with these snipes. You gotta be. This is insane. I wish I got snipes like this, but nope. I never get snipes like that. I pay full price. 800k for bronze Anthony Gill. Full price 700k for bronze Costas and Antenna Kumpo. It's just, it's not pretty, man, but you gotta get the good card somehow. What's good, Corbin? Welcome back to the stream. Dallas said, tell the stream I have La Curry. Hey man, La Curry, he was making big appearances yesterday. The Luz, I'm not seeing them in as many people's names, but shout out to everybody who still has a La in their name. Tally said, this is epic. Felipe said, tell the stream I have Shaq. Deniza says, I've been lurking this long. I'm officially in the lurk gang. Yes sir, Deniza. Shout out to everybody who's lurking. Of course, all you guys who are being active in the chat. I appreciate y'all. Y'all are awesome, but shout out to everybody who's chilling, lurking in the chat too. Jeff Gaming said, yo, I sniped a bronze Cameron Payne for 99k. That's crazy. Cameron Payne's actually going for like 100k, 110k. So that's a big, big deal. Collins said, tell the chat, I sniped 72 overall Damian Dotson for 1.5 million. The funny thing about that is that I actually like Damian Dotson, but yeah, 72 overall Damian, that's a big time snipe. RJL said, Doc, attention, attention, I have Kermit the Killer. Yeah, you already said that earlier. Detail said, yo, what's up, Doc? I'm back from yesterday. What's good, Detail? Welcome back. Brian Quick said, I'm a lurker. I liked and subscribed. Hey, yes, sir, Brian. Like I always say, the rules to lurking in my stream are simple. Just like and subscribe. And yeah, Brian, you've been coming into the streams for a while. You don't talk much, but I know you're in here. So shout out to you. Deniza said, hey doc, gotta go to bed. If you stream tomorrow, I'll be there. I think I will. I don't think we're gonna get much new content tomorrow, but I will most likely stream tomorrow. Tristan says, I'm gonna start grinding through Patrick Beverly so I can start on D-Lo, yes sir. Yeah, we were talking about this yesterday. To get D-Lo, you need Pat Bev and Arenas. Nick Wright said, I like the video. I appreciate that, Nick. Thank you for the like. Flyman says, 
I sniped Dark Matter Isaac Bonga for 2 MT. That's crazy. I thought you had to pay at least 200 MT on the auction house. That's a big deal. Dark Matter Bonga for 2 MT? Now that is insane. Jacob said, yo doc, I'm gonna play basketball, but I'll still be watching you. Sounds good, Jacob. Have a good time playing basketball. Matthew R said, hey doc, what's good? Matthew R, welcome back to the stream, my brother. Game over said, do you like Halliburton? I really, I love how Ty Tyrese Halliburton, man. Well, not love like that, but yeah. I'm a big fan of his game. One of my favorite rookies for sure. One takes that new opal. Yeah, there's a picture of him in the thumbnail. What's good? I like food. Welcome back. Shagger said, yo, duck. I pulled a dark matter pineapple and an opal banana. I think that's a dub, to be honest. Yeah, sounds like a dub to me. Sounds like you're eating healthy. Casey says, attention, attention. I picked up Andrea Varniani for 200K. Dub or L? If it's the ruby for 200K, dub. If it's the diamond, L. Yes, that's how logic works. Bacto said, yo doc, what state do you reside in? Alabama. Kevin said, yo, put Kermit the Frog in the thumbnail like why you mad did. I should have, that would have been funny, but that would have also been like copying. I don't want to copy why you mad, but that's hilarious. Why you mad is funny for that. I should have thought of that. I definitely should have thought of that. What's good, Mr. Raymer? Welcome back. Lucid said, Doc, this is probably a strange question, but have you and Dominique Wilkins maintained your promo relationship you used to have? Eh, not really. Not as much. I still talk to him sometimes. He still follows me on Instagram, but not as much because usually I would do stuff pertaining to 2K with Dominique Wilkins. And of course... He hasn't gotten much content in terms of my team this year, so I haven't really posted much about him. But if he does get a Galaxy Opal or Dark Matter, I probably will hit him up, and he probably will go ahead and post that on his Instagram. Nick Riot says, I have Adrian Dantley. All I need is Opal Donovan. Do you like Adrian Dantley? Because I've said this so many times before, I know a lot of guys who think he's booty. I've seen gameplay. Doesn't seem like an insane card, but... Yeah, I mean, I still want to have him because I haven't gotten a single Ascension card in each of the first five seasons. Mr. Raymer said, you know Dominique, that's sick. Yes, sir. He follows me on Instagram still. Kirsten said, do you think Kermit's better than Antoine Jameson? Maybe not offensively, but defensively it's not even close. He's definitely better defensively, but I think I'd take Antoine offensively. Then again... If you give Kermit range extender, he hits a whole nother level. What's good, Brody? Welcome back to the stream. Tristan says, I just sniped Dark Matter Charger Box. Nice. Matthew said, got Opal Jokic and he's so good. I like Opal Jokic. I'm just not very good with the jump shot at all. I like him though. Great ball handler. Pretty athletic. Not a bad defender, but I just couldn't get the jump shot right. King Jess said CP the doc be the name. What's good, King Jess? Welcome to the stream. I like food says I just pulled Bronze Dean Wade. Is that a dub, L, or N? Huge dub. Are you kidding me? Dean Wade goes for like 500k on the auction house. That's a huge dub for sure. Mr. Raymer said, sorry, Doc, gotta go. I have some very important things to do. Keep up the grind. Hey, I appreciate you, Mr. Raymer. You keep up your grind as well, and I'll see you again soon. I'm Volatile said, thoughts on Pink Diamond Gerald Wallace. He's really good, especially defensively. I mean, you could say he's pretty similar to this new Kermit card, but not as good. Of course, Kermit, much better defensively. They're both great defensively, but... Kermit's probably better because he has more badges. Neither of them have range extender, but I know Gerald Wallace is a great release. Kermit also has a nice jump shot. They're very comparable, but yeah, nah, Gerald Wallace, he's great, especially for such a low price. Give him range extender, and he's going to be pretty great. 
The legend says, where is Dean Wade? He lives in Dubai. He lives across the world from us, so his time zone's a little bit different than ours, so that's why he's not in here right now, but you never know. This is gonna be a long stream, so maybe he'll wake up and join the stream. Owen L said, Doc, I only need Bradley Beal and James Harden challenges to get Donovan. Hey, that's nothing. You got this in the bag. With Beal, you need 26 points. With Harden, you need how many points? Um, 21, so yeah, you'll be fine. Those are two very easy challenges, and neither player is that expensive in the auction house if you don't have him yet, but I'm going to go ahead and assume you do. Tyler said, did you get Don Ole last stream? Nah. Lucid says that bruh moment when you error coded. Me? Or was it one of y'all? I don't think I've error coded very much lately. I know I've error coded before, but yeah. Hasn't happened in a long time on stream, thankfully. Bacto said, hey doc, just got pink diamonds a bonus for 36k. Wait, your message just disappeared. I was in the middle of reading it, but now it's gone. Zorli said, holy, I just hit a 3D green with Taco on Hall of Fame. Nice. I've never even shot a 3 with him, so I can't say the same. Gotta make that shot. Javen said, bro, why do they still have one token in the vault? It's already marked. That's a great question, Javen. That's a very good question. I have no idea why. I mean, at the end of the day, one token's gotta go. Why can't they use like three tokens or two tokens? Five tokens? That might be a little bit too much, but if they do make it five tokens, they could just, you know, reduce the odds a bit. But now one token still sucks. You're not getting shit with one token. Herbs said, Doc, maybe this season we both get the Ascension reward. Herbs, that would be amazing, man. We're in the same boat. We have some terrible luck with the Ascension reward, but hey man, if we get him, that will be legendary. I'm getting pretty close to him, so we'll see if we can end our streak of not getting that reward this season. Mason Soak said just got Spida. Yes sir, Mason! Congratulations on Spida. He's so easy to get, man. If you're a budget player and you don't have him, I don't know what you're doing. You're on the weed if you aren't at least going for him. Francisco said, Doc, should I save my 300 tokens for when they come out with more of those packs? Um, Loki, I don't know, man. I really don't know because I don't know when those packs are going to come out. Of course, we got to get like pack markets, like the pack market open eventually, but I have no idea when it's going to be open. So you're going to be waiting for a long time, potentially, since the token market hasn't opened since season three. Parallel said the best budget baller for cheap is hero Sean Kemp. He can shoot and play good defense. Hmm, I wouldn't say he's the best, but he is one of the best big men for sure. I mean, his hero card is so cheap. So I agree with that. What's good, Ruxy? Welcome back. Jacoby said, I got spider too. I'm telling you, man, if you're a budget player and you aren't at least going for Donovan Mitchell, you're crazy. He's a free Galaxy Opal, and if you have all the cards for him, then you can get him in like 30 minutes, no longer than an hour for sure. Marcus said, yo doc, I'm back from a four hour grind of Triple Threat Online. I got Opal Jimmy and Pink Diamond Kyrie, nice. Sounds like it was a good grind. Parallel said, what cards do I need for Spida? Uh, any Steph Curry, any Lillard, any Trailblazers player, any Delonta Sabonis, any James Harden, any Bradley Beal, and any Giannis. What's good, Aiden Lydell? Welcome back. Bad shot. Flash Gamer says, I began a grind squad, and the starting lineup is goaded. Hey, no. 
I don't doubt it one bit. I have so many cards that I've just purely grinded for. So many. I mean, my starting lineup on the main team is pretty much all rewards. I have so much MT saved up that I could spend on anybody, but I don't know. I like my reward squad too. I like food said. I didn't even notice until now that Ruby Taco has gold showtime. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. If you get a couple dunks with him, you're going to have takeover in no time. Especially if you're also blocking shots, getting rebounds, doing all those good things. Kelvin says they're on the weed. Yes, sir, Kelvin. Like I said, if you're not going for them, you're on the weeds. Jasphon said, who's a good diamond for 10k? Diamonds for 10k. There's a lot of them out there. My favorite at each position, point guard Bob Sura, shooting guard Eddie Jones. JR Smith and Fernandez are also good, but I don't know if they're 10k or not. Small forwards, you got guys like Rudy Gay. You got guys like Thurl Bailey. And yeah, I mean... Diamonds are good, but there are some Ruby players who I prefer over Diamonds, to be honest. La Legend said, my internet's on the weed. Is that your internet? Is it stream lagging? Just gotta make sure that everything's okay. Francisco said, Diamonds for 10k. Could be Jeff Petrie. He's a D-Wade clone. Or you could also get the Diamond D-Wade. Low key, I like the Diamond D-Wade's jump shot better than the Galaxy Opals. Just my opinion though. I'm Volatile said, is Sidney Wicks any good? Yeah, he is. Especially defensively. He's missing range, so you might need to give it to him. Your boy Parallel said, is Spida on next gen? My team's the exact same on current gen and next gen, so yes. You know what? I kind of just realized something. So, people love Sidney Wicks. People think Sidney Wicks is very good. Even though he doesn't have range extender. They're like, you know what? I'm going to go grind and get Sidney Wicks. Going to give him range extender. He's going to be a beast. But, even though you can give range extender to this new Kermit card, even though he's so much better defensively than Sidney Wicks, everyone's saying Kermit's trash. I kind of just thought about that. That kind of makes no sense. I mean, at the end of the day, ain't a big deal. People say what they want to say, but everyone's like, oh my gosh, Sydney is so worth it. I'm going to go over him because he's tall and has a long wingspan, but he doesn't have range. That's okay. I'll give him range. You can do the same thing for this card, this Kermit card, but I don't know. Owen said, my sister thinks it's amazing that you read messages. I appreciate that. Yeah, I try to read every message I can, but... Every now and then I'll miss a few. What's good, Lil Pooh? Welcome to the stream. Lil Legend says the stream is fine, just my internet. Okay, just making sure. Just making sure. Another retro pack. We got like six retro packs yesterday, but what do you know? We've gotten two today. At least they changed the retro pack. At least it's not like the same retro pack from yesterday. Parallel says I'm new to my team. Where do I go to get Spida? Go to Season Agendas, and you'll see the challenges needed for him. I like Food Set. I hope Aldridge is gonna. I hope Aldridge is going back to the Blazers, just because it would be nice to see him and Dame together. True. I like those Trailblazers teams, man. With Batum, Wesley Matthews, Lillard, Aldridge, Robin Lopez, Mo Williams. A column off the bench. Those are some fun teams. I would not mind seeing him back on the Trailblazers either. What's good, Billy Bob? Welcome to the stream. Vixie said, yo, have you gotten them yet? I just got here. Not yet. We've gotten two retro packs, though. I guess that's kind of something. Your boy Parallel said, easy challenges. Yes, sir. Very easy challenges, man. Like I said, you need Steph Curry, Damian Lillard, guys like that. So yeah, those guys shouldn't be too expensive on the auction house. Save up some MT, get those guys, and yeah. Get those challenges done, and you get that Galaxy Opal Spider. Very easy challenges. 
I like food said time to gamble again hey man don't gamble too much don't gamble all your points away getting those points is not easy those points are hard earned so don't spend them all too much Bacto says I don't know why it disappeared but at the end I said it was worth 36k oh got you Casey says gotta go on a run see you take it easy Casey I'll see you around Matthew said hopefully Opal Steph comes out on Friday hey man that will be awesome but we just got a pink diamond stuff on Monday so maybe next Friday instead or next Monday with new hero cards you never know Harrison Orr is in the building Harrison said what's up doc how's it going hey things are going great Harrison it's good to have you in the building my guy look who's back the goat Harrison Orr yeah I hope everything's going okay with you man I know you're looking forward to fantasy starting again tomorrow for sure or is that tonight I'm pretty sure it's tomorrow but I could be wrong what's good Cameron Jenkins Ethan L Javen says I hope we get a glitch a glitched Steph or CP3 that can dunk that would be awesome that would be pretty cool because I can't remember the last time we got a new CP3 I think it was the amethyst CP3 the last one that we got King Jess said if people don't stop saying that the challenges are easy for a good card the next challenges are gonna be harder true true but there's also reason to believe that the next challenges will be just as easy I don't know we'll have to see what's good spoken hell boy welcome to the stream you said you dropped a like hey I appreciate that shout out to spoken hell boy for dropping a like shout out to everybody who's dropped a like every single like helps the stream get out there more and more people see the streams and YouTube's algorithm and yeah you guys know the rest just generic YouTube stuff Harrison Orr said yes sir glad to be here and yeah man I've been doing well hey that's awesome to hear I've been doing well too we're back on the grind this is our third stream in three days and our ninth stream in ten days so we've been grinding let's keep it up and it's good to have you back in the building Harrison Cameron says what happened to LaColt great question man LaColt I'll say it was fun while it lasted yesterday it was hilarious in the stream but yeah slowly but surely the LaColt is dying Roxy said are you gonna stream tomorrow eh, maybe most likely yeah I think I will but it really depends on what content we get welcome back Corbin welcome back Corey as well welcome to the stream both of y'all Tristan said quick reminder 50 games away from Peja that's true that's true once this game's over 50 more wins and we get Opal Peja so we're gonna get at least one Opal this stream but if we don't get the new vault Opal not a big deal we'll get him eventually we'll grind for him most of the season free throw city said what content do you expect tomorrow if any yeah honestly I really don't expect anything I really don't expect anything I mean if I do stream tomorrow it'll probably be an XP grind and I'll probably end the stream after hitting 36 or 37 I really don't know I haven't thought that far ahead but I am looking forward to the level 36 ascension because as you guys know I'm trying to end my streak of L's in the ascension Corey says you already got Peja on another account on another account I got Peja but that was not this account Terrell said CP the doc is streaming now that's what I'm talking about yes sir Terrell I love the energy and it's good to have you back in the stream Owen L said my sister subbed to you and is watching the stream yeah you said that like 30 times and she said that like 30 times Vanit said hey doc I'm back had to go do some homework welcome back Vanit it's good to have you back 
In the time you were gone, I sadly did not get the new vault player, but we're still working on it. We've only played 49 games. This is game number 50 right here. Julian said, yo, brother, what's good? What's up, Julian? You know what's good, man. We're back on the grind. It's good to have you back. Luzid said, my vault luck just died. I started by opening packs and actually getting decent stuff. And then I got one token. That's tough. I mean, I've gotten one token so many times, I can't say it's a rare occurrence. Hopefully, you can turn your luck around very soon. Kevin says, we just hit three hours. Yes, sir. We have officially hit the three hour mark. And you guys know what that means. We are officially halfway through this stream. This stream is gonna be six hours long. We're gonna go for the new Opal, but we're gonna end the stream by getting Peja, so that would be pretty legendary if we can get both Opals, but like I said, if we get at least one, I'll be happy. What's good, Zay World? Welcome back. Splash said, do you think Galaxy Opal Stephen Curry is gonna be good? I mean, he's a Galaxy Opal. That's like the best card in the game, so of course he's gonna be good. Vivi Yikes said, do you know that the hero cards are building a portrait? Yeah, and because of that, I kind of want to, you know, see what the portrait ends up being. I don't know. I, I kind of want to collect all the cards just for the portrait, but like, I don't really care about all the coaches. I don't really care about those coach rewards, but yeah, I did know that. Francisco said, CP, can you say John Wall? If I get in a better mood, I will. I'm in a good mood, but I need something hype to happen, man. We need to get that Galaxy Opal out the vault. I need to get to a thousand wins. We need something fire to happen in the chat for me to say, John Wall. I just said it right there, but it was a sample. You guys know what I mean. What's good, Judge Fraser? Welcome back. Also, Legendary MT, welcome back. Got a lot of guys coming back in the stream. Lucid said, Doc, Galaxy Opals aren't the best. Darth Matters are the best. Hey, you spelled it wrong, Lucid. Not Darth Matter, Darth Matter. M-A-D-D-E-R. You spelled Dar Darth Matter wrong. How could you? You know so much about the game, you can't spell Darth Matter wrong. Mason Guest said, Kermit, Mike Tyson, Washington. Would have been nice seeing those two guys in the ring together. But nah. Kermit Washington, he didn't wait for a fight versus Mike Tyson. He settled with Rudy T. Luther said, I'm so uncultured, how could I? Facts. Darth Matter. Owen L said, Doc, I need Bradley Beal challenges for Spida. Nice. Hey, so get those challenges done and Spider's gonna be yours. Harrison said, I thought it was Darth Vader. Oh no, we're talking about something else. This one guy came in the stream one time, Harrison, and he didn't know how to spell Galaxy Opal. So, yeah, everyone makes fun of him for that. He spelled Galaxy wrong. He couldn't spell the word Dark Matter. Yeah, so we're just joking on him, but... Yeah, don't worry. We're not talking about Jedi and Sith. Cameron said, who is Spida? He spelled his name wrong. It's S-P-I-D-A. It's short for Donovan Mitchell. Len says, I have a Galaxy Opal and Darth Matter. Nice. Yeah, it sounds like you have all the best cars in the game. No cap. Ruxy says, what do you think about the Bulls? They're surprising this year. I didn't think the Bulls would be that good this year, but what do you know? They're in the playoff picture, which is pretty awesome. It's been a while since the Bulls have been in the playoff picture, but Zach Levine's playing well, and I think Larry Markkinen, once he gets back, he's going to give them a boost. Harrison said, that's hilarious. Oh no. Yeah, man. I don't know how you spell Dark Matter and Galaxy Opal wrong, but someone was able to do it, and... It's been a meme ever since. YBZ said, Hey Doc, the Cavaliers signed Quinn Cook. Nice. I like Quinn Cook, so I like that pickup for the Cavs, but the Lakers, 
It's too bad they dropped him, but at the end of the day, they already cut Quinn Cook once. It does not surprise me they did it again. They also left him at the, the arena after game six of the finals, so it's it was just been a tough run for Quinn Cook with the Lakers, so hopefully he can go crazy with the Cavs because I like Quinn Cook. Bacto says, I'm playing versus Peja in triple threat rip. Hey, man. Let me know what you think of Peja. Personally, I don't think he's very good, but I do know some guys who like him. My boy Ryan made a gameplay video on Peja. Made him look pretty good, so maybe it's just me. Personally, I'm not a big fan, but I'm not going to say he's bad. It's just I'm not good with him. Maxi said, do you think Wes Unseld is better as a power forward? because he's only six foot seven. Yes, I do. Of course, I mean, Wes Unseld, he's also good as a center, but no, nah, I think he's much better at the four, mainly because of his height. His height is really his only weakness. But you can't really control the fact that he's six foot seven. If his weakness was a bad three point shot, you could give him a shoe. You could use a good coach, but like, yeah, his weakness is the fact that he's six seven, you can't really do anything to make him taller, so you kind of just have to roll with him and make it work at the four, preferably. Free Throw City said, should I play Kermit the Frog at the three or the four? I think Kermit's better at the three. I think Kermit's a lot better at the three. There are so many good wing players, so many good shooting guards and small forwards in the game. I think Kermit, he would be better at versus small forwards and shooting guards, even though He's also pretty good at the four. I mean, he has all the defensive badges you need to guard big men. Lenacho says, I am tactically downgrading Bronze Dean Wade to Darth Matter Zeon. A. Hey, Dean Wade's the best card in the game, but he goes for so much MT. You might as well sell him and get Zeon or Zeon from the auction house. Harrison says, I remember that point guard West Unsell last year was a ton of fun to play with. Facts. That glitch point guard West Unsell was so good. And this new Galaxy Opal West Unsell, he's pretty much the glitch card, except he can't play the point guard. So still very good. Galaxy Opal West Unsell. Tony said, Doc, how was your day yesterday? Very good day yesterday. Pretty good day today too. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. And yeah, man, it's been a good day for me. My afternoon class was canceled, so I don't have to mute myself during the stream. And yeah, stream's been pretty good too. Judge Fraser said, do you like the Heat jerseys this year? The Heat jerseys, yeah, they're nice. I mean, the City jerseys, they're not as good as they were the last two years, but they're still pretty nice. Those new yellow Heat jerseys, though, are terrible. Those are so ugly, in my opinion. If you like those new Heat jerseys, I'm sorry if I offended you, but I don't like them one bit. Kelvin said, Doc, tell the chat I have Galaxy Apple Ray Allen. I think the chat can see you just fine. I mean, having a player that good just draws so much attention. Rob Meir said, what's up, Doc? How many games have you played? I think we've played 52 games. 52 games, 52 wins. I'd say we're doing some good work today. No Limit Zoe said those yellow jerseys. Oh yeah, I'm not a fan of those yellow jerseys. Guys in the chat are saying the Miami Pacers. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of those yellow jerseys. The Heat usually always have great jerseys, but man, those yellow jerseys are booty. I'm not a fan of those yellow jerseys. And I mean, maybe they're not that bad. Maybe it's just that the Heat makes so many good jerseys that these new ones are just, I don't know, such high expectations, but nah, they're just bad. They're really bad. A bunch of those new city jerseys, they're just really, really bad. Bacto said, which earned jersey is your favorite? Honestly, the best earned jersey, in my opinion, is the Lakers. It's pretty much the exact same as the Hollywood Knights from a few years ago, but nah, those Lakers jerseys are clean. And the Raptors, they're not too bad either. I've seen a lot of guys who like the Raptors jersey, but eh, I think the Lakers is the best. Also, the Trailblazers one 
is not bad either. And the Nuggets one's pretty cool. Harrison says, I'm going to have to see the stars like Butler and Bam have those jerseys on for me to judge them correctly. Facts. Exactly. Those Heat jerseys, they are awful for sure. Quentin said, just joined the stream. How many games have you played so far? Um, 52? I'm pretty sure this is 53. What's good, curly head Ryan? Welcome to the stream. Shadow Play said, gotta go, Doc. Good luck. Take it easy, Shadow. Appreciate you dropping by. See, Bernie said, the new Trailblazers looks like a Spurs jersey. Yeah, man, because it's just black and white and gray. Like I said, man, I like it, but it could use some color. Then again, that's kind of the gimmick of the new Trailblazers jerseys. I like the design, but it can definitely use some color. Chad said, gotta go. Take it easy, Chad. I'll see you around. Bacto said, I like the Pacers jersey because it gives me classic Pacer pinstripe vibes. I feel that, but aren't the city jerseys like pretty much the exact same? Aren't the city jerseys like just like the new urn jerseys? I could be tripping, man. I could be wrong, but aren't they super similar? The Pacers jersey is not ugly, but I thought they were very similar. Splash said, Doc, have you watched Matt Singer before? A lot of my a lot of my family watches that, man. My older brother watches it, my sister watches it, my mom likes it. Yeah. I don't really watch it, but they do, so sometimes I'll watch it with them. I like food said, I can smell this Kermit the Frog. Hey man, I can't say the same. We've played over 50 games. We still have a lot of games left, but no sign of Kermit the Frog just yet. Kermit Washington. Jazz Fawn said, I do. Yeah, I saw one time Lonzo Ball was on the Masked Singer. Chad said, are you streaming tomorrow? Um, uh, most likely yes. Most likely I will be streaming tomorrow. I haven't thought that far ahead, but there is a great chance that I will be streaming tomorrow. Kelvin says, what gives you the most nostalgia? Hmm, I don't know. There's a long list. There's a long list. And I'm getting pretty old, so I'm going to have to come back to you on that one. Judge Fraser said, do you have a PS5 or PS4? I have a PS5 and Xbox Series X. La Legend said the NBA is adopting the Oregon Ducks philosophy on switching jerseys. That's tough. That's tough. That's a good one, but yeah. That is not what I'm talking about. Especially with the Heat. Not a fan of those Heat jerseys. Harrison said they're fairly similar. I don't like how the new Pacers jerseys lines are diagonal. Facts. Facts. I agree. I completely agree. I should have said that earlier. I love the pinstripe Pacer jerseys, man, but these new Pacers jerseys, the pinstripes are diagonal. I'm not a fan of that. I do not like that. I like when the pinstripes are just straight, but yeah, these pinstripes are crooked, man. Not a big fan of that. Electric Ted said, who do you think is going to be our cartoon card for Friday? It could be Steph Curry, but we'll have to see because we just got Steph Curry. Dynamite said these la names are getting out of hand. You should have seen it yesterday. It was way worse yesterday. Judge Fraser said, do you think Jimmy Butler is underrated? Yes, I do. Lenacho said, I thought it was an Xbox 369. Facts, I forgot about those. I forgot about my Xbox 369. My limited edition, special edition, Xbox 369 Elite Pro. Xavier said, finally made it to the stream after losing my Xavier Muskies lose again. That's tough. Welcome to the stream though, Xavier. I'm sorry those Muskies took an L today, man. I'm sorry about it. Welcome to the stream though, man. Judge Fraser said, gotta go. Take it easy, Judge. Harrison said the Bucks ones are pretty cool with the antlers, though. And I low-key like the Trailblazers one and the Thunders foot on their jerseys. Facts. I like those too, man. I like those a lot. I think the best one overall is the Lakers jersey, though. 
I think that's the best earned jersey, but there are a lot of good ones. But there's also a lot of bad ones, like the Heat, but we've already talked about the Heat jersey enough. What's good, Corbin Powell? Welcome to the stream. Psycon said the Kermit's not appearing in my vault. Same here. This Kermit's not appearing in my vault either, so we gotta keep on grinding. Bobovan says, I feel like the bad magic ones are the best. Hmm. Bobovan? Low-key, I like the magic ones. The magic ones are very similar to the jazz ones. I think the jazz ones are kind of underrated. I like how the jazz are using their old colors and the musical note, the number fits perfectly right next to it. That new jazz jersey is pretty cool. And low-key, I was thinking about this. Do you guys remember that one time I made the video on ranking all the city jerseys? I could make another tier list video ranking the earned city edition jerseys, or the earned edition jerseys, but I might have to make a tier for list for that. Maybe you guys can make it for me. What do you guys think of that, if I make a video like that? Because that could be pretty fun. I gotta green that. Harrison said, definitely do that. Splash says, I remember that video. Wouldn't mind making another one like that. Legend said that would be fire. Yeah, man. Ranking those jerseys. That could be pretty fun. Those new NBA jerseys. Those earned edition jerseys. Some of them are cool. Some of them suck. Some of them are in the middle. They're meh. So, might have to make a video ranking those. Dallas says, only if you rank the Miami jersey A tier. Hey, man. Come on, Dallas. I know you're a Heat fan, but you know they're not A tier. You know they're not A tier. I know we have a bunch of Miami fans in here. Even my boy No Limit Zoe knows those are probably going to be F or D or whatever the lowest tier is. Even Heat fans know those jerseys, they're not so tough. Bobovan says that would be a cool video. Dynamite says that video would be on Fuego. Yes, sir. The only thing is... I'm not sure if anybody's made a tier list of the earned city jerseys yet. So, I might have to make that myself. Maybe one of you guys can make that. I don't know, but that's going to take a little bit of time. Recording shouldn't take too much time, though. What's good, Griffin? Welcome to the stream. Douglas said, it's all about those Celtics jerseys. Hey, Amen. Loki, not a huge fan of those Celtics jerseys. They just add green and green. I don't know, man. Not a huge fan of it, but better than the Heat jerseys, in my opinion. Actually, I don't know. I guess you'll have to see in the tier list video. Javen says, what is an earned jersey? If you made the playoffs last year in the NBA, you get the jersey, or your team gets the jersey. No Limit Zoe said, as much as I love the Heat, they're definitely F tier. Yeah, man, and Zoe's a big Heat fan. Zoe's a big fan of the South Beach, man, but yeah, gotta give those Heat jerseys F tier. Curly Head said, good shot, man. I appreciate you. Yeah, we were hitting some nice shots that game with Curry. Kelvin said, the Mavericks are at least B tier. I do like the Mavericks jerseys, but so similar to the Thunder jerseys. But then again, I never said the Thunder jersey was bad. YBZ said the Heat are dog crap this season. I wouldn't say they're dog crap. I'd say that they've had some problems with injuries. I think the injury problems are the reason why the record's not that great. Okay, that was a bad shot. I shouldn't have taken that. Electric Ted said the new Magic jerseys are fire. I like the new Magic jerseys. I like them a lot. Bacto said the problem with Celtics jerseys is that it looks like every other Celtic jersey it's hard to make a new and improved Celtic jersey. That's true. To be fair though, the Celtic jerseys, they've been the same for the last 577 years. So, yeah, making a new one is kind of hard because even if it's like a special edition jersey, you don't want to escape too far from like the Celtics usual jersey scheme. You don't want to stray too far away from that because it is a historic franchise at the end of the day. Dynamite said, uh-oh, Zoe's live in 11 minutes. Yes, yes, sir. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, I'll be there. I'm not going to be there at the beginning, but I'll be there for sure. 
at some point. You already know. Shout out to Zoe going live on YouTube. You love to see it. Billy Bob said y'all are talking about how bad the jerseys are. I just want to watch basketball. Yeah, but if the players are wearing nice jerseys, it makes watching basketball so much easier. Hadrian says, have you gotten Kermit? No. Dallas said, Miami's best four players have missed more than half the season. We got Vincent and Oak Paula as starters, and we're still a sixth seed. Yeah, I was going to say, the Heat, they aren't really dog crap. They have had some bad luck with injuries. Jimmy missed a lot of games. Bam missed some games. The Heat are going to be all right, but yeah. Gabe Vincent starting a lot of games. Kendrick Nunn's had to start some games too. Dragic has missed some time. Adebayo's missed some time. So at the end of the day, it's really all about the time that the Heat players have missed because once they get back to 100%, they're going to be hard to stop. What's good, Adams of Steven? Welcome to the stream. No Limit Zoe said, time to grind and test my luck on Triple Threat. I'll catch you later, Doc. Hey, take it easy, Zoe. Take it easy, man. Glad to see her back on the grind once again. So, you know I'll be tuned in at some point. You know I'll be tuned in. Make sure you're not live for less than two hours, and you'll see me in there for sure. Jaden said, are you going for D-Rob? Yes, I'm going for D-Rob. Of course I'm going for D-Rob. We're not going to get him first before anybody else does, but we're still going to get him. It's no rush. We're going to get him. It's going to be awesome. Legend Gaming says, my internet is legit dog water. That's tough, but hey, shout out to you for still being in here anyway. Shout out to you for still watching. Hopefully you can hear me. Hopefully you can hear what I'm saying. Hopefully your internet's not like that bad to where you can't hear me, but I appreciate you still being in here. My boy Legend. My boy Legend is a legend. Andrew Bates says, I played 500 games between Don and Terry, got nothing. I didn't get Don Ole. Thankfully I got Terry. Thankfully I got Terry, but that sucks, man. Yeah, 2K's vault luck. It can be so weird. It's so weird. I would love to get this new player sometime to stream, but it would not surprise me one bit if we don't. Monk Brown said on Bleacher Report, they have the Heat jersey ranked number three. What? Yeah, that Heat jersey? No. That Heat jersey's F tier. I'm sorry. I like the Heat. They always have such nice jerseys, but man, that new Heat jersey is terrible. Curlyhead said, wow, nice shot. Thank you, Curlyhead. 44 more wins for Peja. He might be the only Opal we get today, if we're not careful. And if 2K doesn't bless us. LaFood Steven says, I changed my name to make it more simple. I appreciate it. LaFood said, who's the biggest surprise player this year? Biggest surprise player. Hmm. Gotta be Jeremy Grant. I gotta go Jeremy Grant. I knew he was going to sign with the Pistons because he wanted a bigger role or whatever, but I did not expect him to be so good. That man, Jeremy Grant, putting up like 23, 24 a game, I did not see that one coming. Unknown Pulse said, did you hear about DBG and Ty Debo? Yeah, of course I heard about that. Dallas said, I think Miami's yellow jersey is just a big L. Facts. We've seen so many color schemes from Miami. The red, black, and white, the all white, the white out, definitely work for the heat. The all black, definitely work for the heat. The all red Christmas jersey, definitely work for the heat. I mean, they've also worn like pink jerseys, blue jerseys, pink and blue jerseys this year, but like yellow, nah. Yellow certainly doesn't work for the heat. Every other color scheme works, but yellow, nah, not a fan. Puppy Power says, what system are you playing on? Xbox. Good defense. All Ripley says, it looks like you're grinding for Peja. Yeah, but we're actually grinding for this new Kermit the Frog Washington card. If we get Peja, that's cool. Probably not going to use him. What's good, Bucket King? Welcome back to the stream. Lucid said, Julius Randle is literally carrying the Knicks. Hey, man, but... 
Also, a lot of other players are stepping up. RJ Barrett is having a career best season. Alfred Payton stepping up, playing well for the Knicks as a starting guard. Derrick Rose playing well with the Knicks. Emmanuel quickly looking like a beast. And Nerlens Noel is stepping up big with Mitchell Robinson out. So, yeah, Julius Randle is carrying, but hey, gotta give some credit to the other guys too. NYC said on the way to level 34. Not bad. I'm level 34 right now. To be fair though, I've been 34 since Monday. I haven't grinded XP since. Snag, you said, did you get the vault card yet? No. Monk Brown said 2K really needs to add double vault. Yeah, they do. It's been so long since they've done double vault, but I don't know. Hopefully one day they bring him back. Janice said, gotta go because my phone's on 2% and I don't have a charger. Take it easy, Janice. Go find a charger ASAP. Bobovin said, Beal just hurt his knee. Oh God, oh God. That's not what I'm talking about. The Wizards, they were on a roll too. They need Beal every game. That's terrible if they really lost him. Bobovin said, I think he's okay. That's good. That's very good. Because those Wizards, they need Beal. Corbin said, imagine if you get Kermit on Game 1000. That would be pretty legendary. If we get both Opals at the same time, Peja and Corbin, now that would be amazing. VV Yikes said, let's go. I got Brandon Roy. Yes, sir. Yikes. You love to see it. Congratulations on Brandon Roy. Snag you said, there hasn't been double vault since like November. Exactly. It's been so long. They need to bring it back. Especially when they decide to put these Opals in the vault. Roxy said, how is this epic stream? It's epic, just like you said. Trash Plan said, I'm back. Just wrapped up my stream. Yes, sir, Trash Plan. Welcome back. Hope you had a good stream today. LaFood said, Beal isn't playing like himself. 12 minutes, three points. Yeah, but it's a long game. It's a very long game. I hope that knee isn't too bad. I hope he's going to be all right because the Wizards, they need Beal. They need Beal and Westbrook playing well if they want to make a playoff push. Zorley said me and Badge Packs are in a very serious relationship. Yeah, you're not alone. You're not alone. I've also gotten a bunch of Badge Packs this stream, so trust me, it is not just you. Those badge packs, they might be cheating on you with me. Matthew said, Doc, do you have a dog? I have two dogs, yes. SMK says, I got Dantley from the Ascension. Do you think he's good? I've heard he's not good at all, but I haven't used him, so I can't say that I think he's bad. I've heard that he's bad, but I don't know because I haven't used him. Quentin said, Dantley is trash. It's tough. I agree. The thing is though, like I said, I haven't used him. Snag you said, I beat this kid in a my team wager for $50? Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Did he challenge you to the wager or vice versa? Make sure you don't tell 2K about that because they banned wagers. Was that just the park? I don't know, but yeah. Wagers banned. Kirsten said Dantley's not even as good as Rudy Fernandez. That's tough. Rudy Fernandez is a pretty good diamond, but Dantley's a Galaxy Opal, so he's supposed to be much better. Quentin says I got Dantley last night and he sold me in triple threat offline. Wait. Dantley sold you in triple threat offline? That's tough. Triple threat offline is the easiest game mode in the game. If Dantley's selling you in triple threat offline, that is not what I'm talking about at all. Douglas said, yo doc, I said this earlier, but I pulled both dark matters back to back. I believe you. 
Taco Fall says just bought 1.5 million MT on PX, and I'm doing a pack opening, and it was only 13 bucks on PC. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. And that shot right there, that's also what I'm talking about. All right, I think that is now like 57 wins. I really haven't kept count, but yeah, let's go and find out how many wins we have. Let's also see if we can get something from the vault. Cosmos said, have you used Pink Diamond Mark Price? Yes, and I'm not a fan. You know how I said I've heard that Dantley's not good? I know that Mark Price is not good. I am not a big fan of Mark Price. I've heard he's better on current gen, but I never play current gen, so that really doesn't matter to me. Janice said, now I gotta go. Hi, right, Janice, I'll see you around. Septic said, yo, Doc, what's your main squad in TTO? Mine is Beck, D, Mitch, and glitched, cough, cough, jazz boy. Hey. My squad is Galaxy Opal John Wall. I also use Galaxy Opal West Unsealed, and my big man is Galaxy Opal Kevin McHale. Every now and then, I'll also use someone like Terry Dissinger because he's faster, more mobile, great shooter, good spot up shooter. But yeah, my squad used to be McHale, Curry, and Carmelo. I replaced Carmelo basically with Unsealed slash Dissinger, and yeah, McHale, he's still the center. Sometimes though, I'll use Blake. Flyman said, how's life? Very good. Very good so far. Kirsten said, Mark Price is too small. He can't even stop a nosebleed. That's tough. Yeah, he's not very good defensively. Can't stop a nosebleed though? That's kind of cruel. But it's also kind of true. Kind of true. That's very true actually. Trader Joe said, what's up doc? I'm here again and again. What's good, Trader Joe? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, my boy, Weston Allen? Trader Joe, Weston. Everybody joining the stream. Say what's up to me in the chat if you haven't already. Let me know how you're doing. And if there's anybody new watching the channel, make sure to subscribe if you're enjoying what you see. Make sure to sub if you're enjoying the grind. If you guys see the sub goal at the very bottom of the screen under my face cam, Let's see if we can get there today. If you guys subscribe if you're enjoying the stream. Only if you're enjoying it though, because I don't want to force you guys to do something you don't want to do. Taco Fall said, how's your day been? Like I said, man, very good. I can't complain. Gene said, did you get Kermit yet? I got him in 10 games. Didn't have to grind. Yeah, I haven't gotten him yet. I think we've played like 58 games today. So yeah, we got to keep on playing. See if we can get him. Whenever the vault opens, it's a dub. Unless we get one token. Or MT. Or a badge pack. And that's all we've gotten today. And two retro packs. I guess those count too. Alright, let's get one more shot to fall. Hey, on the bright side, we are breezing through these games. You guys know I do this all the time though. We've been breezing through these games. Beva said, what's good, Doc? A little late. It's all good, Beva. Welcome to the stream. You're really not that late. I can't say you're that late because we're about halfway through the stream, so even though you've missed a lot, there is still a lot of game left to play. This is game number 60 right here. We've played 59 games. We've won 59 games. Let's get this win right here to make that 60 wins. And 40 more wins for a thousand. Taco Hoops said, yo! What's good, Taco Hoops? Welcome back to the stream. I had no stamina on that shot. Richard said, if you have Sonics on the Thunder team and you play, does that mean they can be used? Yes. If you're using Sonics players, and it lets you load into the game, then yes, you're fine. Justin Felty said, bro, I'm watching your video and playing. Hey, I appreciate you, Justin. I hope you're enjoying it and I hope you're winning in the game. Hope you're getting some dubs in the game. 
Good shot. Taco Hoop says, I got Rubio today. Is that a dub? Hmm. We were talking about this earlier. We were talking about this exact same thing earlier. Rubio's good, but man, there's so many good point guards in the game now. So many ways to get good point guards. Ricky Rubio's good, but that new Donovan Mitchell might be a little bit better. That new Donovan is cheaper. Well, not really. I mean, I wouldn't say cheaper, but it just takes so little to get him. I mean, you can get that Donovan in like 30 minutes. So keep that in mind. Rubio, you can also get in like 30 minutes though, because all you have to do is open packs or play triple threat online. Either one. Rubio's good, but like I said, man, so many good PGs are coming out. Vanit said, hey doc, the Pink Diamond Steph Curry and Pink Diamond Dame are available for 50k. Who should I buy? Personally, I like Steph better. I mean, the new Pink Diamond Steph is so similar to this Steph. And I like this Steph a lot, so low key, or personally, I would pick the Steph, but Dame Dalla, also not too bad. Kirsten said, Rubio ain't it. Hey, Rubio's not bad. That new Pink Diamond Rubio is not bad, but like I said, so many good point guards. We just got a Donovan Mitchell. We just got D'Angelo Russell. Of course, I have John Wall. A lot of you guys have Don Ole. I have Steph Curry. Damian Lillard just came out. There's so many good point guards available. I don't think that getting the new Ricky Rubio is 100% worth it. What's good, Maul Plays? Welcome to the stream. Magma said, did you ever get Don Ole? No, I didn't, sadly. We're going for the new one today, though. And yeah, we're starting this grind early. We're going to make sure we get him before the season's over. He can have that dunk. Let's get one more three. And that's going to be 60 games in the book. 60 games down. If we make this three. Oh yeah, that's beautiful right there. Okay, 60 games played, 60 wins. Amit says, yo, came back from practice. What's good, Amit? Welcome back to the stream. Gene said, is the free Donovan card a good choice for a lineup? I got him, but with his height, I don't know if I want him in, maybe as a sub or primarily point guard. If you do start him, you probably should start him at the PG. He's six foot one, but he does play bigger than that. Yeah, at the end of the day, I think that you probably should either bring him off the bench as a six man scorer or start him at the PG. He's definitely not bad, definitely not bad. But there's so many big point guards online, so it's really your call. If I were you, make sure to use him at the one. Benit said Donovan is nice. Facts. Now nah, Donovan's really nice. I mean, there's no way of saying he's not nice, but of course him being 6'1 makes him a bit of a liability. Lucid said, did somebody weld my vault shut? Because it's not opening. Sometimes I feel the same way. Sometimes it feels like my vault is locked shut, so that's just unlucky. Keep on winning and 2K will reward you for sure. Good shot. Kirsten says, if you have Don Ole and John Wall, there's no reason to use Mitchell. He's too small even with the wingspan. He's a beast though. He's a beast though. I have John Wall, I have Curry, and yeah, you're right, Donovan does have a big, big wingspan. For what it's worth, though, he's a fun card to use. He's a very fun card to use. Athletic, good jump shot, can create space, but yes, he's a defensive liability. Tony Esco said same, been playing for like an hour. Luna said CP the GOAT. What's up, Luna? Welcome back. The GOAT's in the building. What's good, Luna? Snag, you said not worth going for Wall because Donovan is like 80% of him. Yeah, but Wall's better at the end of the day. I will agree. I said this earlier. Donovan's better value. It takes over 30 hours to get Wall. It takes 30 minutes to get Donovan, but yeah. I like Wall a lot. I like Wall better, even though he is pretty hard to get in comparison to Donovan Mitchell. 
Kirsten said, very fun card. I'll give him that. Yeah, I'm telling you, very fun card, but not great. Like, not a competitive, not a card I'd use online, is what I'm trying to say. Hoodie said, what's up, CP? Make sure you hit the like button. Hey, I appreciate you, Jamelo. Shout out to you for joining the stream. And yeah, if you guys listen to Jamelo, hit that like button for me if you haven't already. Let's keep this stream going strong. We've been going strong for almost four hours now. Let's keep on getting these wins. Tony says, got Don and Peja yesterday. So I'm not playing till my food comes. Yes, sir, Tony. Hey, man. I didn't get Don yesterday. But we are going to get Peja today. If we don't get the new Opal, we are at least going to get Peja for sure. Justin felt he said, bro, I'm running an 85 overall Kristaps, 79 overall Caruso, 93 overall Jeff Petrie. Now that is a loaded team. I mean, I'm using Pink Diamond Steph Curry, and my other two players are Bronze Udonis Haslam and Bronze Zaire Smith. So, hey, your team is definitely better than mine. You have the one diamond, and I have the one pink diamond, but I'm out here running bronzes. Chad said, do you think those Opal coaches are worth it? Hmm. So, a lot of guys were saying that those coaches will raise all your gold badges to Hall of Fame badges, but the devs said that's not true. If that was true, I think they'd be worth it. But since it's not, I really don't think it's worth it. I mean, those coaches, very cool concepts. But, like, I mean, do you really want to lock in millions of MT just for a coach? And here's the thing, if you have a really good team, if you have really good players, if you have all the players needed to lock in for the coaches, you probably don't need the coaches because your players' attributes are already so high. So like at the end of the day, to get those coaches, you need good cards. To have good cards, you need to play the game a lot or be good at the game. And at the end of the day, I mean, I think that those coaches it's just so much to get. So much you have to get just to unlock coaches. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's worth it at this point in the game when every card's about to be so OP. Dark Matters would not be surprised if those become regular. Tony said, do you think they're going to come out with more coaches? I have no idea. Low key, I don't think so, but it would be kind of cool if they did. They announced Phil Jackson... They announced Greg Popovich, but like, if they also added other all-time coaches like Red Arbach, if they added guys like Larry Brown, that would be really cool. Flip Saunders, maybe. That would be really cool if they added more coaches, but yeah, I like the concept, but we'll have to see. Xavier said the coaches should have been added earlier in the game. Facts, because... A huge attribute boost it would have been a lot better earlier in the year but at this point in the year with all of the OP cards there's really not a need for plus 10 attribute boosts the neat said doc who's your favorite card in the game favorite card is probably galaxy opal John wall probably galaxy opal J wall but you guys know I'm always gonna like this pink diamond curry because his shots are pretty insane Andrew said, what do you think of the D-Rob update? He's looking like the best center in the game. Looking like the best Opal in the game. Yeah, D-Rob's looking like a beast. Dallas said, Bill Russell the coach? I mean, Bill Russell was a coach. If they added guys that were like player coaches, that would be really cool, for sure. Vanit said, the Diamond Steph is also very good. I agree. I agree. Diamond Steph is pretty good. Not as good as this pink diamond, though, I gotta say. LaFood said, do you think the cards will be expensive forever, even when they're outdated just because of the collection reward, which is the Dark Matter coach? Honestly, man, I really don't know. I seriously don't know. I mean, cards like Zion, Jordan, I mean, I'm assuming there's gonna be another Jordan at some point. I'm assuming there's gonna be another Zion at some point, and... Yeah, cards like Luka, Galaxy Opal, cards like Harden, Galaxy Opal, they're eventually going to go out of date, and 
I mean, that's how it is with every 2K. The cards eventually go out of date. Every single one of them. So, I don't think the prices are going to stay high forever, but I think they will stay high for a while. And, yeah, once we get more dupes, once we get, like, goat packs and stuff like last year, you guys know what's going to happen. The values of those cards is going to drop like a rock. Bailey says, you make me want to buy Steph Curry so bad. Hey, I've heard the new Steph Curry is so similar to this Steph Curry. You can get through these games so fast if you have one good shooter who's consistently hitting those shots. That's all you need to get through these games in like less than four minutes. Iced456 said, hello, what's good Iced? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up my boy, Mario's. We have 140 people in the stream. You guys, talk to me if you haven't already. Let me know how you're doing. Subscribe if you haven't already, if you're enjoying the stream, and you guys make sure to hit that like button too. We're about to hit 350 likes, so if you guys like the stream for me if you haven't already, we're going to keep grinding and we're going to keep on winning these games one by one. Bad shot. Cordy says, I got the free right, Allen. I'm all good. Yeah, like I said, man, one good shooter is all you need. Ray Allen is most certainly a good shooter. And he's so easy to get. Just get a few challenges done with Shaq, LeBron, all those guys, and yeah, you'll be good. I got to time that shot better. I got to green that. Flyman said, I've been doing XP challenges while trying to get Kermit. That's very smart. I'm going to do my XP challenges another day, though. Probably tomorrow. I don't think we're going to get any new content tomorrow, so I'll probably grind XP tomorrow. Kyle Reynolds says, I sub with notifications. Yes, sir, Kyle. Thank you for the sub. Welcome to Doc Nation. You guys follow Kyle's example if you haven't already. Join Doc Nation today. Let's keep this channel growing every single day. Hoodie Jamello says, I don't have the Shaq, and the Shaq card is worth 50k. Sad face, man. Yeah, it sucks. That Shaq card is very expensive. The Amethyst Shaq. Now, if you have the starter Shaq from the beginning of the year, then you're all right. But yeah, if you don't, you're kind of screwed because every Shaq card's expensive, even the Amethyst, which is crazy. The Legend said, 2K is capping, bro. My Donovan Mitchell just got a snatch block. Yeah, and Donovan Mitchell, I don't care what card rating he is. I don't care if he's an opal or pink diamond. He should not be doing that. The 2K King said, did you get Don Ole? No. The Neat says, I got into basketball because of Steph Curry. Hey man, Steph Curry is the reason why I shoot such deep threes in real life. I was actually thinking about this the other day. The reason why I started shooting such deep threes in high school and stuff and, you know... Whenever I play anywhere, it's because of Curry. That's the reason why I shoot from so deep. Of course, my favorite player is Carmelo. You guys know I like Derrick Rose, Kobe, guys like that. I really like Curry, though. I know I like his pink diamond in the game, but I also shoot such deep threes because of Curry in real life, changing the game. Jamelo says I have the starter Mello. I'm a diehard Mello fan. Me too. I also have Mello. I'm also a diehard Melo fan. Favorite player in the NBA. So, I also picked Carmelo. He's not very good, but like, Carmelo, big fan of him. So, I'm always going to cop his card in 2K. His pink diamond's very good. His pink diamond's great. That glitch Carmelo. Lucid said, this is embarrassing to say, but I got into basketball because of LNU. LNU got you into basketball? That's crazy. I don't think I've ever heard anybody say that. You got into basketball because of Lost and Unbound? That's crazy. Not a bad thing, because I'm glad you like basketball, but LNU, he hasn't posted in so long. Man. LNU's content was hilarious. His 1v1s were also hilarious. He almost never won, but somehow he beat Flight. Some guys like to talk about how good Flight is at basketball, but Flight lost to LNU. I think losing to LNU is literally impossible, but Flight found a way. He's improved though, for sure, but that's terrible. 
Kirsten says I got Pink Diamond Mellow on current gen because I love Mellow. But that card ain't it on current gen, so I sold him. Hey man, I hear you. I hear you. I was not a big fan of Mellow on current gen, but I promise you, he's so much better on next gen. On next gen, his shot is so nice. He doesn't step in like LeBron does from the corner. He can actually hit shots from the corner. His pink diamond was great defensively. Very athletic. I was a huge fan of the pink diamond, but yeah. Definitely better on next gen than current gen. No doubt about that. Ice said, what's your favorite Galaxy Opal? My favorite Galaxy Opal that I have is John Wall. I like Wes Unseld too, Brandon Roy. The favorite's definitely John Wall though. I like Mikhail too. 2K1v1 said, how many games are you at? We've played, I think, 62 games now. We've won all 62, gotten the vault every time, but haven't gotten that Galaxy Opal yet. So let's win this game right here and Let's see what our luck's looking like. Elmo said Kermit got that Hall of Fame face crusher. Chill. Blake said, bro, this Donovan Mitchell's ridiculous. Yeah, he is. Very fun card to use offline, but online, just not as effective all because, I mean, 6-1. A bit of a liability on defense. 64 games today, so 36 games left. Will of the God said, how happy would you be if Opal Chef Curry comes out? I mean, I'll be pretty happy, but he probably wouldn't start for me. The Pink Diamond's so good, so the Opal better be good too. Vanit said, 10 games in, no sign of Kermit for me. Yeah, but 10 games is nothing. I know some guys say they get Kermit after 10 games, but like, nah. Usually we don't get that lucky around here. I got Byron Beck after 40 games though, and then I got him the next game, and then I got him like 6 games after that, so I got like 3 Byron Becks in a 10 game span, but yeah, it took me 300 games for Terry Dissinger, so that was a grind, and yeah, I didn't get Don Ole, but to be fair, I, I didn't start playing Season 5 until last week, so I didn't really take the time to grind Triple Threat until now. La Legend said Chef Curry with the sauce, yes sir. But yeah man, if there's an Opal, I'll check him out. I'll try him out. I just don't know how good he's going to be yet. Elmo said today, I got Opal Luca and Opal T-Mac. Nice. You know what else is nice? Thank you Delay Borge for the $2 dono. That's a big dub. Alright, let's win this thing. They can take all those open shots they want to. All we have to do is shoot with Curry every time. Elmo said, Don will come back to the vault with Kermit. That's true. Yeah, he's definitely going to come back. At the end of the season, it's going to be Kermit and Don in the vault. Hopefully, though, we get Kermit before then. I would love to get him today, but eh, haven't thought that far ahead. We're just trying to get through these games one by one. Kermit will be cool, but we're also going to get pages, so that's going to be a dub as well. Septic said, Doc, does winning games give you XP? Kind of, yes. So of course to unlock cards like D'Angelo Russell, you have to play triple threat games. Online, offline, and unlimited games. So it does give you XP. But it gives you XP like challenge after challenge. For example, you have to play 10 games of triple threat for, I think, Diamond Gilbert Arenas. You also have to play 7 for Diamond Pat Beverly and seven for Pink Diamond D'Angelo Russell. So first, you gotta do the XP for Arenas, then you gotta do it for Beverly, then you gotta do it for D'Lo. You can't do it all at one time, but you can still do it, yes. Elmo says, what's your main squad? I'll show you later if you hang around. I would show you after this game, but I'm just trying to get through these games fast. I'm just trying to grind through these games as fast as we can, so... Yeah, we're just gonna bring it up the court every time, shoot the three every time. Every game is super fast. We play these games and get through them at a very fast pace. Dennis said, yo doc, did you hear about Aldridge? Yes, I did. I don't know where he's gonna go. I really have no idea. 
I can't think of many teams that could use a player like LaMarcus Aldridge, but I wouldn't mind seeing him back in Portland. I mean, they could use him because Yusuf Nurkic is hurt, so maybe he can be a center for them. Maybe he can be a pick and pop guy, post up every now and then. Even though he's not very good defensively, I wouldn't mind seeing him back in Portland. Seth said, I'm using Rubio to get this vault reward. I hear you. That new Rubio is pretty good. If you're talking about Pink Diamond Ricky Rubio, he's certainly not bad. It's just like I said earlier, there's so many good point guards available. The 2K King said Warriors could use Aldridge. I don't know. I mean, they have James Wiseman, he's a good athlete, but he's so young. They could use a more experienced big man, but no matter what team Aldridge plays for, he's going to be a defensive liability. He could be a good floor spacer though, so I see what you mean, but yeah, I don't know. Elmo said, are you a Warriors fan? Nah, not even close. Gene said, is Antoine Jameson worth it? He definitely is, yes. He's still one of the best wing players in the game, so if you aren't too lazy, hop into domination. Heat check domination. And winning on Hall of Fame is pretty easy, so get all those games done and Antoine Jameson's pretty good. What's good, Kelvin? Welcome back. Kelvin said I'm back from lurking. It's good to have you back. Also, welcome back, Terrence. Rob Meir said, how many more games for Peja? Um, 36, I'm pretty sure. I've lost count. Well, to be fair, I haven't really kept count, but yeah, I'm pretty sure 35 or 36. We'll find out once this game's over, though. What's good, Splash? Welcome back. DJ230 said, my vault refuses to open. Yeah, your vault, it must be glued shut. To be fair... My vault's like that too sometimes. What's good, Tristan? Welcome back. Flyman said, just got Mark Price. Now I gotta try and go for D-Rob. You got this. Getting D-Rob is gonna be very easy. They've given us so much XP this season that, yeah, even if you're a casual player, if you don't play much, you're gonna be fine. There's so much free XP available, it feels like. Elmo said, who's your best card? I don't know, but I have like 10 Opals. My favorite one out of those is probably John Wall, though. Ratings-wise, I think John Wall is the best card I have. Cosmos said, I was thinking about using Pink Diamond Ray Allen. Is he any good? I think Pink Diamond Ray Allen is pretty good. There were some guys in here earlier who were saying he's not very good. He's kind of like Mark Price, but there were also a bunch of guys saying he's great. It comes down to personal preference. I think he's a good card. I think he's a good player. You know what else is good? We just hit 350 likes, so thank you guys for all those likes on the stream. Y'all are some real ones for that. Snagu said, just got back from a quick workout. The legend said, let's go, yes sir. The grind continues. Flyman said, I like Ray Allen, but I can't time his jump shot. Yeah, here's the thing though. I know so many guys who were good with Ray Allen, but I also know just as many who were bad. Ray Allen's a card that is hit or miss for me. I'm not a huge fan of Ray Allen cards. The release is always a bit weird for me, which is kind of weird because he's one of the best shooters ever, so it's kind of weird that his release is just so hit or miss. One of the best shooters ever with an inconsistent release doesn't really make sense. The 2K King said, Doc, I kind of want to go for D-Rob, but I only have 32,000 XP. Do you think I could get him? If you play a lot, yes. If you don't play a lot, probably no. What's good, NX43? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up, LaFood? LaFood says, I'm back. I got timed out from, spam from spamming dubs. Who timed you out? Usually, spamming dubs is not a bad thing. Yeah, usually after donos, everybody spams dubs, so I don't know why you got timed out, but welcome back, LaFood. 
BCTO says, I got Terry first game. You've said that like 30 times now. Lucid said Ray Allen's release is money. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's hit or miss. It's seriously hit or miss. I mean, I've been good with some Ray Allen cards before. I've been bad with some too. The release for me is just hit or miss. Lenacho said Ray Allen's release is, ca is cash. Yeah, man. I mean, he's one of the best shooters ever. It's so weird that so many guys have problems with the release. Nice block by Curry. Alex said Ray Allen's release is effortless after a few games. So you're saying you gotta get used to it. That makes sense, but I haven't really used it. I liked the Ruby Ray Allen a little bit, but I don't know, man. Ray Allen cards, the hit or miss. Last year in 2K20, was not a huge fan of Ray Allen, but like I said, his Ruby wasn't bad this year, but haven't tried the Pink Diamond yet. What's good? Stamatios, welcome to the stream. NX43 said I still haven't gotten Kermit. Same here, man. I haven't gotten Kermit either. Like I've been saying, though, we're going to get at least one Opal, man. We're going to get Peja for sure, and I would love to get Kermit too, but haven't seen him yet, and it's been almost 70 games. Snag, you said who's better, Buddy or Ray? I'd say Ray's the better player, but... I mean, we were just having a conversation about how people don't like Ray Allen, so I wonder if there are guys out there who really believe Ray Allen is not as good as Buddy, but I'm not sure. What's good, Isaac? Welcome to the stream. Martin says they should have made the play my team groups play any game mode with limited in the name. That would have been cool. That would have been interesting. Yeah. Because playing unlimited can be kind of rough. Playing limited, it can be a grind too. I enjoy playing both game modes, but yeah, I think playing multiplayer game modes should be the main point of those. Lucid said Buddy ain't it. His defense is absolutely awful. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of Buddy either. But somebody did ask, is Ray Allen or Buddy better? I just wanted to see if anybody thinks so. Martin said, so it can be limited and unlimited? Yeah, that would be nice for sure. James F. said, is there any way to improve your chances of getting him? Um, there are some guys who believe that you can improve your chances by doing things such as making an all-bronze lineup with a bronze coach and selecting it and stuff and using bronze jerseys and a bronze ball. Some guys believe there are conspiracies, so if you want to try that, you can, but I don't believe that is true. Baba said, Buddy heals a beast. He makes every three. The new Mello said, I like Ray Allen's jumper. But Buddy's a great free card. Hey man, Ray Allen's a good free card too. Then again, I mean, Ray Allen, you need to buy cards and do challenges. I don't know. Would you guys consider Ray Allen a free card? I'd say he is. Vanit says, it is mostly luck. Yeah, yeah. It is mostly luck on here, man. We've been opening the vault plenty of times. We've made so much MT, so many tokens. We've gotten badge packs, regular packs, retro packs. I mean, what I'm trying to say is we have no problem opening the vault, but we just need that Galaxy Oval to appear inside. Seth said it's 8.32 in Alabama, so I got four hours of grinding left to do. Yeah, I live in Alabama too, so I know all about that. For me though, we're going to stream for about two more hours. We're going to hit 100 wins in Triple Threat Offline. If we don't get the new Opal, that's tough. But we'll go for him again sometime. We'll grind some Triple Threat Offline. We'll grind some other XP challenges. We'll eventually get the new Opal, but if we don't have luck today, not the biggest deal in the world. Theodore said, still live. Yes, sir, Theodore. You know me. You know that we don't have many short streams around here. These streams are usually long, grinded out. Legend said, skill-based matchmaking. Yeah, that is definitely not a thing in 2K. Skill-based matchmaking, that does not exist in 2K. They may claim it exists, but trust me, it is not skill-based. Wily Brothers said, what up? What's good, Wily Brothers? Welcome to the stream. Martin said, did you see DBG's wager? Yes, I did. And DBG lost his beard. 
Everybody's been talking about that, man. That's been the biggest talking point of the stream, low key. Calvin said DBG's shaved beard. I need to take a look at it. I knew they were playing, but yeah, I didn't know it was today until you guys told me earlier. So I'll definitely check that out later. Tacos said, guys, is there anything negative about giving your players badges? I mean, usually you give your players badges to make them better. For example, if your player is not a great shooter, you give them range extender to make them a better shooter. So they can shoot from deeper, you know? If your player is not very fast or explosive out of size ups, you give them quick first step to make them faster. Like when they first pick up the ball, start dribbling and try to drive to the rim. So you give your player badges to make them better. So yeah, I don't think there's anything too bad about giving your players badges unless you're giving players badges they don't really need. Snag, you said 2K should make a competitive triple threat online mode where if you win a certain amount of games and have a good win percentage, you get players. That would be interesting. That would be pretty good. I mean, there's a lot of things 2K should add. Of course, that's a very good idea, but also they should add a draft mode. There used to be a draft mode back in 2K18. It was pretty messed up, but it was still a draft mode. It was a good concept. I would love to see them bring that back because it's a good way to test out new cards. Of course, you can connect it to the season pass. There's so much stuff you can do with a uh, draft mode, but yeah, 2K hasn't brought it back in a long time. James F said, what is the minimum level you should be right now to get David comfortably? I'm at 32. Do you think I'm safe? Do you think I'm safe? That's such a funny way to put it. I'd say you're in a good spot, yeah. I'd say it is for sure. I think if you're in the 30s, you're good. Safe? That's a weird way to put it though. What's good, Joseph? Welcome to the stream. Come on, Vault. All right. 32 more games. That should take about two hours, maybe a little bit less. Yeah, we usually win like 16, 17 games per hour, so let's get these last two hours of the stream going and let's see if we can get to a thousand wins and let's see if we can get the new card too because we still haven't gotten them yet. No luck just yet. Flash says, why am I getting points? That's a great question. Earlier, didn't you say you wanted to stay at 269? Maybe everyone's trying to ruin that for you. What's good, Isaac? Snag you said, just chilling. If I feel like I'm not far from D-Rob, I will get him. If not, then I'll use Opal Dirk. Hey man, Opal Dirk is one of the best in the game. If you don't get D-Rob and keep on using Opal Dirk, that would not be a bad thing because that Opal Dirk's a beast. Martin said all the good players sweating unlimited or offline and triple threat online is so free. Yeah, triple threat online is free unless you don't have PlayStation Plus or Xbox Build. F9 Flame said I'm back. What's good F9? Welcome back to the stream. Also, what's up Agility? Agility said what's the best way to get XP? Uh, finish up XP challenges. Save up MT. Buy players and do their challenges. That's the best way to get MT. Or XP, excuse me. And then once you're done with their challenges, sell them back. It's that easy. Ryan said is D-Rob Opal or Dark Matter? He's Opal. SB Live said, in the blue corner, hailing from parts unknown Alabama, weighing in at a staggering 175 pounds, coming in at six foot 10 inches, CP the Doc. What's good, SB? Welcome back to the stream. Hey, you're a little bit off on the measurements, but hey, I am from Alabama. You got that right. I am in the blue corner. You're also right about that, so you're pretty much right about everything. What's good, my brother SB Live? Welcome back to the stream. 
it's good to have you back. To give you a quick update, we have not gotten the new Opal yet, but the grind continues. The grind continues. We're going for that new Opal. If we don't get him, we will certainly get Peja, though. SB Live said, six feet and 10 inches were two separate measurements. Nice. Hey, okay, I hear you. I hear you. I definitely hear you. Joseph said, how do you feel about Steady Shooter? On next gen, Steady Shooter is blinders, so I like blinders on next gen, but yeah. Steady Shooter on current gen, not that great. SB said, hope the stream's going great. It is going great. Stream's definitely going great. I really can't complain. It's been another good grind. We have a very good group in the chat right now. And we're almost at 369 likes on the stream. We should be getting there soon. And yeah, we should be getting a lot more badge packs too. All right. Right now we're at 969 wins so let's keep on winning games let's keep on doing what we're doing and yeah hopefully we get the other opal along the way but yeah we should at least get patient what's good taylor cole ryan said are you going for the vault opal or Peja? in the title it says i'm going for the opal but yeah i guess we're going for Peja too just because we don't have him yet i guess we're going for him too Amit says, I'm Jewish, and I hope Myers Leonard gets fined and suspended. Yeah, I know that he probably offended a lot of Jewish people, but I mean, Myers Leonard, I've always liked him as a player, so kind of disappointing that he did that, but keep in mind, the Heat owner is Jewish, so he definitely didn't really like what he heard from Myers. Myers, I mean, he just got to learn from his mistakes, man. That's something you should not say live. Sticks said, would Peja replace anyone in your lineup? Um, maybe one of the bronze players at the end of the bench, but nah, I'm kidding. I mean, I like Terry Dissinger better. I like Jack Marin better. Their jumpers are just so much easier, so much smoother, so yeah, they're also better defensively. I think I would not use Peja in my lineup, but it's still a good card to have, I guess. SB said you love to see it. Can't believe you're going to get Peja twice before I get him at all. Everybody like up the stream for the ultimate grinder, A. Eh? That's what I want to be, man. I may not be the best player out there. Might not be the most entertaining. Might not be the best content creator. But I do want to be one of the best grinders in the community, man. For sure. For sure. We're going to keep on grinding. We've got John Wall. we got Jameson easily. And yeah, these grinds are always a whole lot of fun to go through. We're going to get more Spotlight Sims. We're going to get more Triple Threat Offline Online players, more Unlimited players. Got to keep on grinding, man, at the end of the day, if you want to be one of the best out there. And I do. Reset YT said, CP, how's it going? I'm good, Reset YT. I'm doing great. Hope you're doing all right as well. Also, welcome to the stream, Eris. Good to have you back, Eris and Reset. SB said, Myers messed up. He apologized. One mistake shouldn't and doesn't define a person. Facts. Of course, there's going to be consequences for what Myers said, but at the end of the day, he apologized. He will learn from it, and he's still going to have a spot in the NBA. I know he doesn't play much for the Heat, but he's definitely still going to have a spot in the NBA. What's good, Shant? What's good, Miguel? Welcome back. I didn't get the Opal. Tony says, I'm thinking about picking up Magic tonight. Good idea or bad? You tell me. If you like tall PGs who are fast, they can dribble, defend, cover a lot of ground. I mean, I think Magic's going to be pretty good for you. I was also thinking about getting Magic. His price is so low, so might as well pick him up for so low. Cool Crispy said, just got Donovan Mitchell. He's awesome. Yes, sir. He's 6'1". That's the biggest weakness. He's 6'1", which makes him a bit of a liability on defense, but nah, he's still a great player. Still very fun to use. Miguel said, how many games in? 70. 70 is really not much, so I mean, I can't really get mad about, you know, playing 70 games and not getting the vault reward because I've played like 300 before and not gotten the vault reward. 
Gotta keep on grinding. Gotta keep on playing more and more. Reset YT said 2K is full of grinding. Facts. Yeah, man. Online and offline, there's always something to do, which is my favorite thing about 2K21. Cool, Crispy. I already read that. Ryan said, do you think they're going to add a new domination? They're going to add two new dominations. So there's a big reward for getting 594 stars in domination. And right now, only 395 are available, something like that. Yeah, right now there is not. I think 396 are available, so yeah. There's a big reward for 594 stars in domination, so yeah. They're going to add two more dominations. They're going to add 198 more stars. And yeah, we're probably also going to get a Dark Matter and Opal in those dominations, if I had to guess. Opal in the next one, and Dark Matter in the next one. After that. Lucid said this grind hurts me. It hurts me bad. I've never not opened the vault this much in a day ever. Hey Lucid, you've had some bad luck. You've had some bad luck. I've opened the vault, and even though I haven't gotten the new player, at least, at least, I've been getting a lot of MT, packs, and all that stuff, but man, it sucks that you've not gotten anything and that you've not been opening the vault. Jacob said I'm back. Welcome back, Jacob. LaFood said, I meant to say points, not likes. Hey, actually, I just realized. Thank you for pointing that out. We just hit 369 likes on the stream. That's big time, so thank you for pointing that out. I'm Volatile said, these Dark Matter cards are killing me. Thankfully, I haven't played versus any Dark Matters. I'm just playing versus a few Diamonds, Pink Diamonds, and Opal every now and then. We are not getting very hard matchups. What's good, Judge Fraser? Welcome back to the stream. Well, Austin said, just finished one assignment out of 100. Two hours for La Math? La Pain. Austin, do you really have 100 assignments? There's no way. I'm glad you finished up one of them, though, no matter what, but that's crazy. Keep on grinding, Austin. I'm glad you're finally starting on your work. Eris said, what's up, Doc? What's good, Eris? Ready said hi to you. Snag, you said the guy I wagered only paid up $5. He said 50. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah. He probably had a hard time explaining to his mom that he lost a game of 2K and had to pay up, you know, $100 or $50, excuse me. So, yeah. He probably did the best he can do. For real though, he said he'd give you $50 and only gave you five. It's better than nothing, but that's crazy. I guarantee if he won the game, he would have gotten real upset with you if you'd only paid five. Like I said, it's better than nothing, but yeah, I know he would have been real mad, real hot. Well, Austin said it's not a hundred assignments, but it's way too many to look count. <laughs> It does sound like a lot. If it's too many to count, that means it's a lot for sure. Vanit says they really need to update Curry's face scans. His face scan in next gen is not too bad in my opinion. His face scan really ain't too bad, but yeah, they do need to update it to make it a bit more up to date, to say. Jacob said this video is lit. Hey, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. You know what else is lit? This man, Tacos Locos, just dropped a dono. 5.49 in euros. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, Tacos, you said some support, bro. Hey, even dropping a $1 dono, dropping 99 cents. Any dono is a big dono around here, man. Every single dono is a dub, so thank you, Tacos, for the dono. You're the man for that. And there's a thousand MT for us. I will say, we've made a lot of MT today. Yesterday we began the stream with like 830,000, so 
We've gotten a lot of MT, and using bronze players definitely helps, but yeah, at the end of the day, we don't want a thousand MT, we want that new Galaxy Opal. Thank you again, Tacos, for that dono. You are the man. Five six seven seven said, "Who's your favorite character on All American?" Uh, probably Darnell, but he's been gone for a few episodes. Ryan says, "Is it worth it to buy a Dark Matter?" Um, depends on how much MT you're willing to spend. I think you can get players who are really good for way less than Dark Matters are worth. So. I don't think it's worth it yet, because eventually we're going to see those prices drop like crazy. I'm Volatile said, give us a John Wall. Hey, look at that. I think saying John Wall triggered that dono. There's another 549 euro dono from my boy Tacos. Hey, shout out to you Tacos. Those two donos were the first two times you ever donoed, so big shout out to you. Thank you for those donos. You're awesome. Can't thank you enough for that. Like I said before, man, you guys do not have to donate money to support the channel. All you guys have to do is be here. Be here, like the stream, subscribe to the channel, but whenever you guys go above and beyond and drop a dono, it always gets me hyped, it always gets the chat hyped. I mean, look at the chat right now. Jay Hillen spamming dubs. D2K with that la dub. Lucid, Splash. Yeah, donos are always big dubs. So, shout out to my boy, Tacos, once again. I know his name is spelled Taxos, but Tacos Locos, I think that's a lot easier to say. What's good, Joshua? Welcome back. Let's get this low in. You can have that La Dunk. We're gonna inbound the La Ball. And we're gonna hit a La Three. Judge Fraser said, How long have you been streaming for? About four hours, 20 minutes. 420. Now, for real though, it's been about four hours and 24 minutes to be exact. So, not exactly 420, but pretty close. Tommy Gunn said, Yo, did you get Kermit yet? Haven't gotten him yet, man. Low-key, I'm losing hope. I don't know if we're going to get him this stream, but all we can do is keep on playing. We've gotten a lot of MT. We've opened the vault a lot of times. I'm glad that you got him, though. I'm glad you got him because he is looking like a beast, especially on defense. Young Reezy said, what's up? What's good, Young Reezy? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, John Foster Price? Hey, man. I'm seeing some new faces in the chat, so if any of you guys are new to my stream... Make sure to subscribe if you're enjoying what you see. This is going to be a six hour grind total. We're going to get to a thousand wins and we're going for that new Galaxy Opal. Let's see if we can get him in the last two hours of the stream. Zerst on top said, I put range on Kermit and he's a beast. Yes, he is. He's already a beast on defense, man, but giving him range makes him that all around threat. Vineet says, what happens after you reach 1,000 wins? They're going to add more wins next season. That's what happens after 1,000 wins. They add even more next season. Vineet says, can you play more than 1,000 wins? Yeah, I mean, you're not going to get anything. You can open the vault, but... You're not going to get anything like Peja, for example. Angel said, how you doing, Doc? I'm good, Angel. How are you doing? Welcome to the stream, Angel. Also, what's good, Andrews Gaming. La Legend says, I'm second in hours. Yes, sir, La Legend. Hey, I'm not sure if you're about to catch Casey, though. My boy Casey's about to hit 40 hours. That's crazy. Hey, number two in hours, though, La Legend. That is a La Dub, for sure. Fat boy said, what's up, Doc? What's good, fat boy? Welcome to the stream. The new Melo said, what is your favorite card art in the game? Mine is Colin Sexton. I think the best card art is probably Hero Zion. Of course, I don't have him, but the card art, it's very, very nice. Corey said, Jose Calderon has a sweet release. 
Hey, that new Jose Calderon is pretty good. And all you have to do to get him is win one little weekly challenge game. That's literally all you have to do. Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! The legend said, I told YBZ I was getting number two in hours, and I did. Yes, sir. I believed it, too. I knew you'd get there eventually. Snag, you said bye. See you guys. Hey, take it easy, Snag. I will see you around. Kelvin says, I don't know what I should say, so I will lurk a little bit. Hey, man, Kelvin, I thought you always have things to say. But hey, feel free to lurk. You know that all you have to do is like the stream and sub for permission to lurk. Good shot, Curry. Backdo said, Doc, I just got Kermit after a nice, nice long shower. After not opening the vault for 10 games. Nice. That gotta feel good, man. You were probably so pissed about the vault not opening, but what do you know? It opened and you got Kermit. Kirsten said, I gotta go make dinner, my man. I'll catch you later. Sounds good, Kirsten. Hey, go do what you gotta do. Go and make a fire dinner. And I'll see you again soon, for sure. Casey said, YBZ is going to grind those hours just to get the number two spot back. Facts. Hey, I'm not going to lie, man. La Legend might have woken up a monster, man. YBZ, he's always in the streams. He might be more active in the chat all because of that. Zerst on top said, I'm still grinding vault. I haven't gotten a single Retro 2K pack. I've gotten three Retro 2K packs. But I would trade all those packs. I'd trade all of my badge packs. I would give all those up just to get that opal for sure. Jacob said you make Curry's build better. Hey man, we are very good with them. We make those shots look easy. And he can dribble like crazy, get to the rim. Yeah, this Curry's pretty good. I'm Volatile said in your opinion, who's the GOAT? I don't think there is a GOAT in my opinion. Angel Lopez says I have all the dark matters. Nobody cares. Kirsten says, I'll try to make it back before the end. A, hey, would love to see you back in here. But like I said, if you have things to do, if you can't make it back, it ain't a big deal. I'm just glad you can stop by for a little while. You guys stopping in here for a little while, that's all that matters, man. That's all I need. Fatboy said, Doc, what is the best technique to win spotlights on current gen? Defense is the most important thing. I've heard that defensive settings can really, really help. Of course, I'm on next gen. I'm on next gen, so we didn't really need defensive settings. We didn't need any settings at all, actually. All we did was just lock in, and every game was an easy win. Every game was a very easy win, all because we have a good team. So on current gen, if you have defensive settings on, if you have good defenders like Jonathan Isaac, if you have good big men who can grab rebounds, that's really the most important thing. Because the CPU loves to make some BS shots. They also love to grab offensive rebounds. I mean, the CPU really loves to BS you, so... If you have players who can lock up on defense and grab rebounds, you're gonna be alright. YBZ said, if I can't get number two back, I'll secure number three. Hey man, I mean, you're locked in there at number three, YBZ. Um, number four in ours is Flurry 2K, and... He is about, what, three hours behind you? That's not a big deficit, but yeah. I'd say you have a pretty secure lead on number two right now, or number three right now, but you never know. Me saying that might wake up a monster in Flurry 2K. Nicholas said, look at Curry, man. Facts. So inspirational. If we win this game, if we win this game, all we have to do is win 25 more, and we're at a thousand wins, so let's step up to half court. Let's knock down this three. And there we go. 25 games to go for Peja. And hopefully we get Kermit along the way. Volatile said, since when was Hall of Fame Skull Crusher added to the game? I think it's a special badge for just Kermit Washington because he punched Rudy T so hard. He almost died. Gotta say it how it is. Alright guys, 25 more games. 
Dallas said Kermit incoming. Not now, but it's gonna happen eventually. If not this stream, it'll happen again sometime. I mean, Dallas, let's be honest. We all knew it was gonna be one token. We all knew good and well it was about to be one token. Let's keep on grinding though, and let's keep on getting through these games fast. You guys know there's gonna be a six hour stream, so you guys sit back, relax, enjoy the rest of it because yeah, we're only gonna be live for like an hour 30 longer. We have 25 games left. That's not gonna take two hours, so let's keep on moving through these games. Tommy Gunn said it's gonna happen within the next hour. Now that would be inspirational stuff right there. That would be real inspirational. We've been going for over four hours, over four and a half hours now. Winning all the games, destroying the league. And yeah, making our way closer and closer to a thousand games, so. What's gonna happen first? Peja or Kermit? My guess is Peja, but shout out to you guys for believing in the fact that we might get Kermit first. William said, what's up, Doc? I'm late. What's good, William? Welcome to the stream. Hey, you are a little bit late, but you came at the last stretch. You came for a good time. We have 25 games left. We've played 75. 75 games played, 75 wins. Going for Kermit, man. Let's see if we can get him in the last 25 games. Casey said, Do you really have to end the stream in one and a half hours? Uh, not necessarily. So, I was thinking that 100 wins is going to take about six hours. So, the stream's not going to be exactly six hours long. We're going to play for six hours, though, and then we're going to raid as usual. And then we're probably going to be back tomorrow, most likely grinding XP. Brenty said, yo, what's up, CP? What's good, Brenty? Welcome back to the stream. Judge Fraser said, who's your favorite team? In the NBA, my favorite team is the Knicks. Hey, man, if you've been watching me for a while, you know that. I mean, then again, I say it all the time. Knicks fan. I'm a Knicks man. So, gotta keep on rooting for the Knicks. YBZ said, Miss Piggy would not tolerate the Kermit slander. Facts. You guys chill with the Kermit slander. Kermit Washington, that man's a beast. He's missing range, but he's a beast. Another game, another win, another crack of the vault. Zerst on top said, Seeker code when you're opening the vault is up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start. Let's try it. Zerst on top said, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start. It got the vault open, but there's no way we actually get the opal. I don't think that cheat code was real. I think that cheat code was for one token. Hey, that code gets the vault open, but spamming A gets the vault open too. Good cheat code, but nah. We're just gonna keep on rolling with spamming A. Imagine if I'd actually gotten him right there. That would have been crazy. I would have had to make a video about that. About that cheat code. That would have been the biggest coincidence ever. That would have been legendary. Darian Lewis says on level 27, is it too late to go for D-Rob? Nah, there's over two weeks left in the season and a lot of free XP available, so you have a lot of time. You have a whole lot of time. And it's no rush either. Brenty says, what if he meant the buttons on the left side and not the actual stick? Um, I didn't use any of the sticks. I pressed the left, right, left, right buttons. Good shot, Curry. Volatile said, was it up, up, down, down, left, right? Yeah, and then left, right again. That was a good pass. Muhammad says I'm level 20. Can I get level 40 in time? Maybe. I mean, I don't know how much you play the game. I don't know how good you are at the game. I don't know what level any of you guys are, unless you tell me, so... No matter what level you are, there's no guarantee you get level 40. You're gonna have to put in the work yourself. Just because I think you're getting level 40, does not mean you're getting 40. Yozami says, I right, bro, I'm out, gotta head to work, see you tomorrow. Sounds good, Yozami. It was good to have you, man. New sub right there, so big shout out to you. Thank you for showing love, and hey, 
have a good time at work or as good of a time as possible and looking forward to your capture card coming in. Legend said I'm a fat level one. Yes, sir. I'm telling you, man, doesn't matter what level you are. This man legend knows he's still getting 40. Spider-Man said, hi doc, what's good Spider-Man? Games TV said, you're on the single player, triple threat offline leaderboards. Nice. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. I wonder how many wins it says that I have on the leaderboards. I'm curious. YBZ said, I did the Kermit code and things in my room levitated. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. I would try the same thing, but spamming A works just as well. Wiley said 81. Kobe on likes. Uh, 381 to be exact, but 381, 81, pretty much the same thing. What's good, Sin City? Welcome back to the stream. Miguel said, how do you check the leaderboard? Go to the community hub, and that's how you do it. Oh, come on. Haslam has to block that. Brenty said, CP, you're probably going to get Peja soon. Yeah, we're going to have Peja in less than two hours. We might get a thousand wins before we get the new Kermit card, so... Yeah, you're right about that. I would not be surprised if we get Peja before we get Kermit. Judge Fraser said, gotta go to sleep. Take it easy, Judge. I'll see you around. Brian Pham said, what's up? What's good, Fammy Ice? Welcome to the stream, my boy, Fam. It's good to have you in the building. Fam, we've been going for over four hours, haven't gotten the new card yet. But yeah, I mean, no matter how long it takes, y'all know we're eventually going to get this card. Oh, come on, Curry. It's got to be green. Laker fan said, call an ambulance. Hey, that was a pretty bad crossover, man. I definitely should have said, call an ambulance. I definitely should have said it. Corey said, am I the only person that can't shoot with Diamond Devin Booker? I don't know. I've never used Diamond Devin Booker, so that's a question for the chat to answer. Pedro said, hi, bro. How are you? I'm good, Pedro. How are you doing? Brian says, I couldn't get the Don Ol card. Hey, he's going to be back at the end of the season, though, so you're going to have another chance. Keep on going for Donovan Mitchell instead. Go and get him if you haven't already gotten him. 5677 said, Doc, who do you think Drummond's going to go to? I think the Raptors, but we're going to have to see. I'm thinking the Raptors want him the most. I know the Celtics do, too. What's good, Nathaniel? Welcome back to the stream. Love Felipe said, attention, attention. I have Silver Isaac Bonga. Yes, sir. Brian said these spotlights are so hard. Yeah, they are. They really are. I mean, especially on current gen. I'm assuming you don't have the next-gen console yet, so... Yeah, playing versus such good teams, guys like John Havlicek, it's not easy, but if you pick up some good defenders, you're gonna be fine. And guys who can rebound. It really does help a lot. Christian said, what up, Doc? What's good, Christian? Welcome to the stream. Brenty said, CP, just got home from basketball practice. I was knocking down my shots. I used to be hecka inconsistent. Hey, I feel you, man. My junior, senior year, I became an excellent three-point shooter, but my freshman year, I couldn't buy a shot for sure. Jimster Shot said, hey, Doc, sorry. Just got in the stream. Was out with friends all day. It's all good, Jimster. Welcome to the stream, my brother. It's good to have you. Ladies and gentlemen, 22 more games left. 22 more games left to win for Galaxy Opal Peja. Are we going to get the new Opal before? I don't think so, but there's only one way to find out. Kareem said, why do you use bronze players? Because you get easier matchups. 
Notice how I'm playing versus gold Kyle Kuzma and gold Eric Gordon and then pink diamond LeBron. We're getting open shots every time. The CPU just can't guard. Nathaniel said, what does CP mean? It's my initials. Nathaniel Walsh said, almost a Peja. Facts, we are getting close. Volatile said, Peja gameplay? Nah, I've already done gameplay with Peja and I don't like him. Doc Adams said, I'm alive. Barely got a mind grade, hey. That's tough that you have a mind grade, but I'm glad you're still alive. Welcome to the stream, my boy, Doc Adams. He always shows up at some point. It's good to have you in the stream, Doc Adams. Hey, I hope you feel better ASAP. Oh, call an ambulance, call an ambulance. What's good, Seth? Welcome back to the stream. Legend said so close, yes sir. Getting closer and closer every game. And these games are going by so fast that we're going to be at Peja in no time. These last 22 games, they're about to fly by. Y'all already know. What's up, Rayhan Tick? Welcome to the stream. Felipe said, you're going to get Kermit in this one. I'm calling it. Hmm. Let's see if you're correct. Jim Shot said, level 38. That's a dub. Kareem said, I've seen you do a 12-hour stream grinding domination. That was insane. Facts, man. Facts. The channel was so much smaller back then, but those streams were still a lot of fun. Those streams were a whole lot of fun. We did a 10-hour stream, or two 10-hour streams. I mean, two 11-hour streams last week. Those were some huge grinds. And then we went for nine hours the next day, so we've been doing a lot of grinding lately, and yeah. Six hour stream yesterday, another six hour stream today. Dark Cloud said, bro, you're goaded. I appreciate you, Dark Cloud. The new Mellow said, if you want Kermit, you gotta sacrifice something to the 2K gods. That's true, that's true. I've heard that one before. So I have a bunch of pink diamonds in my vault, or not in my vault, in my unopened packs. I might have to sacrifice one of these guys. We've had some good luck, but Maybe sacrificing one of these three Byron Becks is going to give us some luck. I don't know though, man, because I'm just going to try to keep on grinding through these games as fast as I can, but I'm going to think about that. I'm going to consider that. I'm definitely going to consider that. Nathaniel said, Kermit right here, I'm going to give you the luck. Hey, I need all the luck I can get for sure. So thanks for all those four-leaf clovers. Let's see if they help us out in the coming games. Keaton said, Doc, when are you stopping the stream? It's going to be about six hours long, and right now it's been about four hours, 40 minutes long. So we have a lot of game left to play. Stream's not going to be over like too soon, but we will be over sometime in the next two hours. Less than two hours. A little over one hour to be exact. Safe said, is Kermit hard to get? For some people, yes, because the odds of getting them, they're so low. Jimster said it's tough playing on current gen. Gotta play current gen until my Xbox comes back from Microsoft. That's right, that's right. I know you had the next gen console, but yeah. You said it was in the shop. I hope they get it back to you as soon as possible, man, because current gen, it is kind of hard. Especially compared to next gen. Next gen just feels so much easier. What's good, Electric Ted? Welcome back to the stream. Keaton said, bet I love the streams. Hey. So you're not upset that this stream is going to be long. Hey, I love to hear it. Yeah, this stream is going to go on for a little while longer. I'm going to see if we can get some good luck in the vault. Le Felipe said, I guarantee you're going to get Kermit. You guarantee it, huh? Hey, man, I hope you're correct. I hope you're correct. It sounds like you have some magical powers you're not telling me about. Let's see if we can get Kermit, though. I mean, if we don't, I'm not going to cry about it, but it will be nice to get him the first day he comes out. Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! He got right back up, but yeah, we made him slip. Jimster said, I've still been keeping up with the XP. I just prefer next gen. You still motivate me. Hey, I'm glad I do. I'm very glad I do. 
Whenever someone says I motivate them, it means a lot. Because I'm just a dude. A weird looking ugly dude who plays 2K. Goes to the gym a couple times a day. Does homework. Doesn't pay attention to class though. I'm glad I can inspire you though. Hey, even though I don't pay attention, I still have all A's, so we'll take those. Oh, come on. Should have blocked that. Kareem said bonus MTB event is really helping. Yeah, facts. I'm not getting much more MT from these games, but hey, we are making a lot of MT and getting a lot of it out the vault too. Tristan said, Doc, man, you're my favorite YouTuber. I appreciate you, Tristan. Some of you guys tell me that sometimes. It really means a lot every time. Nice shot. I think that is 20 games remaining. 20 games remaining. We win about 17 or 16 games in one hour, so... Yeah. Sounds like we have a little bit over an hour left in the stream. Tommy Gunn said, time for Le Kermit. Nah, no way. Not right here. It is going to be one token again. We've gotten one token a lot this stream. We've also gotten a lot of badge packs. 20 games remaining for anybody who's wondering, so... Let's get started on the final 20. Jimster said D-Rob's going to be a beast. For sure, for sure. I know a bunch of guys are a bit disappointed in D-Rob, but... He's certainly still a beast. Shiz C said, what's up? I finally did my selective. High school test. Yes, sir. That's what I'm talking about, man. Welcome to the stream. And glad you got that test out of the way. Casey said Streamlabs still hasn't done the sub glitch thing yet. Exactly. The key word is yet. The key word is yet. They usually do it once per stream. I don't know when it's going to be today, but it's going to happen at some point, for sure. Jack Mills said, could I put gold range extender on Kermit? Yes. Brenty said, CP, do you have basketball highlights on max preps? Um, nah. My team didn't post any highlights, but I do have a highlight video from high school. I also committed to play in college, but yeah, didn't play a game. I transferred, took an academic scholarship somewhere else. YBZ said, test, I got the SAT in two weeks. That's tough. You're going to kill it though, man. You're going to kill it. I never took the SAT, but I did take the ACT. The ACT was pretty chill. Kareem said, do you have all the stars in Domination? So far, yes, but I mean, we're going to be getting two more Dominations eventually, so going to have to get all the stars in those Dominations too. Lucid said, this Kid Cudi album is so goddamn good. Solid 9 out of 10, nice. Torn said, what's up, Stock? What's up, Doc? What are you doing? Playing 2K right now. Jimster said my favorite my team card is Galaxy Opal Spider. I like him too. I like John Wall better, but Spider is still a beast too. Kareem said, will the next two dominations be harder? Hopefully. The first four were way too easy. So hopefully the next one is a bit harder. Aiden said still grinding. Yes, sir. Aiden. Tommy Gunn says, I'm sure we're going to have a Dark Matter domination. Yeah, I agree. I think we're going to get one more domination for a 98 overall Galaxy Opal, and then an another domination after that for a Dark Matter player. Septic says, that was my first time redeeming something, and it was Vinsanity. Yes, sir. All right, 19 games to go. 81 games down, no Kermit. 19 games to go. Yes, sir. Fun Run Gaming said, Yo, what's up? I finally got Ray Allen, and I'm grinding for Kermit the Frog right now. Yes, sir. I'm going for him, too. Haven't had any luck, but we're going to keep on grinding. Going to keep on grinding, excuse me. 
I can't talk. Love Felipe said, Center Spud Webb is a beast. Yeah, back in NBA 2K20, he was a big time player. Jimster said, Who do you think could be the new domination reward? I have no idea. The domination rewards are so random. Guys who aren't even close to being the best ever, but are still pretty well known players. So you gotta have a good in between of like all star, all time great, because George Mikan, he's an all time great player, but nobody really thinks about him. Rolando Blackman had a great career, but nobody really talks about him. Nick Van Exel, great career. Antoine Jameson, great career. At the end of the day, I don't know who it's going to be, but it's going to be someone good. What's good, X Ace? What's up, Doc Jr.? Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. Bacto said, I just did a gameplay with Kermit, and I have to say, he can shoot the ball well, defensive beast, and worth the grind. Hey man, I could have told you that, but that's awesome that you made a gameplay. Definitely a beast on defense. Looking forward to getting him myself. Aiden said, Doc, do you think we're getting Opal, Mello, and Jimmer in a March Madness theme? I don't know. We're going to have to see. I mean, March Madness, 2K does it pretty much every year. And that's how we got Jimmer last year. That's how we also got Mello last year. That would be awesome if they brought it back, but you never know. You never know. If we do get March Madness, it probably will be this Friday. That might be how we get Curry. Because remember, he was a beast at Davidson, so maybe it is going to be March Madness this Friday. We'll have to see. Tommy Gunn says nobody talks about Rondo's rings. Yeah, man. Rajon Rondo, two-time champion, but you're right. 3-2-1 said, is Kermit worth it? He's free. Defensive beast. I mean, yeah, he's definitely worth it. All right, that's 19 games left after we hit one more shot. Jimster said, I was for real thinking about Davidson Curry. Yeah, man. He had an awesome run in the tournament, man. Awesome tournament run. Maybe we get a Curry for March Madness. What's good, Zay? Welcome back. Nathaniel Walsh said, did you ever get Don Ole? I've answered that question a thousand times now. Maybe a thousand seven. Also, Jacob, please stop spamming. You've said that message a thousand times. Maybe a thousand seven. YBZ said Jimmer didn't survive the NBA because of his big e ego. And he was not very good defensively. And of course, if you do want Jimmer to be a good NBA player, you probably need to surround him like with players who complement his skill set. Of course, in college, he was the big scorer. Surrounded by other guys who can shoot. In the NBA, I mean, he wasn't super fast. He was a great shooter, but not like a great dribbler. Someone like Kyrie, for example. Amazing shooter, but like, not much more. Bacto said, Jimmer range. Douglas said, I'm back. Any luck? Not yet. We haven't gotten the new Opal yet. I predict we're going to get Peja before we get the new Opal. John Foster said, was Derrick Rose good in college? Nah, he was terrible. That's why he got picked number one. He was so bad in college that the scouts said, oh lord, yeah, yeah. We gotta pick this guy number one. He was that bad. That trash. They were like, he's never gonna win an MVP or anything. Mello says he was off-brand Kyle Korver. Eh, I mean, Kyle Korver can't dribble like Jimmer. But to be fair... Jimmer's not, like, too great of a ball handler. Great, not a bad ball handler at all, but, like, not one of the elite ones. And in the NBA, you gotta be a great ball handler. Gotta be great at creating your own shot. Especially if you're Jimmer's height. And a liability on defense like Jimmer. What's good, Blake? Welcome back. Also, what's up, Vanit? Aiden Sullivan said, D-Rose went to Duke, right? That's a good one. 
I can't tell if you're serious or kidding. I hope you're kidding. Because I was just kidding about D-Rose being bad in college, so I hope you're kidding too. For anybody who's seriously wondering, he went to Memphis, but yeah. Sure, he went to Duke. Good defense. Aiden said, Doc, do you think they should bring back Signature Limited? If they do, it'll probably be in Retro or 2K22. I don't know if they're ever going to bring it back. Workaholic said he went to Memphis. Like I said, man, I couldn't tell if he was serious or not. I couldn't tell. You never know in the chat. I mean, look at some of the things some people say. It's so hard to tell when someone's serious. What's good, Vandy Bacon? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Fatty Buckets? Hey, Fatty Buckets, don't worry about being late. We're going to go for about one more hour, so you're not too late to where you're only going to get to watch one game, but... Yeah, it has been almost five hours, my guy. Welcome to the stream. Mal plays, said goodnight, Doc. Hey, take it easy, Mal. Have a good night. All right. 17 games to go, and we've been going for almost five hours now, so I predict that we're going to win these 17 games in one hour because we're hitting our shots with Curry. We're playing some decent defense. We're getting through these games real fast. The real question is, are we going to get the new Opal in the next 17 games? I don't think we're going to get him right here, so we're going to have to keep on moving forward, keep on grinding. 17 games to go, and yeah, we usually get 17 games done in one hour, so let's close this stream out strong. Let's see if we can get both Opals, Peja, and the new Kermit card. And yeah, we'll raid somebody, open some of our packs, and that'll be that. What's good, dog water? Welcome back to the stream. Mr. T said, how many games have you played so far? 83. 83. We're going to play 17 more, then call it a night. We began this stream with 900 wins. We're going to end at 1,000. Septic said, Doc, I'm in the stage right now, and I can't get a game. I'm an all-star one, and everyone's a superstar one and up, and doesn't want to play. That's tough. I mean, if you get a friend to play with you, that'll make things a whole lot easier. Fatty Bucket said, after last night's stream, I kept on grinding and got Don. Oh, yes, sir. I'm happy for you, Fatty Buckets. I didn't get Don. Oh, so I'm glad that you did. Don. Oh, is going to be back at the end of the season, but yeah. Sadly, we didn't get him yesterday. Aiden said, Doc, I got Dantley and Kobe Grinches on my 36 Ascension board. The Kobe Grinches? That's a dub. Dantley? Kind of an L. I've heard he's not very good. Bacto said, I'm glad to see the Knicks doing well this year. Me too, for sure. I'm a Knicks fan, and I've never been this excited about the Knicks since like 2014. 2013, 2014. Of course, in 2013, they made the playoffs. In 2014, they barely missed it, man. They made a great comeback, second half of the season, and almost got it done. Yaya said, do you think they'll update Opal Dame? Nah, I don't think so. They usually don't update cards that are already out, but I mean, what they will do is they'll give the card a dynamic duo, or they'll make the card an evolution card. That's two things they might do, but are they going to, like, make the card, like, way better? Probably not. Brady said, hey, man, I've been watching your content, and I love it, man. Keep it up. I appreciate you, Brady. I've been loving giving y'all content. I've been loving the streams. Always have a whole lot of fun with them. So, Brady, I appreciate you. Let's keep on moving forward, and let's see if we can get that opal. We've gotten a lot of MT though, man. We've gotten so much MT that I might even open some packs. That's right, packs, back-to-back -back streams. That would be crazy, for real. Hey though, man, I just noticed we just jumped up from 9.27 thousand subs all the way to 9.28, so thank you to whoever subbed. Thank you guys for helping the channel grow today. We began this stream with 9.23 thousand subs. We're now at 9.28. That's what I'm freaking talking about. So, shout out to everyone who subs. Shout out to all the new subs. 
And also shout out to all the old timers who are still in the stream. Jimster said, Doc, once my Xbox comes back, I'm streaming on Twitch. Yes, sir. I remember a few months ago, you told me that once you get next gen, you're going to start streaming. So looking forward to that for sure. You know, you got my support. Brady said, why don't you play Triple Threat online? Because this new Opal's in Triple Threat offline. The new Kermit Washington is the new Triple Threat offline reward. So that's why we're playing Triple Threat offline. Because he's the new offline reward. And he's only available in offline. Ryan said, you make Curry look like the best card in the game. Yeah, but also we play versus bad cards every game. So... Curry's very good, but definitely not the best PG. D23 said, Yo, Doc, after five hours, finally completed the fourth challenge for Dave. Yes, sir. You said you're on to the final A. Good luck in the final to you. You got this. Zay said, Are there going to be more triple threat offline rewards next season? Yes, new vault players and new players for hitting like 1,200 wins, for example. John Foster said, do you like James Wiseman in real life? Yeah, yeah, I like James Wiseman. No problem with him at all. He's raw, but he's been pretty good in spurts for the Warriors, so let's see if he can keep on developing. He's not my pick to win Rookie of the Year, but he's going to be a great NBA player. He's going to have a long career, I think. Caden says, I pulled the Opal Jordan out of the retro pack from the vault while grinding for Kermit. Hey, that's a big dub for you. You know what? I've also gotten like four retro packs, so I might have to do the same thing. Once we have a thousand wins, we're going to be done. So yeah, we'll get all of our wins that we need and then we can see if Jordan's in those packs. I doubt he's going to be, but there's only one way to find out. Love Felipe said, you're going to get Kermit this time? Hey, we'll see. We will have to see. Brady said, my idiot self thought Kermit was in Cripple Threat Online. Oh yeah, man. So Spencer Haywood is in Triple Threat Online. But I've heard Spencer Haywood's not very good. This new Kermit Washington, though, is looking like a beast. Also, I'm missing all my open threes. I don't know what I'm doing. Usually, we never miss with Steph, but... I've missed like two or three shots with TakeOver. Let's make sure we don't miss this shot though. Aiden Sig said, Doc, do you think we're getting Opal Julius Randle this season? I would love that, but we got Diamond Randle last season, so I'm thinking Pink Diamond sometime next season. I don't know. We'll have to see, but I like Julius Randle, so I would love to see him get a card. Streamline said, is Galaxy Opal Damian Lillard rare because... I never see anybody play with him. He is pretty rare because you need to have 2,000 cards to get him. So unless you're like an insanely great collector, then you're probably not going to get Dame. Because you need 2,000 cards to get him. That's a lot of cards. Brady said my sleep schedule sucks. Hey, you're not alone, man. You're not alone. Jacob said what's good. What's good? Jacob, welcome to the stream. John Foster said, have you met any NBA players? Yes, I have. I've met J.R. Smith. I've met um, Ben Simmons, Josh Hart. That's three I can think of. I want to say there's one more current NBA player. I've also met ML Carr from the old Celtics. I've met Dominique Wilkins. That's five right there. I think those are the only current players I've met. I've also met Tyrod Taylor, Travis Kelsey, Baker Mayfield. Took a picture with him. So, yeah, three NFL, about five NBA, counting legends. I think those are the main players I've met. I've also met Larry Nance Sr. I've met the Larry Nance Sr., but not his son. Joseph said, yo, bro, spotlight for Kyrie. I can't beat the 10 Hall of Fame Pelicans challenge. Hey, man, that challenge is pretty hard, but make sure you have good Pelicans. Make sure you have good Pelicans players. Good budget Pelicans players. Guys like Diamond Ingram and Diamond Randall. And those guys will help a lot, I promise. What's good, Drake? Welcome back to the stream. Mr. T said, I met Gronk like three years ago. That's so dope. That is really dope, actually. 
Zay said, would Glitch Dwight Howard be a good card? Um, it depends. I mean, if Dwight Howard is a Glitch card, I'm assuming the Glitch is going to be that he can shoot, so he probably would be a good card. I'm not sure if I'd get him, but I mean, he's a great rebounder. He would be a great defender, for sure. The jump shot would make him a great floor spacer, so wouldn't be a bad pickup. Just depends on the price. Brady says, I met Larry Johnson and, R and RJ Ryder. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Aiden says, we need a glitch Yao Ming. Hmm. We got the goat Yao Ming last year. I would love another Yao Ming like that. La Legend says, gotta quit lurking. Facts, man. You might lose all your hours. You might go down to number three. Dallas said, I met Jeremy Grant while doing a campus tour of Syracuse. That's dope. That's what's up. So you met Jeremy Grant. Aiden met Terry Rozier at an amusement park. That's really dope. John Foster met Tasho Fall. I don't know who Tacho Fall is, but I think he might have a brother in the NBA named Taco. He plays for the Celtics. Very, very popular player. Vanit says, what dame do you get if you get 2,000 cards? Galaxy Opal. I thought everyone knew that. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, Galaxy Opal Dame. He is very rare, though. Just like y'all said earlier, very rare card. Lil D Max says, I met Jay Rich at PF Chang's. That's what's up. Jimster says, we don't talk about Goat Yao Ming from 2K20. I would get destroyed by him. Hey, you're not alone. I used Goat Yao Ming. He was a beast. Super fun card to use. Him and Goat Kareem were the two best cards in the game. And that point guard Giannis was also pretty amazing. All right. I should have said this before this game started. Yeah, I should have said this way before this game started, but 14 games to go. Yeah, we're definitely gonna get these games done in less than an hour, without a doubt. I think we're definitely getting these done before the six hour mark. I wouldn't be surprised if we don't miss for the rest of the game. We've already missed like two or three shots this game, so let's see if we can green out. Jimster said, can't forget about Goat Shaq. Goat Shaq, I mean, I didn't really like his jump shot. I mean, that's the thing about Shaq. Even if he has great handles, even if he has great defense, great rebounding, great speed, he's going to be a bit of a liability because his jump shot is so ugly. So even if he can green it every now and then, just the fact that it's so bad and so hard at time is going to make Shaq a bit of a liability. Braden said, my best friend got VIP tickets from a player on the Colts and got to see in the locker room and meet the players. That is so dope. That's a big dub for sure. John Foster met Mike Miller. Grayson says, I met the Warriors GM, Bob Myers, at my birthday party. Nice. Bob Myers. Yeah, Bob Myers, he's the guy who said the Warriors are light years ahead of the rest of the league. Look at him now. Still... In the playoffs, if they had Clay, who knows how good they'd be this year. Felipe said, thoughts on Diamond Sean Kemp? Pretty underrated card. The Amethyst Sean Kemp is awesome. The Diamond is like a better version of that card. So if you like Amethyst Sean Kemp from the double takes, then you're definitely going to like the Diamond. Oh, come on. We got to make that. Let's get one more shot right here. This is the shot right here for 13 games left, if I'm not mistaken. Fear Clan says my dad met Beetlejuice. That's what I'm talking about, Beetlejuice. Now that is a dub right there. Everybody's talking about the NBA players they've met, but man, Beetlejuice, now that is the biggest dub of them all. All right, let's give Zara Smith a contract. We have 13 games left to win. Yeah, we're definitely getting these games done in less than an hour. Vanit said, hey Doc, could you do a gameplay for Pink Diamond All-Star Curry? Nah, probably not. I don't feel like getting him because 
I'm going to get him and then his price is going to go down because I think we're getting a new Curry very soon for March Madness. Yeah, I'm not going to do a gameplay for Curry. Plus, he's already been out for two days now, so I would be a little bit late. The biggest thing about doing gameplays is that you want to drop the gameplays on the day of or the day after a card comes out, but preferably the day of. So, yeah, we would be a little bit late on that one. Carson Lowe said what comes out tomorrow. Um, I don't think we're getting anything tomorrow. I'm thinking no new content tomorrow. Maybe moments, but like, I mean, we, we didn't really have any games. No NBA games lately. NBA is back now, but like, we haven't really had any games, so. Usually on Thursdays we get moments, but we already got moments on Monday, so. Yeah, probably no moments tomorrow, but maybe some new XP challenges, but at the same time, we also got new XP challenges today. We also got a new vault player today. Maybe tomorrow we're gonna get a new triple threat. Never mind. I was gonna say a new triple threat online player, but we also got one of those today too. So, yeah, I don't know what we're gonna get tomorrow. We're gonna have to see. What's good, Lydia? Welcome back to the stream. Bad shot. Jimster said, hopefully, some high XP challenges. Yeah, you know, I don't think we're gonna get any XP challenges tomorrow because David Robinson. He's going to be available on Friday, I'm thinking. So, yeah, I think that's what 2K wants. I wouldn't be surprised if someone gets him tomorrow, but I think 2K wants tomorrow to be the first day for David Robinson. I mean Friday, excuse me. They want Friday to be the first day. Troy Drop Moff said, since I'm having trouble in the Hall of Fame spotlight games, I will practice in domination and try to get Oval Antoine. You got this, man. Yeah, Hall of Fame Domination is very good practice. 100% worth it for Opal Antoine. And if you do get Opal Antoine, he's going to be a big help for you in the, the Spotlight Sim games. Don Quarius said, You think there's going to be a new Curry Friday? Either this week or next week, we're definitely getting a new Curry. It's already been confirmed we're getting a new Curry. A new Opal Curry, most likely. I don't know if it's going to be this Friday or next Friday, but I know we're getting a Curry. Dignity said, Dignity said, hey doc, you got Curry? I mean, Kermit yet? Nah, not yet. But yeah, we're going to end this stream after playing 100 games, so we'll see if we can get him in 100 games. Once this game's over, we have 12 games left. This is game number 88 right here in the books. Dallas said, I want Opal Tyler Hero. I think he's going to be a diamond or pink diamond, but Opal, I don't know about that. The Neat says, is Opal Curry going to be free? I don't think so, but we'll see. Maybe Opal Curry is going to come out on Friday, or what do you mean, Monday. Maybe he's going to be one of the new hero cards that drops on Monday. You never know, but yeah, I don't think we're going to get Opal Curry for free. I think he's going to be in packs. RJL said, Doc, you're a real grinder. I appreciate you, man. Yeah, these grinds are always a whole lot of fun, so I hope you guys have been enjoying them, and yeah. Let's keep on keeping on today. Ty Oates, you need to calm down. I'm not going to read your shit if you're spamming caps. RJL said, I hope you get Kermit. I appreciate it. Vineet says, I hope he's free. I mean, that Donovan Mitchell's already good enough for free, so I wouldn't be surprised if they don't give us another good free card, but yeah. I don't think he's going to be free. Left Felipe said the stupid vault won't open for me. It opens for me, but I never get anything good. That's the tough part. Workaholic said, grinding spotlights while streaming. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. How's your stream going? Aiden said, the last free card we're getting is Opal Clyde the Glide. Now, I like how that sounds. Yeah, Clyde the Glide, that does sound like a card 2K is going to give us for free. So, yeah, Opal Clyde instead of Opal Curry. That sounds pretty reasonable to me.
Ryan said, once you're done grinding Triple Threat offline, will you grind Triple Threat online? There's no reason to. I mean, the Spencer Haywood sucks, and there's no wheels on the boards anymore, so I wouldn't get any more MT than I am from doing this, and yeah, Spencer Haywood sucks. RJL said, Ty, chill out. Yeah, chill out. I mean, I literally have 116 people in here. I can't read every single message, so... Yeah, I don't get why guys like to yell when I can't see their messages. I mean, it doesn't really help me see their message. It's just annoying. It annoys me and it annoys everybody in the chat. He asked if you can open the vault after quitting at the end of the game. I literally quit at the end of every game, and we get the vault every single time. I be get there every time. It doesn't open every single time because that's not how the vault works, but... Yeah, I don't know what question he was asking, so not only was he yelling, but he was asking a hilariously stupid question. Kareem says you do a great job with reading messages. I do the best I can with so many people in here. I do the best I can. I can't read every single one though, but some guys don't get that. D23 said, yo doc, any tips to get a lot of subs? I stream a lot but I only have 11 subs. Uh, keep up the good work, man. I mean, make sure your family and friends support you because at first, you're not going to be found by that many people. Not many guys are going to know about you. They're not going to know your name or they're not going to know you in the community. So get involved with, commu with the community, whether it's on Twitter or Instagram or whatever. And at the end of the day, just keep on putting in work. Make sure your family and friends support you. Take the time to make thumbnails, improve your content, and... Just do little things like that. Keep on improving your content, getting better, and growing. The 2K community on Twitter is pretty strong, so I'd recommend getting a Twitter. Trying to join this community. D23 said, You can't read every message because you're trying to play a game and have a good stream. Some people don't get that. Facts. Yeah, man, you guys forget. Not only can I not read every chat, but I'm also trying to play a game. I think some of you guys forget that. I'm literally holding the controller right here. And if you guys don't believe me, there's me spam pausing the game and everything. I'm actually playing the game. This isn't like gameplay going on in the background that I'm narrating. Aiden Productions said, Doc, when do you think we're getting Opal Kareem? Hmm. See, you know how I said we're gonna be getting Opal Curry for March Madness? That was my prediction. I think Opal Kareem or Dark Matter Kareem could be a Marsh Madness player too. Probably Opal though. I don't know. We're going to have to see. But yeah, Kareem, one of the best college players ever. One of the best college careers ever. And yeah, same thing for Curry. I mean, Curry, I wouldn't say he had the best career ever, but he did have a very memorable run with Davidson. So that's why I'm predicting Opal Curry. John Foster said, have you pulled Dark Matter? No, I haven't. Aiden said, see you, Doc. When are you streaming again? Probably tomorrow. Yeah, most likely tomorrow. I'm thinking tomorrow's gonna be the next stream. Actually, I have no idea. I seriously don't know. It might be Friday. It might just be Friday. And then, of course, I'm posting the 1v1 on Saturday. So, video Saturday, maybe stream Friday. Maybe stream tomorrow, too. I really don't know. Brady said, how do you get that court? Um, get Next Gen 2K. Get Next Gen 2K with Zion on the cover, and you get this court with it. Jimster said, Marsh Madness, we could maybe get a Galaxy Opal Chris Webber. Probably a Pink Diamond. We already have Opal Chris Webber and a Diamond, so we'll probably get a Pink Diamond Chris Webber. Possibly. Maybe a Jalen Rose, too. We'll have to see. There's so many possible players. Maybe even a new Christian Leitner. We haven't gotten a Christian Leitner in so long. Ryan said, do you think Curry sliding and Triple Threat is worth it? Offline or online? Because you said TTO. I mean, Triple Threat online, everyone Curry slides. Triple Threat offline, is that really worth it? I really don't know if it is. I mean, the CPU is so bad at defense. All you have to do is snatch back every time and you're open. We take advantage of that and that's how we win so fast. 
and they're just bad on offense too. Harry said, hey Doc, just started my team. Who are the three best budget players to get for triple threat? Um, three best budget players. I think Jonathan Isaac's one of the best ones you can get. I think at the center, Mo Bamba's one of the best ones you can get. And at the point guard, there's a big selection of guys. Tony Roten, there's also guys like Jared Jack, Smush Parker, Isaac Bonga. At the shooting guard position, you got guys like Kobe, Kevin Porter Jr. I think Ruby KPJ is overall the best wing player you can get. Because Kobe doesn't have range at off bat, right? You have to give him range. But if you give him range, he's better than KPJ. But now I gotta go KPJ is the best wing. Him and Jonathan Isaac are great defensively and offensively. Mo Bamba's a good center. I can go on and on about budget players, man. There's so many good budget players you can run with. Workaholic said I was going to say Christian Leitner as well. His amethyst sucks. Facts. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of Christian Leitner's amethyst, so it's about time Leitner gets an upgrade. He's always a good shooting card, man. Leitner's always a good big man shooter, so I know a lot of guys are going to enjoy using Christian Leitner's pink diamond or whatever card he ends up getting. Diamond, pink diamond. I don't know what it's going to be. Theodore said, did you get him? Nah, not yet. YBZ said, I still use Amethyst Clay Thompson from season one. Hey, he is pretty good. Great release. I don't blame you for still using him. Taco Hoops said, I'm back. What's good, Taco Hoops? Welcome back to the stream. Young Reezy said, I'm grinding for John Wall. That grind for John Wall is not easy, man. Keep on working hard. Go get that John Wall. He's a beast. Owen said Opal Carmelo for March Madness. I would like that, but we just got a pink diamond last season. So I don't know if we're going to get an Opal after getting a pink diamond so soon, but we'll have to see. There's so many possibilities. Elevated said, my man, what's good? Elevated thoughts, welcome back. You said Grant Hill. We haven't gotten a Grant Hill in a long time. We have a pink diamond, so maybe Grant Hill will be the next Opal. There's so many possibilities, man. There's so many possibilities. We can name player after player after player that was good in college, but at the end of the day, I think it comes down to how memorable the player was. So I think guys like Jimmer Fredette, I think he's a lock. I think someone else like Christian Leitner's a lock. Guys who were just super memorable in college. For example, in March Madness sets, we've never gotten a Steph Curry before, but we are supposed to be getting an Opal Curry either this week or next, so maybe Steph Curry's a guy we get from those packs even though I wouldn't consider him one of college basketball's most historic players, you know what I mean? I mean, he still was great in college, but like, not up there with like the greatest of all time, not up there with Kareem winning all those national championships. I mean, you can argue that even guys like Tyler Hansborough were more memorable in college than Curry. And that's no knock against Curry, man, but if you guys know how much of a beast Psycho T was in North Carolina, you know what I'm talking about. Of course, Curry had a legendary run. No doubt about that. But Psycho T, he was the leading scorer in UNC history for a little while. He might still be. Owen said JJ Redick. Exactly, yeah, yeah. JJ Redick's very memorable. That's what that's, that's exactly what I'm saying. That's a hundred percent what I'm saying right there. Guys like Redick, they are the super memorable guys in, in college. Jimmer for debt, JJ Redick, Christian Leitner, guys like that. Kareem too, if you want to go that far. I mean Kareem won a championship every year, won six championships in the NBA. Dallas said Opal Kemba for Marsh Madness. That could be a cool one. That could be a cool one, man. Kemba would be a pretty cool player for Marsh Madness. Rohan said, what's good, Doc? How's the grind going? Very well. Very well. Stream's almost over, though, man. We have less than 10 games left, and you know how quick we always breeze through these games. So we're going to keep on grinding, get these games done. Hopefully get the new vault opal, but at this point, man, we're just going to be ending the stream after we hit a thousand wins, and we are getting very close to a thousand wins, so let's keep on grinding and let's keep on doing what we're doing. F9 Flame said, oh gosh, F9 Flame spammed six times. Now that is elementary right there, man. That's how you ask for your message not to be read. I was about to read it too, but then you spammed it seven times. 
So shout out to whoever timed you out. So, I'm sorry, F9 Flame. I was about to read that, but then he spammed it seven times. Caleb's YT said, I went driving for the first time today, and I was terrible. I mean, you gotta start somewhere. You gotta start somewhere. Even though you were terrible, you'll keep on improving. Driving, I mean, not everybody gets it at first, so don't be too demoralized about that. Legend said L, huge L. I was about to read it too, but then he spammed it 30 times. Mock Builds said, yo, what's good, Doc? What's up, Mock Builds? Welcome to the stream, my brother. How you been, Mock? Hope everything's good with you. Troy Drop Moff said, it's crazy how some people called Opal Brandon Roy trash because he doesn't have the curry slide. I mean, at this point in the game, 2K is giving everybody the curry slide, so... Some people are definitely disappointed that Brandon Roy doesn't have it. He's still very good, but yeah. It is kind of weird that he doesn't have it because everyone has it. Also, I just noticed. I just noticed. 400 likes on the stream. That's a huge dub. So thanks to everybody who's dropped a like. Thanks to all my new subs too. Hey, that's big time. 400 likes is big time. Yeah, man. It feels like we get 400 every single stream because of y'all. Mock Build says I'm currently moving right now, so you know stress. Facts, facts, man. Yeah. I moved into this house in December, so I know all about the moving process. It can be tough, but keep on grinding, Mock. I know that you're feeling stressed, but I hope that transition is as smooth as possible for you. YT said, right starting lineup. Hey, send it to me on Instagram or Twitter and I got you. Aiden said, Goat Stream Doc, I appreciate you, Aiden. It has been a really good stream. It's not over yet, though. We have to play eight more games. That's going to take us less than 30 minutes, so let's grind through these games. Eight more games. Guarantee y'all it's going to take less than 30 minutes. RJL said, Doc, I was the second like of the stream. Nice. That's what I'm talking about, man. You love to see that. Person says, can I send my lineup too? Yeah, you can. Tristan says, my birthday is in 17 days. My birthday is in 9 days. Kirsten said, hey doc, I'm back. What's good, Kirsten? Welcome back. Astro said, look at CP and Curry, man. So inspirational. Hadrian said, have you gotten Kermit? Not yet. We've played almost 100 games and still haven't gotten them, so we'll see if we can have some last minute luck. Todd Galloway said, how many games can you finish in one hour? Um, you, I'd say about 17 or 18 games per hour. Yeah, I'd say 17 or 18. So, with about an hour left in the stream, we had 17 games left. And now we only have 8 games left. Once this game's over, we're going to have 7 games left. Quick and easy math. What's good, Caleb? Welcome back to the stream. Aiden said, what is Kermit's wingspan? Like 7-3. DJ Freestyle said, my birthday was today. Hope you had a good birthday, DJ Freestyle. Oh, come on, Curry. Gotta make that shot. Todd Galloway said, how many games can you finish in one hour on average? Yeah, like I said, about 17 or 18. 17 or 18. At the pace we're going on right now, I'd say 18, but yeah, I'd say usually 17, sometimes 16 depending on how well I'm shooting, so yeah, I don't know. I'd say about 17 per hour. If we finish up like our 1,000 games before the 6-hour mark of the stream, then yeah, I'd say 17 an hour. Felipe said, how long you been streaming? About 5 hours and 30 minutes now. About 5.30 total. That was wide open, but CPU loves to miss open shots. So do I. Come on. Gabby K said, do you play other games besides 2K? Yes, I do. Okay, I've missed back-to-back -back threes, man. I gotta 
get back on my game. I told you guys, the faster we get these games done, or the faster, or the better I shoot, it gets the games done faster. So, I gotta shoot a little bit better. Vinit says, what is the Curry's three-point rating you're using? Uh, 99 for sure. Travis Scott said, do you play FIFA? Yes, I do. A little bit. Not as much as I used to. Le Felipe says that went in. Lucky. Are you talking about the CPU? Their shots are very lucky all the time. Even though they're usually open because they don't play defense. Beva said how many more hours or minutes? About 30. We're going to play for about 30 more minutes, but then we're going to be done. Nathaniel Met said, make your full lineup full of bronzes. Why would I do that? I mean, I know there are, com there are conspiracies to have better vault luck, but we open the vault all the time. The problem's not opening the vault, it's getting the player out the vault. It's so silly to me that people think that making a full bronze lineup actually helps. You either get the player or you don't. I don't think it really depends on your lineup. Ryan said, have you gotten any of the vault players this year? Yeah, pretty much all of them except for two or three. Tommy Gunn said, yo doc, I actually had the bronze lineup for Kermit, but it failed me for Ol. That's tough. Yeah, I'm telling you, man, the bronze lineup, we can try it, but like, I don't think it really makes a difference. F9 Flame says, I've uploaded Call of Duty and got decent views, but when I upload 2K, I don't get views. I mean, that means your subs probably like Call of Duty more. So, I mean, I don't know. I'd say focus on one game, but you also want to try and build an audience in both games. I've built an audience by playing 2K, but I know some of you guys are open to me playing more games in the future. I don't know what else I'm going to play, but... I don't know. I'm enjoying the 2K grind for sure. Tristan said, I wish I had the time that you did to play 2K. I mean, I don't really have time. I just make time. I go to the gym twice a day. I'm taking 12 hours this semester. I graduate in the summer. I mean... I do homework every day, I make all A's. I don't really have time, I just make time. You probably have the same time I do, but I just make so much time. For example, some guys who are in my situation who have class at 5 p.m., they would probably end the stream at 5 p.m. so they can go to their class, but for me, I just turn on the class in the background and mute myself, so that's one way to make time for yourself. I also don't get much sleep, so I'd say that's another thing. Maybe that's not a good idea to copy that, but I don't know. Ryan said, is single player fun or do you find it boring? Oh, it's very, very boring. It's really boring. I prefer multiplayer over single player. What's good, Brayden? Welcome to the stream. Gene says, I don't know if it's just me, but offline's low-key better. Yeah, because there's delay online, but you get used to it. You get used to it. Everyone has a little bit of delay online. Of course, doing little things like getting an ethernet cable makes it a little bit better, but yeah, shooting offline, much easier than online. What's good, Brayden Dunn? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, NB Aiden? NB Aiden said, hey doc, how are you doing? Sorry I'm late. Hey, no big deal, man, no big deal. Glad you can make it. You are a little bit late, but we still have a whole lot of time left in the stream. A good 30 minutes, I'd say. So let's keep on grinding. Let's close out this game strong. And after that shot, we have six games to go. YBZ said 2K is boring when you have nothing in the background playing. Yeah, facts. Facts. Really boring when you have nothing in the background. So make sure you have a stream or music or Netflix or something in the background because it just really sucks playing 2K in silence. 
Alan said I'm new to the channel. Can you show your lineup? I'll show my lineup after we hit a thousand wins. Once we get a thousand dubs, I'll show my lineup. For sure. Hang around though, be patient. And yeah, like I said, I'll show the lineup once we get these games done. But for now, I'm just trying to zoom through these games as fast as I can. Lucas said I killed this kid with Dark Matter Zion and all Opals. That's tough. So he had Dark Matter Zion and Opals and lost? That's tough. Yeah, some guys who buy all the cards, they aren't very good at the game, but if you have those cards and you know how to use them, yeah, you're gonna be a beast. Tristan said your streams are just vibes. Hey, the streams are always vibes, man. You guys make playing the game more fun for me. And hey, I'm glad that you guys always enjoy those chill vibes in the background. Good music in the background. I try to keep my commentary calm. All those little things, man, all contribute to making the stream better. Ryan said, are you no money spent? Yeah, no money spent. Nathaniel said, who's your favorite 2K YouTuber besides yourself? I'm not my favorite YouTuber. Not even close. Kelvin said, hey, I'm getting sleepy right now. Just lurking here. Hey, man, the stream's gonna be over soon. So, I mean, feel free to go to sleep if you're tired, man. I don't want to keep you up, especially if you're getting tired. But, yeah, keep on grinding, man. Feel free to hang around, but... Now, if you're getting tired, go get some sleep. Braden Dunn says, I have 50,000 XP. Can I get D-Rob? The season doesn't end for over two weeks, so yeah, you have time. I don't know how much you play the game or how good you are, but you definitely have time. Jose said, yo, I'm new. I'm on the same grind you're on. Nice. Have you had any luck yet? Because I haven't. I really haven't had any luck. We've won 94 games. This is going to be win number 95 once we get it through, once we get it done. So, hey, I hope you've had some luck. We've gotten a bunch of retro packs. We've gotten some badge packs. We've gotten a lot of MT. In the last two streams combined of Triple Threat Offline, we've made like how much MT? Like almost 100k. So, we've made a lot of MT, gotten a lot of tokens, but we haven't gotten the Vault Player either time. So, that's the tough part. Welcome to the stream though, Jose. And shout out to all the new viewers who've come through today. You've gained a lot of subs today, man, which you always love to see. Kelvin says, can't stop watching the GOAT. Hey, I'm not the GOAT, man. You guys know it and I know it. Definitely not the GOAT, but I do always enjoy these grinds. And like I said, you guys make them a whole lot of fun. Plushy World says, I got it on my 32nd game, so I'm lucky. That is very lucky. That is very lucky. Jose said, nah, I'm still grinding. I think Kermit's better than Spencer. That's good for you. Hey, man, keep on grinding. It's good that you're still grinding. I also agree. I think Kermit's a lot better than Spencer. I mean, Spencer Haywood is a much better name than Kermit Washington. Actually, nah, I take that back. Kermit's a much better name. I'd much rather be named... Kermit Washington, then Spencer Haywood. YBZ said, if you're new, join the Discord if you want to communicate with, with the community. Facts, yeah. If you guys are enjoying the stream and want to talk with me, talk with my community, the Discord link is at the very top of the chat. Amit says, imagine if at 1,000 you get Kermit. Now that would be legendary. I don't think it's gonna happen. I mean, the odds of that happening are insanely slim. Getting two opals at one time, I don't think it's gonna happen, but that would be legendary. We have five games left to get this opal. We're gonna have to see if we get lucky, though. MB Aiden said just hit level 31. Nice! That's what I'm talking about. Congratulations on 31. You're gonna be getting Mark Price pretty soon, so keep on grinding XP. You're doing an awesome job. What's good, Drakester? Welcome back to the stream. Plushy says, I wonder how many threes you've made with Curry. Um, so we're going to end this stream with 100 wins. And to win each game, you got to make seven threes since each game goes to 21. So seven threes per game for 100 games is 700 threes. Yeah, that's a lot of threes. But in one game earlier, I accidentally made a two. 
That was one game earlier, but I still made seven threes in that game too, so yeah, I've made seven threes every game so far. Now, of course, in this game, we've made three so far. And in every game before this, we've made seven. So doing the math, seven times 95, I'm pretty sure that's 965. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure seven times 95 is, yeah, like I said, 600, wait, yeah, 600, 665. I'm trying to do the math in my head. So yeah, that was just quick math. So I hope I'm correct. I'm probably not. 665. 7 times 95. Let me check that math. 7 times 95. Yeah, 665. So I got the math right. I just had to make sure. Plushy World said pro math. I appreciate you, Plushy. What's good, Grant Wilson? Welcome to the stream. Jose said, how many wins left? Once this game's over, we have to win four more games. Donna says, I subbed. Hey, I appreciate you, Donna Edits. Thank you for the sub. Welcome to Doc Nation. You came at a pretty good time, too. Once this game's over, we gotta win four more games. I'm out here leaving them open on purpose, and yeah. Let's knock down this three, and we're gonna end the stream right there. Actually, that's not true. I don't know why I said that. Four more games, then we're gonna end things. My gosh. I'm on the weeds. All right. The vault doesn't open. That's not good at all, but we're gonna have four more chances in the vault. Four more chances. Trayton said, hi, mate. What's good, Trayton? Welcome to the stream, my guy. But yeah, Drakester, you said big brain. I don't like math either, but I'm able to do the, the quick equations in my head. I'm able to do it quickly. I can't believe I got that right. I did all the mental math while playing the game, while talking to the chat. That's what I'm talking about. Vanit said 1,000 wins. Oh, did I say 100? To be fair, though, we began the stream with 900 wins. So we're going to end the stream like having won 100. So, yeah. You know what I mean, but yeah, I did kind of misspeak right there for sure. R2K said CP equals GOAT. Not true. Not true. But I appreciate the love. Ray said open packs and show lineups, please. I'll show the lineup later, but we're not going to open packs. Gotta save up our MT. Get something amazing one day. What's good? Lost Cracked. Welcome back. Jose said, am I the only one that thinks John Wall's not worth it? Um, other people probably think that too. John Wall's very good, but yeah, over 30 hours of gameplay to get him. Flex Gaming said, still grinding. Wow. Hey, I told you guys this was going to be a six hour stream. And you guys know whenever I say it's going to be a long stream, I never lie. So yeah, once this game's over, we have three games to go. I'm leaving them open on purpose. I know they're going to miss. Let's get that ball back to Curry, and let's keep on knocking down those threes. YBZ said, I got to catch up on XP challenges. Hmm. Hey. The reason I'm saying that, hmm is because I might do the same thing tomorrow. I also need to catch up. I really need to catch up, man. Tomorrow, I could hit 35 and 36 if I lock in, so... Might have to do that tomorrow. Kirsten says, I just got Wes Unselled. Thank God, now only John Wall. Yes, sir. So you got Wes Unselled and Brandon Roy. That's what I'm talking about. Go get that John Wall. You got this. D23 said, 15 more minutes. Until six hours, let's go, Doc. You the GOAT. I'm not the GOAT, but I appreciate the love. Max Dodd said, how's your day? Very good day for me, Max. How have you been? Hope everything's, hope everything's been good for you, my guy. We have 107 people in the stream. Thank you guys for over 400 likes. We've also gained a whole lot of subs today, so shout out to all the new subs in the building. And all the OGs. Appreciate all you guys. Let's get two more threes in the bucket. And then we're going to have our final three games coming up. Also, what's good, Le Austin? Welcome back to the stream. I saw your message, but forgot to read it earlier. Le Austin is back in the building. Max Dodd said, I'm good. Thank you, sir, Doc. Hey, no problem. No problem at all. <laughs> 
I know I made that sound pretty formal, but nah, glad you're doing all right. Oh, come on. Should have greened that. Either way, three games to go. Whenever you can count the games left on one hand, you know you've made a lot of progress, for real. La Austin said, I didn't get too much La work done today, but tomorrow I will continue to try to keep La working. So you're saying you're not going to keep working tomorrow, but you're going to continue trying to La work tomorrow. Hey man, you're not subtle. I see what you're saying, but nah, keep on grinding, Austin. But it's good to have you back in the stream for our final three games. Flex Gaming said next gen looks mad smooth. It is mad smooth, man. Especially if you have the stream quality at 1080p. It is mad smooth. Now, there are some problems with it, man. It's not a perfect game, and the park kind of sucks. A lot of guys are quitting next gen park to go back to 2K21 current gen or 2K20, so the park gameplay could be better, but my team itself, I love it. What's good, Charlie Keller? Welcome to the stream. Jose said Curry's a beast for you. Yes, he is. I missed the shot last time, but we're not going to miss many more of the rest of this game or the mess of the rest of this stream. Ryan said I love your streams. I appreciate it, Ryan. Pennett said how many wins do you have? We have 997. Once this game's over, 998. Yeah, quick math. MB Aiden says I started today. I'm level 26, now level 31. It's crazy how easy XP is this season. Facts. XP grinding is very easy this season because you get XP for doing anything, man. Playing triple threat offline, playing triple threat online, playing unlimited, playing spotlights. I mean, there's just so many ways to get XP. Not to mention the free XP challenges, the free cards like Donovan Mitchell, Ray Allen, all those guys getting XP is just so easy and then for the free cards like Ray Allen for example the hero cards there's XP for those guys too. Lev Felipe said you're gonna get it this win I'm calling it yeah that would be amazing but I doubt it we have three games left to win we have three vaults left to try and open I doubt that we're gonna get them at this point we haven't gotten them the first 97 games so realistically I doubt we're gonna get them in the final three but you never know Charlie Keller said, what Curry card is that? This is the Pink Diamond Season 1 Level 40 Steph Curry card. So yeah, not the new one, but just as good, for sure. Okay, Curry, come on. Back-to-back -back back -back games. I didn't green the final shot, but I still went in. We'll take those. What's good, my boy Nick? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Joshua? La Legend said, park his booty on next gen. Facts. I mean... It's just the same thing over and over again in Park, man. The gameplay is so scuffed. It's not fun for the content creators, so they're going back to current gen because of that. Guys like Badge Plug are playing more on current gen. Guys like, what's his name? Can't remember his name, but yeah. There's more than just two guys going back to current gen, trust me, but there's still a lot of creators on next gen. I don't want to make it seem like all the creators went back to current gen, but yeah, Joe knows, Badge Plug, I know Agent did, I know Jack Bill did. Then again, none of those guys are like serious competitive park players. Nick said, how's the triple th threat grind? Any luck? Nah, not today. Not today. We have two more games left to win, and then this stream's gonna be in the books. We've gotten a bunch of retro two packs, so I guess we'll see if we can get Michael Jordan, but yeah. No luck getting the Opals, but I guess we are about to get Peja, so I guess that's a slight dub. Kirsten said, Joe knows Duke Dennis have been playing 2K20. That's right, Duke Dennis has been on 2K20. Nick said, unfortunate. Yeah, but at the end of the day, we're eventually going to get the card. I don't know when, but it's going to happen. We've been doing our part, man. I say this all the time. We've been doing our part, winning all the games, and... 2K is just not rewarding us. We have been winning at a very fast pace though. We're about to win our, what, 17th game in the last hour, or 16th game in the last hour, and we still have a little bit of time to spare. 
Nick said, do you think the reward's gonna make your lineup? Yeah, man, you know I love good defensive cards, good athletes, and of course, he doesn't have range extender, but definitely gonna give him range. Bacto said, how long did it take you to get a thousand wins? Not long, I mean, getting a hundred wins takes six hours, so just do all the math and that's about how long it took in gameplay to get a thousand wins. If you played nothing but triple threat for a week straight, you would have those wins done in no time. Le Felipe said, you began at 4.30, right? Yes, and it's 10.20 right now. We've won 99 games, or this is gonna be win number 99. Yesterday we won 104 in six hours though. Today we're gonna win 106 hours, which is still a pretty good pace, but yeah. I've had some bad shooting games, but. Let's end the stream on a high note, let's green our threes, and let's hope that we can get this man Kermit out the vault today. If not, we'll get him at some point, but I have no idea when. Ty Hancock said, Doc, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing, Ty? You've made it to the last game of the stream. Not this game. The next game is the final game of the stream, so let's go back to the main menu. Let's load into one final triple threat offline game, and... Let's just hope that he's in the final vault we open, because y'all know he's not going to be in this one. Tristan said, it's 11.20 for me. I'm in Miami, got you. So you're Eastern time. I'm Central. I'm Central. Pan says, can you show your team and stuff after a thousand wins? I'm not going to show it for long, but yes, I will make sure to show it. What's good, Shant? Welcome back. Max Dodd said, damn, I gotta leave. See you, man. Keep on greening. Hey, I appreciate you, Max. Just seven more threes, and this stream's in the books. We're playing versus Steph Curry, so hopefully we can light him up. Casey said, for me, it's 920. Nice. 920? That's what I'm talking about. I know Pacific time, it's 820 right now, so shout out to anybody watching on the West Coast. I know we got guys all over the world watching this channel. YBZ said, y'all are thirsty to see this man's team. Yeah, facts. You guys have been talking about nothing but, can we see your team? Can we see your team? But yeah, the team's not that great. It's a good team. We have a lot of opals, some pink diamonds, but at the end of the day, I have so much MT to make upgrades, so might have to make some upgrades soon. So if you guys aren't blown away by the team, I'm sorry. Sean Lewis said, hey doc, been a while, how you been? I'm good, Sean, how are you doing, is my question. Hope everything's good for you, my boy. Travis Scott said, it's 421 in the UK. Vanit said, I'm watching from Canada. Hey man, shout out to you guys watching the stream, wherever you're watching it from, man. I appreciate y'all tuning in. Four more threes and we're done. Four more threes and that's gonna be a thousand wins in triple threat. 100 and 0 today, 104 and 0 yesterday. All right, four games to go, four threes to go, excuse me. I can't even talk anymore. Near Many says, it is 6.22 a.m. in Israel, that's crazy. Nick said, you should do a shopping spree stream and or video, it would go crazy. It will be fun, it will be fun. I never really go shopping though in public, man. It's been so long since I've done that, but that would be fire. I know you guys have asked me for a jersey collection video before. That would be fire too. And I'm also making a tier list video ranking the new NBA earned jerseys. The earned edition jerseys, so that video is going to be dropping pretty soon too. I don't know when though. We're going to have to see. Oh, come on. I got to green that. Dallas said, I'm watching from the middle of nowhere. Hey man, I live in Alabama. That's practically the middle of nowhere too. Even though I live in the capital city. Hadrian said, watching from Cali. D23 said, 1123 on the East Coast. Yes, sir. Flex Gaming said, do you think Galaxy Opals are going to be common next year? Or next season? Yes, I do. I think they're going to become very common. Kind of like how these threes right here have become very common. Now that's a good way to end the stream right there. That's a good final shot of the stream. Let's go back to the main menu. Let's cross our fingers. And let's see if we can actually get the vault open because I think it would be so anticlimactic if 
on game number a thousand we don't even open the vault but i'm spamming the a button the vault opens up there's no way we get the opal it's too good to be true because we're about to get Peja. there's no way the opal's in this vault that would be way too good to be true they almost got me either way there's Peja right there i guess we'll open up Peja's pack and hey you guys don't get too upset because we're definitely gonna get Kermit at some point, but I guess we'll go ahead and open up Paige's pack. I guess that getting the pack for Michael Jordan or the Retro 2 pack, I guess is better than nothing. So we didn't get Kermit today, but we did get Paige. We got the packs, so I guess we'll open the packs. I guess we'll open the packs, and that's gonna do it for the stream. There's Paige. I got Paige on my boy Casey's account. He's in the stream right now, spamming dubs. There's Peja right there. Let's see if we can get some fire from these retro packs too. As you guys can see, so many badge packs. We also got like four or five retros too, so let's see if we can get something good in the retro packs. Are we going to? I doubt it. We didn't get anything great yesterday from the pack opening at the end of the stream, but we did get pink diamonds a bonus. I know my boy Nick in the chat loves a bonus, so... Yeah, that was a good pull for us. We sold them back. I would love to get a shake out of these packs, but probably not going to happen. So let's open up these packs. Then we're going to raid somebody. And then we're going to end things. We have three more retro packs to open. Two more after this one. No shakes yet, man. Bronze, Kenyon, Martin. Thank you guys for all the dubs in the chat, but man, we didn't get the new Opal. I wouldn't say this stream was an L though. This stream was definitely not an L, but man, I wish we could have gotten that new Opal. And man, we haven't gotten anything good out of these packs. We have one more retro pack. We haven't gotten anything good. I guess we did get some more MT from the packs from selling the players, but still nothing special. Like literally our best pull was a gold player. That's crazy. So I guess we'll quick sell him. Y'all know I don't care about that. And you know what? Just for kicks. Just because we did the same thing yesterday. Let's open some packs. Let's open two packs. One deluxe, one non-deluxe. So let's go to deluxe first. We had a really good pull yesterday. We'll see if we can do the same thing today. Nah, that's not cool. Nick said last chance you basket. Oh, that's right. Hey man, I loved last chance you football. Last Chance U for football was awesome, so I'm definitely going to check out Last Chance U for basketball. I'm definitely going to check that out. Alright, one more pack. No shake in any pack. Guys, we're not going to go below 900,000 MT. So as much as I hate to say it, that's going to do it for today's stream. I would open up all these badges, but like... Nah, that's going to take way too long. That would be very boring. We're going to end the stream right there, so... Thank you guys for watching. We didn't get this man, Kermit Washington, but we're going to get him eventually. We did get Peja though. So I told you guys, we were going to get one opal. And what do you know? We did get one opal. So in five, four, three, two, one, we just hit the six hour mark. We've been going for six hours. So thanks to everybody who's hung around for all the six hours. Let's go to YouTube and let's see who li who's live. So we'll raid somebody and then that's going to do it for today. All right. We're going to transition to my YouTube in three, two, one, and one second. Where's it at? How do I do this? I don't know why it's not coming up. There we go. Okay. Okay. No Limit Zoe's live. Y'all know that's the bro right there. No Limit Zoe's live, but just in case, we'll see who else is live. Oh my gosh, we got a lot of guys live. No Limit Zoe, Cry Spooky, Medi GC, Endgame, Oko, and Sherrod. We gotta raid Zoe though. We gotta raid Zoe. So many of you guys in the stream, y'all are fans of Zoe, so we gotta raid him. Let me drop a like on his stream. As you guys can see, I had that notification bell turned on. I'm also a moderator and a member, so big shout out to Zoe. We're gonna raid him. I know a bunch of you guys love his channel, including myself, so... Yeah, we're going to raid him. You guys join his stream, show him some love, and yeah, here we go, spamming the link. You guys join the link, show some love to Zoe, and yeah, after we raid him, 
we're gonna end that stream right there so let's join in on Zoe's stream let's see how he's doing and yeah let's go ahead and skip the ad there we go we have Dallas random we have RJL Makai Wiley Brothers CP the goat fan Tristan Casey Shant Gene oh my gosh look at the chat purple look at this look at this raid man you love to see that my boy Zoe's just chilling he's playing that triple not triple threat spotlight sim there he is right there if you want to see his face hey look at that smile man that's just golden right there I love it I love it yeah look how many of you guys came through for the raid you love to see it my boy Zoe great content creator 2.58 thousand subs you guys see it right there hey after the raid 2.59 almost 2.6 that's what I'm talking about. Chat going crazy. That's pretty good right there. So, yeah, shout out to Zoe. Flex Gaming said CP's the GOAT. Nah, Zoe is the GOAT. So let me say something in his chat real quick, and then we're going to end the stream. Zoe had to come through. I'll be back. After I hit the gym, keep grinding, bro. You know. Hmm, what do I say after this? I, I had a thought, but I forgot it. Keep grinding, bro. Let me spam his membership emojis. Where are they at? There they are. Yeah, perfect. It's gonna lag for a second, but there we go. Great way to end the stream with a raid. And since you guys are begging for my team's lineup, I guess I'll show it to you real quick. Thank you guys for watching. It was a good stream. And yeah, we have 900,000 MT and no Kermit. You guys stay chill, stay safe, and I'll see y'all again. I would say tomorrow, but I really don't know. Um, I kind of want to grind XP tomorrow. I haven't thought that far ahead. I don't know, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream today, and I'll see y'all again tomorrow.